Hey, how's it going, chat? What's up, everybody? How you guys doing? Um, type nut if we're live. I think we should be good. Hopefully everything sounds and looks good. Anyways, today we're going to be ranking every single Pokemon based on all these categories, all the typings, all the generations. Any category you can think of, we're gonna be ranking the Pokemon based on that. And then we're gonna to come to a conclusion as to what the community's favorite Pokemon is. Because you know what? You know what? I've had enough. I've had enough. I've said it. I've had enough of this all being about me, okay? It's about damn time that we get some fucking representation with you guys, all right? So this is not my list. I'm just gonna say that right off the bat. Not my list. It is you guys' list, and you guys are going to be able to overrule any decision that I make uh, with a vote in chat. So that's what we're going to be doing. What's up, Charbunny? How you doing? What's up, Quincy? How you doing? Lolan Gamer, how you doing? Once again, let me know if everything sounds good and looks good. We should be good. Um, let's start with the normal type. So pretty much the way... It <laughs> Wrong way. Pretty much the way it works is we have all the generations and all the typings that we can pick our favorite from that Venn diagram, right? So, okay. Favorite Gen 1 normal type, right? We got all these options here. A lot of people are saying Snorlax. A lot of people are saying Bidoof, Ditto. Honestly, okay, here's what. Here's how it's going to work, okay? I'm going to make my choice. I know I just said it's not about me, but I'm going to make my choice, and then you guys are going to be able to say agree or disagree, right? So me personally, I'm looking at this. I'm thinking, damn. I'm thinking, damn. We got some honestly kind of shitty picks here. <laughs> honestly, it's kind of embarrassing. I'm looking at this. I, I'm, I'm getting like secondhand embarrassment by how disgusting. I mean, I feel like, okay, top choices immediately. We're thinking Snorlax, we're thinking Eevee, we're thinking Ditto, right? I mean, that just makes a lot of sense to me. I feel like, if this was my list, I feel like we're going Eevee. Ah, no, but Snorlax is cool. Fuck, man. This is going to be hard, okay? It's going to be tough. I think we, I no, you know what? You know what? I'm locking it in. We're saying Eevee. Now, are we saying Eevee, though? That's the thing. Let me go ahead. I'm going to boot up the poll and you guys will be able to decide. I personally, I could see a valid argument for Eevee. I mean, listen, the versatility is there. I mean, it could evolve into like eight different Pokemon. How fucking cool is that? Um, I mean, Snorlax is also cool, right? Like, I'm not going to sit here and pretend that really already a no. <laughs> already a no. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's not, let's not get off on the wrong foot here, right? Let's have a little bit of a dialect. Lax is better, Por okay, Porygon kind of fucks. No, I see you, but I think Porygon Z just stops all of Porygon's potential. Like, we're not looking at the evolutions, we're just looking at, oh, I guess if we're not looking at the evolutions, I guess Eevee, I guess Eevee kind of goes down a peg, doesn't he? Shit, man, no, 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 I'm still sticking with it, I'm still double down, I'm still doubling down. Snorlax might be better, but, Nope, nope, okay, you guys agree. You guys agree, that's it, that's it, we're calling it. That's, it is what it is, that is, that's, we're locking it in, it's fine. This is a democracy, and you know what? The democracy decided. I think we had, that was a successful dem democratic situation, I think. Can we agree on that? All right, hey, let's move on, all right, fire type. Now, I'm sorry, it's obvious. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's not even a, it's not even a debate. I don't care if you're gonna sit here and be like, you Gen 1 -er, idiot. I don't care if you're gonna say that because it doesn't, it doesn't fucking phase me. It's just the truth, I'm sorry. Listen, Gen 1 has a lot of good fire types, right? I mean, we were looking at, it's a heavy, it's a heavy bracket. We have a lot of options, lots of stacked options here, but you cannot tell me with a straight face that any of these are better than Charizard, I'm sorry. I mean, and maybe that's nostalgia talking. Maybe that's the, you know, eight-year-old kid who leveled up to 36 in Fire Red before Mount Moon and then fucking gave up on the game because I couldn't get through it. Like, maybe maybe that is what that is, right? Maybe it is nostalgia talking, but you know what? Nostalgia, nostalgia's valid. I'll say it, nostalgia's valid. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna put the poll up. Do you guys agree? I, I'm, sorry, I almost threw up my mouth. I don't think anyone would disagree with that. Well, okay, sorry, 50, 60% of people are gonna be disagreeing with that. Why? Come on, guys. Okay, if not Charizard, who else? You're telling me that that many of y'all pick Bulbasaur. That many of y'all pick Squirtle. Fuck off, man. Sorry, I don't mean to be vulgar right now, but fuck off, dude. What about dupes? Um, we won't do dupes. We won't do dupes. You guys cool with that? Arcanine? Listen, I fuck with Arcanine, all right? I'm a big Arcanine enjoyer, right? I'm not gonna sit here and say I'm not. But to put it above Charizard, you can't deny everything he's doing for this league. You can't deny the impact he's had. I'm sorry. 
This is, uh, we gotta, we gotta reconsider this. I mean, come on, guys. Okay. All right, all right, fine, 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 fine. We'll do Arcanine. We'll do Arcanine. You guys cool with Arcanine? Is that better? Is that really better? I mean, as I said, I, I can't get too mad, right? Because as I said, I gotta remind myself, this is not my list. This is not my list. It's not my list. It's our list. Do we feel that Arcanine better represents us as a community? Yes. Now do Zard for flying. Oh, I guess that's true. We could put... We could put him in flying. <laughs> that we could, we could do that. No, no, wow. Okay, I mean, I'll run the poll one more time. I mean, I'll do it for you guys, but I mean, at some point we gotta make a decision, right? At some point we gotta lay down the fucking law. All right, do you agree with Arcanine? Go ahead, let me know, let me know. Hit, hit him, hit him with it, hit him with the vote. You guys know how a democracy works? Pretty much it's like a thing where like you guys get together and you can like vote on the, you know, elected officials and that, well, that's more like a republic, but you get what I'm saying. And then they like vote and then there's like the electoral college and then like the Senate for some reason is just, they get like two. Like what the fuck's going on with the two thing. With, and then like the house, I think it was like, isn't there like 400 house members? I don't want to talk about it. Anyways, 65%. Yes. All right. We're locking that in. I vibe more with the Zard. Me too, man. Me too. But I mean, I said it once. I'll say it again. This is not my list. It's not your list. It's not anybody's list in particular. Hi, Dylan Hayes. Look how Buffy's looking, chat. Dylan, stop. Dylan, stop. You're so freaking. God, I'm so embarrassed. Oh my God, Dylan Hayes. Um, these are our water type options. Now you guys know my choice. I'm sorry, I, I'm locking him in. And if you disagree with this, bro, he's on my arm. Wrong arm. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> hey, have a good one, guys. <laughs> no, that was bad. That was, that was bad, bro. I've had this tattoo for like two years, three years. This arm, yeah, he's chilling right there. Um, all right, guys, yeah, let's go ahead. Let's, let's, can we just, can you guys just give me this, right? I, I know it's not my list, but like, it's literally my favorite Pokemon. Like it's, if I'm gonna ask you guys for any favor, it's this, it's this. This is the only favor I'm asking for. It's just, it's just this. Um, and I, you know, I, I, I understand it's a community effort. I understand like, it, it's not just me. Do Lapras for ice. <sighs> Okay, all right, all right, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. What are the ice options? <laughs> okay, no, yeah, okay, good idea, good idea. No, yeah, you guys are valid for that one, honestly. <laughs> like, yeah, no, yeah, it does not make sense to put him in the water category when the category is just so, I mean, there's just so many star players. Okay, all right, let's talk about it, let's talk about it. Excluding Lapras, who would it be? I guess Gyarados, right? Either Gyarados or Blastoise. Vaporeon? No, I don't. I, that just seems sexually charged. Gyarados, Vaporeon? No, I refuse to do Vaporeon. Kabutops? Okay, that's a raw pick. Honestly, you're 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 real for that one. You're real for the fucking Kabutops. I'll give you that. That's I don't know if that's gonna get on the on the on the page here, but that that's valid for sure. I I feel like listen, I'll lock Gyarados in, and then we'll do the poll. I feel like got a lot of dude Kingler. Kingler? That's pretty raw. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like any of these choices are pretty like, you either have a, a very expected normie take where you're like, yeah, Gyarados, of course, right? Um, or you have like a base take. Like if you put fucking Golduck on there, that's raw. And, and I just respect it from the angle of like, it's just ballsy, you know? Anyways, all right, let's see how we're feeling about Gyarados. It looks like Gyarados might be the winner here. I feel like that makes sense, personally. Um, I mean, Gyarados, I mean, he's just like legend, man. I mean, he's been around since ancient times. The red Gyarados, right? I mean, like, you just can't deny his legacy. You also can't deny his demeanor and you can't deny his willingness to learn. Um, so we are gonna go ahead, barely nudging it out at 52%. We're gonna be locking Gyarados into the water slot. Sounds like a plan. Also, before we get too far into this, um, oh my God, I forgot. I think, I think his name was, fuck. His name was Elman, E-L-M-A-N. I'm pretty sure I could be so wrong. Um, but like last week, I just want to quickly say this last week, um, he became like our highest member tier. I wasn't live or anything. He just kind of did it. So, and by the, you know, if he's seeing this by chance, I know this is so random, but if he's seeing this by chance, thank you. Um, it literally just like, it came out of nowhere. I was not live. It was just like an empty chat and he just became the best, like the hundred dollar member tier. I was like, what the fuck? Crazy. Anyways. All right. Grass type, grass type. What are we thinking? Can we get some immediate thoughts here? I'm thinking Venusaur. I think a Venusaur, right? Um, Vileplume, Vileplume is actually kind of a sick take. I, I would probably say Venusaur, Venusaur or Victory Bell are my picks. I like Vileplume. I mean, there's a lot of there's a lot of good players in this league. 
right? We got a lot of all stars here. They, they're definitely making you know finals, but um, I think if we had to single out the Michael Jordans of this group, I think we're saying Victory Bell. I think we're saying Venusaur. We got a lot of Victory Bells. All right, let's lock in Victory Bell, um, and we'll see how you guys are feeling about that. We'll go ahead and get the poll up. I. I don't know. I, it really could go either way. I, I feel like Victory Bell is like the more, it's the more based pick, right? I mean, let's not deny it. Um, Venusaur, I mean, Venusaur just has like, cause like nobody, like I feel like Venusaur is so underloved, but it's weird because I feel like it's looped back around to him being now like reasonably loved. You know what I mean? Hey, gentle dude with the five. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. He said, you the best. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. All the way, Victory Bell. Wow. No, 70% no. Holy shit. Wow, we got some Venusaur fans in the chat. Holy fuck. I, I thought that was a done deal. I really thought this was going to be free. I really thought we'd throw Victory Bell in there and it would just be a, be a wrap. Is this going to... Y'all, okay, do you know what I'm realizing by doing this? This is just going to turn into the most... Like, who, who's the most popular? Is kind, of, is kind of what this is going to become. But I guess that makes sense, right? I'll put the poll up again. I guess that makes sense, right? Because, I mean, at the end of the day, we're trying to find a conglomerate. We're trying to find what is our community decision, right? And I guess in order to do that, we have to look at the popular vote. So um, we got Venusaur on the poll right now. Let's see if he stacks up. He's looking like a no right now, which is kind of shocking. What the fuck? Who do you guys want? You really want Vile Plume? Oh no, he's, he's itching into yes. Wait, it's close. <laughs> Wait, it's close. You really want Vile Plume? Bu oh, you want Bulbasaur? Guys, come on. Really? You're putting Bulba over Vina? Stop. Ivysaur. No, Ivysaur is actually a base. I like Ivysaur. Ivysaur is a base take. Fuck, this is hard, man. Who would have thought trying to get, you know, hundreds of people to get on the same page would be hard? Wow, okay, yeah, I, I should have saw this coming. It looks like we're gonna be locking in Venusaur, though. I like Executor. I, I like Executor as well. Listen, but here's the thing, right? We're not we're not looking for Pokemon we like. All right, we're not looking for your run of the well B tier, C tier Pokemon. No, we're looking for what is the GOAT, right? Like what is the best of his class? Anyways, we got the electric types next. I feel like, I mean, I feel like you just, I don't know, Pikachu, right? Like. <laughs> we might as well have just looked up top 100 most popular Pokemon and just started plugging them in. Honestly, like that, that, that literally might have been what we should have done. Okay, Electabuzz, Jolteon. Jolteon, a lot of Jolteons. I like Jolteon, but I don't love Jolteon, right? Like I'm not like dying for Jolteon. I feel like Pikachu is, but okay, let's not, let's not be fucking basic, right? Let's try to have more nuanced takes here. Um, Anthony with a five. Thank you, Anthony. Electrode, all caps. Nah, Electrode fucks. I've grown to like Electrode. Like, in the beginning, I was like, yeah, like, Electrode, like, whatever. But, like, he's definitely grown on me. Zapdos is also cool. But I, I'm in the same boat with Jolteon where, like, I don't love them. You know what I mean? Um, okay, I'll lock Jolteon in, and then we'll see what the, we'll see what the poll's saying. We'll see where we go from there. Um, uh, I don't know. I, I think, I think that's a valid pick. Like, Jolteon, it's good. Like, it's, I don't know. Listen. I'd put it, like, if we're talking, like, if we are actually, like, ranking these, I'd probably say it's, like, a B tier. Horses with the seven. Thank you, horses. He said, you're one of the best people. That was a really, really strong start. Out of all the people, entertaining as fuck. Thanks. Ah, dude, horses, appreciate you, man. Thank you for sticking around. He's been on the channel for a while. Appreciate it, man. We got a 52% no. Okay, wait, so who do you guys want? Are we throwing Pikachu? Magnemite. <laughs> Okay, I'll put Magnemite up there. I'll put him up there. I'll put him up there just for you. But if he gets like a hundred percent no, that's gonna be embarrassing. I'm just gonna say it. it's gonna be kind of embarrassing. All right, all right. Let's throw Mag. Let's throw Mag not Magneton. Let's throw specifically Magnemite. I would be if he somehow wins it. I'd be shocked. Like that is just like the most out of left field. Like he's all he's cool. He's like all right. I, I, I feel like, no, actually, you know what? I do fuck with Magnemite. I don't fuck with Magnetone as much. I'll say it. And Magnezone's cool. Wow, it is positive right now. You, we got some big Magnemite fans. Anthony with a 10. Thank you, Anthony. As long as Gen 5 Dark is scrafty, I'm happy. Now, honestly, ooh, I don't know. You got, you got High Dragon in that league. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, wow, 53%. Yes, we're really doing this right now. Okay. 
All right, no, I'm down. That's that's chill. That's chill with me. That's chill with me. I'm cool with that. That's absolutely you. You guys, I like that. That makes us different. You know, any any other Pokemon channel, we'd be putting Pikachu up there. No, 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 no. Fuck Pikachu. I'll say it. I'll say it. He's, he, what has he done for the league? Right? What is he doing? He, he's not making free throws. Yeah, he's, he's fucking, he's two feet off the ground. He can't even dunk. He's not going to the league. Magnemite, he's floating and shit. We're chilling. All right. Fighting types. Fighting types. Fighting types. Saucer Turtle, please don't spam. Not in a million years of the five, thank you. Thwacky is my all time, wait, I'm sorry. It got drowned out by the chat, but wait, you're saying Thwacky is my all time favorite and I will not yield. Brother, come on, you gotta yield. You gotta just fucking give up on it. Thwacky, I hate, I swear to God, if the Gen 8 starters even touch this tier list, I'm gonna be so mad. They're all so ass, I'm sorry. I, I'm passionate about them. Anyways, we got a lot of Machamp love in the chat. Hitmonchan, Primate, Mankey, Machamp, Machamp. I'm seeing a lot of Machamps. All right, let's lock in Machamp. Let's lock in Machamp. We'll see how we're feeling about it. I feel like Machamp is solid. Like, it's definitely grown on me over the years. I wasn't, like, the biggest Machamp fan. But, uh, yeah, you know, I mean, he's really come out of the woodwork and, you know, you know, really started to make a name for himself. So, I fuck with that. Um, Hitmon, I actually feel like Hitmonchan is also, also kind of a sleeper pick. Um, I really, like, Hitmonchan really grew on me. So I, I wouldn't be mad if we did Hitmonchan either. I feel like those are like my top two. Uh, Hitmonchan or uh, Machamp. Wow. Okay. No, we're sitting at 56. 50. Yeah. Okay. We'll lock in Machamp. That actually was not hard at all. I feel like, listen, wh when it's only like a select couple options, it makes it a lot easier. It gets hard when you get down to the water types and it's like Gen 7 and you have like just 50 of them. And you're like, God damn it. Like three of my favorite Pokemon are on this list. Jonathan with a two. Thank you, Jonathan. It's his first super chat. Dude, thank you so much. I just wanted Poyon and Gliscor to make it. No, no, no. Well, I'll make sure they make it. Don't trust me. Gliscor for sure. And Empo they're both fucking making it. Absolutely. All right, locking in with champ. Let's go poison. Ooh. Okay, so we're not doing dupes. So we're not putting Venusaur. Um, I, I mean, okay, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. If we're going to go Gengar, let's do Gengar for Ghost. We can't do Gengar. Let's save it for Ghost. Ghost has like, there's literally only Gengar. <laughs> so let's just put Gengar and Ghost. Nobody, we're not doing Gengar here. We gotta do someone else. I think, I mean, could put Victory Bell in there. Coughing, Nido King, Nido King Fox. Honestly, no, okay. The, the most based take here and the one that I would probably go with, uh, let me analyze the options. Yeah, I'm going Venomoth. Call me crazy, I'm going Venomoth. Hey, thank you for the membership. Uh, appreciate it, Scott. Can we just get like, can we get some Venomoth love? Dude, I fuck so heavy with Venomoth. His shiny is so fucking cool, man. I, I know that sounds absurd, right? We got a huge lineup here. We got a lot of options, but I, we're putting, I'm gonna put Venomoth. I'm gonna put Venomoth. I'm gonna put Venomoth. Listen, we'll do the vote, of course, but like, I really, like Venomoth is just so cool, man. He is just like, I, and I don't know if it's just like age, Right? I mean, like, I think when I was younger, I didn't really care for him. But, like, as I gotten older, as I was, you know, growing up and learning and becoming more wise, I really grew to appreciate him. Like, he's just so sick, man. Hey, SM Clash of the Two. Appreciate it. Jet 5 Steel Dark Bisharp. Yeah, Bisharp Fox. And thank you for the first time Super Chat as well. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, <laughs> I still can't believe the Thwacky comment. I still, that is insane. And 73% no. Guys, have you seen the shiny? Have you seen, you guys must, like, unless my entire chat is colorblind, which, I mean, I guess if that's the case, fair enough, but, like, okay, no, I do like Muck, yeah. Okay, Arbok, absolutely not. I'm sorry, Arbok, I'm not even gonna test it. Arbok is not making it. Dude, hunting with the membership, hey, hopefully you enjoy memberly videos, uh, perks, <laughs> appreciate that. Tyler with the 49 months, and who, who dropped the 50? Bro, Ian, thank you so much. Tyler with the 49 months, what's a Venomoth? Brother, just, oh my God, you got some studying up to do. Just look it up. Anyways, Ian, thank you so much. That's so kind. Of, thank you all so much. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Um, God, Tentacool also fucks. Okay, okay, okay. So we're saying no to Venomoth, which I don't agree with, but like whatever, right? Whatever, as I said, not my list. Okay, so who are we going with? Uh, it seems like a lot of people were saying, well, Nido King might, might be able to go for ground. A lot of people were saying Muck. Okay, let's try Muck. Let's try Muck. How are you feeling about Muck, right? I know we saw a lot of Mucks in the chat. A lot of Mucks. I will say Muck has also grown on me, not to the extent that Venomoth has. Like, Venomoth will always just... 
I don't know, man. He's just like my boy. I think the shiny kind of hard carries it, to be honest, but I don't know. All right, listen, I, I'm not here to analyze. I'm not here to psychoanalyze. I'm just here to pick my favorite Pokemon. Hey, Hunting with the two. Thank you, Hunting, for the first time Super Chat as well. Dude, appreciate it. And the membership. Too late to be the Magnemite OG? I honestly, no, you're with us, dude. You're with anybody who voted Magnemite. I, I think the fact that he's even on the board, right? It just really shows what we're about. Shows our, our energy. Really communicates to people. Like, this is like our flag. <laughs> this will be our community flag. Yo, deadass, I'll make it my YouTube banner. Straight up. Straight up. Well, assuming, I mean, if a Gen 8 Pokemon, Gen 8 starter Pokemon, if Thwacky gets on the list, no fucking shot. But if, as long as that doesn't happen, I'm down. Halo with a 10. Thank you, Halo. Wow, it is so unbelievably close right now. Frank, check your Streamlabs. Oh, shit, Unison. That I, I don't have, I don't have it set up. <laughs> I don't have it set up. Uh, can you put your, thank you. Can you put your message and, and in the chat? I'm so sorry. I literally don't even have it open. Um, but thank you so much. Ian with a 10, thank you. You're the man, Frank. Much love. Dude, appreciate it. Thank you, guys. You guys are being so kind. Anthony with the five, bro. We can't have Gengar. Why not Haunter? Haunter does fuck. He said, wow. I'm sorry, Unison. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thank you, though. Thank you so much. If you want to put your message, I'll, I'll go ahead and read it right here. Thank you so much. Um, okay. It looks like we're locking in. Yeah, we're locking in Muck. All right. I'm okay with that. I'm cool with that. That's fine with me. That's absolutely fine with me. Um, all right. Ground type, what do we got? So we got a lot of repeats here. Uh, me personally, I feel like out of all these, I, I probably go Onyx, which might be nuts, but I really, Onyx is like a really nostalgic Pokemon for me, I'll be honest. Rosebuds with the five, thank you. That Magnum pick is gonna feel weird once you get to our steel pick for gen one. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, what? Is that, is that it? Is that literally it? I guess we're doing Magneton. Golem is so, no, Golem does fuck as well. Okay, all right, let me, I'm gonna start with locking in Onyx, because that's my pick. I feel like Onyx, because like, listen, there's just so much, like, obviously Onyx isn't like the best Pokemon, right? Like, he's not like that great or anything, but like, I just remember him being so cool in the anime. I used to watch the episode with Bruno, um, and like the Crystal Onyx, like, all the time. Like, that was like one of the very few Pokemon episodes I had on VHS. Um, it was my brother's favorite Pokemon for a long time, and like, it just, I have like a, I just have like a really strong nostalgia for it. I just really fuck with it. But um, I mean, listen, I understand. I understand, right? Like not everybody had that experience. Uh, so I, I get the 80% no right now. It is a pretty stacked league. Jonathan with the two. Thank you, Jonathan. I always name my Cubones Bambi. That's so depressing. <laughs> that's so, I'm like getting secondhand depression from that. That's, that's, thank you for the support. All right, uh, let's throw Nido King in there. Or actually, no, we'll throw, we'll throw Golem. Let's let's uh, let's litmus test. Let's litmus, litmus test Golem real quick. How are we feeling about that? We got any Golem enjoyers? I will say Golem has really grown on me too. I wasn't like the biggest Golem fan. I wasn't like, you know, I wasn't in the streets like parading for him. You know, I wasn't dressing up as him for Halloween. But um, he's cool. He's rad. You know, I, I feel like he's he's got that demeanor about him. Seventy three percent no. Who do you got? You guys? Do you guys just want Nido King? Is that literally what you guys? Okay. All right. I mean, I, it seems clear as day. That's just what you guys want. It's like you guys got robbed in the poison round. You're like, fuck it. Get him in there. Get him in there. All right. I'll, once again, I'll litmus test it. But uh, yeah, I mean, if it's not Nido King, then I don't know. I don't know who it could be, honestly. I feel like instead of, I'm realizing like a more efficient way to do this is instead of doing yes or no, I feel like we should, I, we're doing a lot of litmus testing here. Maybe I should just make a poll. <laughs> that just says like the top four options and then you guys just vote for who you no that's not fun that's not fun that's not fun all right <laughs> looks like we're looking at that would be way more efficient maybe i should do that i don't know we're locking in nido king now flying i swear to god we have to go charizard i'm not even gonna i'm not even gonna put the poll i'm not even gonna put the poll i don't even want to know like i don't even look at the other flying types are there even any more flying types i don't even remember i'm not even looking at them Charizard is Charizard needs to be on this fucking list. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You can't deny the impact he's had on the league. This guy is literally the Michael Jordan of Pokemon, and you're gonna not put him in the fucking roster? Insane. Have you guys seen the highlights from him? Dude, dude was fucking ever since 1999, this motherfucker was just flying, flying across. No one could keep up. No one could keep up. I'm I'm so I'm sorry. I, I don't care if it's rigged. We're we're, that's, that's it. That's it. That's my, that's my, that's what it is. Le Lexi's in the 50 months. 
Thank you. All right. Psychic type, Mewtwo. Right, right, Mewtwo. I, I mean, I'll put the poll up, but it has to be Mew. Like, I don't even see how we could have a debate about that. Right? I mean, like, Alakazam is cool. Mew is cool, right? No denying that. But, I mean, you can't tell me that Mewtwo is... No! 70%! I'm sorry, am I seeing this right? 65%? That can't be real. That can't be real. What What do you guys want? What do you guys want? Mew? You want Mew? Starmie. Okay, Starmie's based. Star Starmie's based, but no. <laughs> Starmie's based. Thank you, Stephen, for the two. Make Zard fire. No, I tried. I tried. But everybody wanted Arcanine. Everybody was like, Arcanine, Arcanine, Arcanine. So here we are. One of them, one, like, one of them has to be Zard. So it is what it is. Wow. I Okay, Mew. Abra or Mew? Abra is kind of, I like Abra. I will say Abra is, Abra is a pretty good pick. Okay, let me, we'll put Mew in there. We'll put Mew in there and we'll, we'll do a litmus test. I, I don't know, Chief. I don't know, Chief. I mean, listen, Mew's fine, right? Like, it's cool. Better than Mewtwo, though? I, I don't get that. I don't get that at all. Like, that just does not make any sense to me. I mean, it's literally, I don't mean to bring up the naming scheme, but Mewtwo, just the, it's the better, like, you can't, I mean, like, as I said, Mew's fine. Mew's fine. Mew's cool. But, like, putting Mew, putting Mew above Mewtwo is crazy. I'm sorry. I think that's insane. Like, I mean, he's, like, as I said, he's all right. Like, he's fine. He's cool. It's uglier. Yeah. Yeah, but, I mean, I don't know. I mean, Mew, the pro okay, here's my problem with Mew. I'll say it. I, it's the elephant in the room, but I'll say it. Bro, his feet are massive. Like, what is he doing with those grippers? I don't, I can't even believe, like, every time I look at him, it just throws me off. I'll say it. I'll say it. Mewtwo doesn't have that problem. What? <laughs> no, 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 it's not weird. It's not weird. You guys are making it. No, no, no. You see, you guys are, like, making it weird. It's not weird. I just mean, like, he, he, it seems like he could wear clown shoes. Why did, no, I, it's not. You guys are being so weird about it. Also, you're voting Gardevoir. We're talking, it's Gen 1, guys. Come on, what, what's with this antagonistic energy right now? Like, I'm just trying to, I thought this was a safe space. I'll be honest, I thought it was a safe, I thought I could sit here and voice my feet concerns with Mew, but I, I guess not. That's crazy. Wow, I, you know, you learn something new every day. We, I feel like this is like a, um, it's a learning exercise, right? Like, we're really, really finding out about each other in this stream. Like, I've really, the community is showing its true colors, in a way. Steven with a two, thank you, Steven. Are you calling Vinny a clown? Absolutely. Absolutely, no hesitation, for sure. Vinny, Vinny is the largest clown at the circus. I mean, this guy, he's <laughs> love Vinny. Um, all right, what are we talking about here? Come on, guys, please give me Venomoth. I'm putting Venomoth in again. I'm, I'm, fuck it, I'm putting him in again. Please, he's so fucking cool, man. I under, I understand Scyther. I understand Scyther, and you guys are saying Pinsir, and you're saying Butterfree, and rah, 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 rah. very fun, very cool. I get it. I get it, but dude, Venomoth is so sick, man. He's so, just please look at him. Just stare at him a little longer. His, like, he made the transition to 3D really well. He's got Quiver Dance, he's got Bug Buzz, he's got Psychic. His, his typing is pretty cool, I think, and his shiny is just one of the best shinies in the game. Um, I, I, I understand I'm in the minority there, but like, it's just, it's just really upsetting. All right, I guess, I'll, okay, yeah, it's not, I thought, I thought you guys were going to be charitable today, but I guess that's all right. Is the music not on? Have we been going musicless? Oh, no, it's on. It's just not. Okay, in between songs. All right, we'll go and lock in the Scyther. I, I feel like Scyther's kind of mid. I'll say it. Kind of mid. Anthony with a 10, thank you so much. I Oh, oh fuck. Yeah, you're right. Wait, I didn't even realize Pinsir. Dude, okay, we got we to do Pinsir. Guys, guys, guys. No, fuck the Scyther. Fuck this either. Pinsir is so much cooler. Yeah, no, yeah. I forgot Pinsir was even in this league. Guys, guys, guys. No, no, no. Stop. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. We got to go Pinsir. We got to go Pinsir. Say no. Say no, please. It's so much better. I would, I would, yeah. No, Pinsir is so much fucking cooler, man. Cut the vote. Cut the vote. Cut the vote. Guys, okay. We got to get a couple more no's. Okay. Hey. Uh, uh. Come more. Come more. Come more. Come more. Come more. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Guys, guys, come on, come on. We got some, we gotta get some Scyther, Scyther haters. Fuck Scyther, fuck Scyther, get some haters. You guys know, you guys know it has to be done. 
<laughs> okay. All right, cool. It's a no. It's a no. It's a no. By a leg hair. Oh my god. No, wait a one! Are you kidding me? Dude, I I wish I, I didn't even realize Pinsir was in this league. We should have absolutely done Pinsir. That's so upsetting. All right. It's all right. Whatever. It's, yeah, as I said, not my list. Not my list. Not my list, you know? Um, I can't be, I can't be attached to it, right? I can't be attached to it. I personally want to go Onyx again. Uh, we already, we already locked in Golem, right? Oh, no, we didn't. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So yeah, Golem is back on the table. I, I feel like, yeah, I would probably, out of all these, I'd probably still go Onyx. I'm seeing a lot of Aerodactyls in the chat. Anthony with the five, thank you, Anthony. Just go back and do Pinsir anyway. It's not, nah, all votes are final. All, all, all polls are final. Once it's yes, we're done. We're done. We're locking it in. Hey, thank you so much, Grace, for becoming a member. Hopefully you enjoy your perks. Uh, we're doing pretty much, I mean, I, I haven't been extremely consistent, but we're doing member videos, like weekly, which is kind of tight, like behind the scenes stuff and uh, just like random shit. Um, it's like uncut. I, I'm doing a bad job of selling this, but it's like uncut battles and like, you know, portions of videos. And anyways, all right. How are you guys feeling about Aerodactyl, huh? How are you guys feeling? I think... I don't know. I, I could see Aerodactyl winning this. I'd be fine with that. I'd be totally fine with Aerodactyl. It's a valid pick. It's it's cool. It's tight. I personally, once again, I'd go Onyx, but um, <clears throat> yeah, Aerodactyl, I mean, you can't really go wrong with it. Like, I'm looking at Aerodactyl. He's looking back at me, and I'm, I'm not seeing any issue there. So, um, yeah, go ahead and lock that in. Sounds good. Now, Ghost, <laughs> this is a tough one, guys. We got a lot of options. Man, I'm like, whoo, I'm sweating. I'm sweating. We got a lot of options here. Really, it could be anyone's game. Um, a lot of people are saying Ghastly. Honestly, okay, hear, hear me out. My vote, I think Haunter. I think Haunter is cooler than Gengar. That might be a crazy, that might be a crazy thing to say. I mean, listen, I also like Gengar, right? I'm not going to sit here and pretend like I don't. Uh, but let's let's go ahead. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna litmus test. I'm gonna litmus test. We'll see we'll see how we're feeling about Haunter, huh? Wow, over wait, overwhelming support for Haunter. Okay, no, I'm I'm glad we're on the same page with that. Yeah, I I think it just makes sense. Like I, as I said, Gengar is also I like Gengar. Cool Pokemon, cool vibe. You know, uh, I mean besides the that one time where he committed infidelity, but like that's we don't talk about that time, but. Haunter Fox, man. No infidelity on his record. Absolute stand-up guy. Um, yeah, let's lock that in. Let's lock that in for sure. All right, cool. Next up, we got Dragon. Uh, once again, the options are the options are pretty limited. I, I do we pull a Haunter here? <laughs> do we do we lock in Dragon? Okay, Dragonair would be crazy. Dragonair would be crazy. I may, okay, Dratini would be even crazier. We're not doing Dratini. Absolutely fucking not. I can tell you that for sure. Zero percent chance. Let's just, let's start with Dragonite. Let's start with Dragonite. Let's start with Dragonite. We'll feel it out. We'll feel it out. I don't know, man. I I could weirdly see Dragon there. But it also depends on the day, right? Like, today maybe I'm in just more of a Dragonair-esque mood, you know? Also, I got to get rid of the pinned... The pin message here. Let me go ahead. Let me get rid of that real quick. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get rid of that real quick. All right. Wow. No way. Is this a prank? Like, are you really, really? We have that many Dragonair fans. That is nuts. I mean, I'm not like, I'm not shocked, honestly. Like, Dragonair is is like kind of a sleeper pick. I'll say it. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Oh, it's so close. It is so close. Pr pretty much, if, it, if it's no, we're going with Dragonair. If it's yes, we're going with Dragonite. It literally could not be more close. That's nuts. I feel like Dragonite is like the, that's like the, that's like the obvious choice, right? But Dragonair is just so based. It's insane. It's so based. But also, like, here's the thing. Do we want to, we're not just going to pick Pokemon because they're based, right? Like, let's actually try to, 
Let's try to pick the actual best, right? And it looks like Dragonite is gonna be winning that poll. Interesting, wow, that was actually extreme. I couldn't even believe how close that was. Insane. Uh, what the fuck? Why is Missing No on here? <laughs> what, what, what is happening here? <laughs> uh, missing No, right? I don't even think I have to litmus test that. I think we're just, I think we're just going with that. Wow, the steel types are limited. Fuck, we should have done Magnemite for steel. <laughs> it's too late though. It's too late though. We just have to go Magneton. <laughs> that's crazy. That That's like weirdly, it's weirdly depressing. The fact that we have Magnemite and Magneton in the same. All right, I mean, it's like whatever, right? Yeah, no, as I said, no duplicates and we can't go back. That's the two rules. Well, th there's three rules. Also, the poll decides everything. Ah. <sighs> No, 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 we're not going back. We're not going back. Barry, I feel like... I didn't get that. Could you try again? Barry. I don't know, Siri's like smoking crack. Um, whew, God, I don't know. I think I, I personally go Clefable here. I go, I go, I go Clefable. And it seems like a lot of people are also going Clefable. Um, yeah, let's lock that in. We'll go ahead and call that a day. I, I don't know. I feel like Clefable's a pretty obvious choice. I mean, yeah, Wigglytuff is like fine. I honestly, I forgot it was even a fairy type. To be frank with you, that's my name. Um, Yeah, I completely forgot. I feel like, yeah, Clefable just makes sense. It's kind of cool. I, how is it losing? <laughs> chat, chat, are we for real? I feel like this one was so... Who are you going with, Mr. Mime? Shut the front door, dude. There's no way. Actually, stop. No, wait, you guys are fucking with me. You're actually fucking with me. Mr. Mime, I'm sorry, is so ass. Absolutely, I like literally, I might have to veto that. I might have to actually, that's a crime. Bro, he's so mid, he's so mid. He's not even a poke, he's easily like bottom tier. Bottom tier, probably one of the worst gen one Pokemon ever. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm just stating the facts. Mr. Mime? Oh no, wait, wait, Jigglypuff. Wait, wait, okay, wait. No, wait, okay, wait, you guys might be, uh, Never mind. sorry. I might have misjudged you. you. You guys want Jigglypuff is what you want. Okay. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's fine. That's understandable. I thought you guys wanted Mr. Mime for a second there. Oh, that would have been bad. Ash's dad, that is not Ash's dad. That is not Ash's dad. All right, fine, we'll, 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 do, we'll do Puff. We'll do Puff, because obviously that's who you guys are talking about, right? I mean, even though there's an overwhelming amount of people in the chat that for some reason like Mr. Mime, surely it's like a typo or something. Like, surely they meant to say, no, do Wigglytuff, like, clearly, right? Like, there must be some sort of, or, or maybe there's like a language barrier, perhaps? Yeah, no, Jigglypuff, I, I like Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff is cool. Um, I, I still go Clefable. I still go Clefable nine out of 10 times. Mr. Mime is not even, he might as well not even be in the, like they might as well just cut him from the decks because never would, like, okay, someone give me a valid argument for Mr. Mime, like for real. Like just because he's uh, Ash's dad, allegedly, you, you really think they're procreating? Mr. Mime learns a lot of moves. Okay, light screen, he looks funny. You see, that's actually the reason why I don't like him. Invisible barriers. He's OP, barrier and screens. You know a lot of Pokemon can do that, right? Like it's not, I mean, I, I get I get like the gimmick. The gimmick is like interesting, I guess, right? Like I'll give you that. But to say that he is, like, I, I, he doesn't even look like a Pokemon to me. Like, he's just gross. He's just gross and... Like, I would never have one on my team. Never. Ne I wouldn't even consider it. He's one of those Pokemon that you just skip over completely. Like, <laughs> all right, it looks like we're locked. It doesn't matter. We're locking in Jigglypuff. That's all right. Listen, if you guys if you guys want to meet me behind the fucking Arby's, like, we'll, 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 we'll handle it like men. All right? We'll handle it like men. All right? <laughs> You guys, <laughs> Mr. Bob, what? <laughs> okay. All right, hey, I'm just joshing around. Um, let's look at the starters. Oh, this is gonna be a heated debate. Wow, okay, I forgot Pikachu and Eevee are on this. Who okay, catch me, catch me in the Denny's bathroom. Dude, I'm sorry, I would sleep 
anybody. You put me in a Denny's bathroom after some pancakes, I am fucking anybody. I'm, dude, I'm so fast, it's insane. Um, all right, all right. This might be actually one of the most heated debates. I, I'm going Charizard. I'm going Charizard. Well, oh, no, no, never mind. I'm going Charmeleon. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, I think, honestly, no dupes. Okay, this is a based, extremely based take. But I'm going War Turtle. I'm going War Turtle. If I can't go Charizard, I'm going War Turtle. War, uh, War Turtle is cooler than Blastoise. I don't know if that's like a hot take, right? Like, I don't know, I don't know if that's like, um, like an absurd thing to say. Like, I, maybe that's one of those things where like you guys will look at me and be like, Frank, you're, you gotta sip your crazy juice um, or take your meds or something. Like, I don't know. But War Turtle is objectively cooler than Blastoise. And like, I, I would say Ivysaur, Ivysaur is also up there too. It pretty much, I think, I think my ranking, it would be like War Turtle and then it'd be like Ivysaur, Blastoise, Venusaur, like something like that. Isaiah with the one, appreciate it. Wow. Okay. It, no, it's close. War Turtle might actually win this. That's crazy. Guys, guys, come on. We don't want to be, we want to be the cool community, right? We want to be the community that said, yeah, fuck the establishment. Fuck the Blastoise. We, we know what's true, all right? We know what's raw. Hey, thank you for the $5. Um, I am so sorry. I have no idea how to pronounce your name, but thank you. Humans and Pokemon have the same DNA in the Pokemon universe and are able to procreate. So, that's, so that says that Mr. Mime is Ash's dad. If Mr. Mime, okay, but also like, what would he be schlinging, right? Like, what's his size? Okay, <laughs> sorry, that was a joke. We're, we're not answering that question. Um... Chalky with the 10. Thank you, Chalky. War Turtle is a Valkyrie. Dude, yeah, honestly, it's the wingtips that do it. Okay, yeah, wow, you guys are sick. I like that. You guys have weird Mr. Mime opinions, but the War Turtle opinions are, are vibing right now. We are on the same wavelength. I like that. All right, Gigantamax form. Oh, God. I forgot these even exist. Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry, not Gigantamax. Gimmick form. Oh, my God. Okay, well, it's got to be one of the Megas. We can already rule out all the G-Max forms. Um... Butterfree? Actually, Butterfree G-Max. No, no, no. Not, not, we're not even Megas. Megas. Right? Megas. Yeah, we're not, I'm not putting a G-Max form in here. Um, God, okay. If I, if I were sitting here, I'd, I'd have to go with Mega Pinsir. I don't think that's winning the poll, but Mega Pinsir is like my second favorite Mega. I fuck with him so hard. Mega Gyarados is also sick. I would say Mega, B, probably Mega Beedrill or Mega Pidgeot are also up there for me. Um, and probably Mega Charizard Y. Like those, those would be like my my picks personally. But um, I'm seeing a lot of Charizard X. Listen, I'm always down for more Zard. Um, we'll we'll litmus test that. I feel like I feel like with Megas, it's gonna be really split. Like I don't know. I don't. To be honest with you guys, I don't know how we're gonna come to a conclusion here because it. This is this is a touchy subject, right? Like it's like this is. This is rough. Also, like, I feel like, like, I don't know. Like, there's not like a unanimous, like, best pick. Like, really, all the Megas are cool. You said you wanted to be different. No Chuzzard X. Okay, I, listen, I'm not saying Chuzzard X is my pick. I just, I saw a lot of it in the chat. And, you know, we're actually, we're getting some Beedrills right here. Okay, well, let's run Beedrill. Let's run Beedrill. I love, I would be happy with Beedrill. I would be extremely happy with Beedrill. Um... Yeah, that would that would be that would be totally cool with me. How are we feeling about B drill? I as I said, my vote is like Pincer, B drill, uh, Zard Y. Literally, okay. The only reason why I'm going with Zard Y is because in competitive he was so much fun, bro. He had drought, he had fucking solar beam and shit, and it was very cool and rad. And I have a lot of nostalgia for it. And X and Y came out like ten years ago yesterday, and it made me feel something. Um. Wow, we are never gonna come to a decision here. This is this is actually brutal. We might this might be just the end of the poll. I don't think we're getting past this. <laughs> I'll okay, let me I'll throw Y in there. I'll throw Charizard Y. I, I don't think we're gonna we're not gonna be able to come to a, a conclusion here. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put Charizard Y. Pincer. We could probably also throw Mewtwo in there. Oh, fuck, man. Okay, wait, who, who else is there? I'm just gonna make an actual poll and then we'll decide from there. 
Pinsir, what, what's like another popular option? Who do you guys want? Gengar? Okay, we'll throw Mega Gengar. Um, okay, and then we got one more. We got one more. Who else are we locking in? Who else are we locking in? Kangaskhan? Beedrill? Well, we already we already litmus test Beedrill. Pidgeot or Alakazam? Okay. I'm gonna go Pidgeot. All right, whoever wins the poll is gonna be the definitive winner. Those are the four. I, I as I said, Pinsir is my vote. I feel like Mega Gengar doesn't really deserve it. I'll say it. <laughs> I, I mean, like, he's all right. He's cool. Like, he's fine. Mega Gengar is a fine... Wow, it is overwhelming. It is, like, not even close. I don't even know why we bothered litmus testing any other Pokemon. He's so silly. What do you mean? Yeah. I, I mean, yeah, he's, like, okay. I don't know. Like, I, he just never really sat right with me, personally. Um... And in terms of dupes, I don't think this counts. Like the Mega, all the, all the alternate forms will be separate. Um, so yeah, we'll go ahead and lock in Mega Gengar. That, as I said, not my pick, but also not my list, you know? All right, Legendary. We already did Mew. <laughs> we already did Mew, okay? We already did Mew, I'm sorry. Like, I, you have to give me this. Like, we, I'm not, we can't do Mew again. And there's no shot the legendary birds are touching that. Right? Right? I mean, like, there's just no shot. Zapdos? No, no, no. If anybody is touching it, it's it's like Articuno. Articuno's maybe touching it, but like, no. Yeah, it, it's gotta be Mewtwo. Okay, yeah, it's like not even close. Cool. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Awesome. All right, so now we have to pick a favorite out of all the Gen 1 Mons that we just locked in. God, we're gonna be live for like four years. Wait, how long have we been live? It's already been an hour. Okay, let's try to pick up the pace. Now, Lapras. Lapras, Lapras. Lapras. Lapras, come on. Magnemite, guys. Okay, no, it was, it was a funny joke. It was a funny joke. <laughs> I laughed really hard when we picked Magnemite over every other electric type, but um, no, it has to be Lapras. Come on. That's easy, 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 yeah, you know? All right, we'll see. We'll run the litmus test. Um, I just feel like if, because, okay, if Lapras, here's the thing. In order for Lapras to be listed as our, our conglomerate, this is so biased, as our conglomerate favorite, it has to get on this, it has to win this, and it looks like it's not. Okay. That's all right. I, you know, I didn't want it. I didn't want it to be my favorite anyway. I mean, it's like whatever. I'm just, cause like literally if we, if we voted out here, when we go down there to pick our overall favorite Pokemon, it won't be an option. You guys really want Magnemite. The best in the generation though. Okay. <sighs> yes. Y yeah, it is. Okay. It, it, it is. He's right there and he's cool and he's very tight and he uses ice beam and whatever. All right, yeah, I, I understand it. You know, the fact that you guys even let Lapras get that far is um, respectful, I guess. All right, well, <laughs> Magnemite. Are we really saying, now think about it before you make this decision. Are we really saying that Magnemite is our favorite Gen 1 <laughs> Pokemon? Out of all of them, all 151 plus the Mega Forms, plus the Legendaries, we're saying that Magnemite is our favorite. Okay, it looks like we're not. That's cool. That's cool with me. That is a okay. I'm 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 tight with that. I'm tight with that. That's I mean you know it's it's all right. Stop stalling. Vote faster. <laughs> okay, all right, all right, all right. God, this is, this is only gonna get harder. Um, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put the top four. I'm gonna put the top four in a poll, and then we go from there. All right, so go ahead. Uh, looks like we got some missing no. Guys, we are not gonna say missing no, but okay, I'll put it in there. Um, <laughs> War Turtle, okay, we'll throw War Turtle in there. Um, we'll throw, I feel like Eevee. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of Eevees. We'll put Eevee in there. That's fine. 
and Dragonite. Okay, those are our top four. Whatever you guys pick will be the winner. This is so like, <laughs> this is so raw. It's so like, this is so unfiltered. Like we're just, we're just, come on. No, go, guys, actually though, actually though, we can't, it's a joke. It's a joke. Don't pick missing no. Guys, we don't need, like, it's not even a fuck it. I didn't even know it was going to be here. I didn't even know. If you're going to pick Missing No, we should have just picked Magnemite. I'll say it. If, if we're, if we're going to say Missing No, we should have just said Magnemite. That is unbelievable. That is unbelievable. But you, guys, if this becomes my channel banner, we really want people to know that Mag, I'm sorry, Missing No is our favorite Gen 1 Pokemon. <laughs> All right, you know, it is what it is, right? That's, as I said, not my list, not my list. Unison with a 20, thank you, Unison. He said, long story short, my mom beat cancer two years ago and now is dealing with recovery from double knee surgery, which I haven't been in streams of late. Dude, don't even worry about it, man. I hope nothing but the best. Hopefully, hopefully she recovers swiftly. We can get some hearts up in the chat for Unison. Thank you for the support, Unison. I appreciate you and I hope things get better soon. I can't believe we're locking in missing now. That is, that's crazy to me. That is crazy. But yeah, much love, Unison. All right. Normal type Gen 2. Wow, we got some shitty options here. <laughs> very, very mid, mid options. I honestly, I'd be, I'd be fine if we just skipped this. I, I'm telling y'all with Gen 2, I'm going to be ruthless. I don't like Gen 2. I don't like Gen 2. I think the Pokemon are mid. Um, I mean, there's some exceptions, right? But overall, probably the worst overall decks. Sorry, not sorry, sorry, not sorry. It's, yeah. <sighs> Porygon 2, Porygon 2 Fox, actually. Yeah, let me, okay, hang on, let me think about it. I wasn't really giving it the time of day. Definitely not Noctowl. Not Noctowl, not for it. Absolutely not. Ursaring, maybe. Smeargle, actually, I could maybe see Smeargle. Out, out of these, though, yeah, I think we have, yeah, we got to go Porygon, too. I think for sure. Uh, Meta Scott with a two, appreciate that. Who would have knocked out for the win? Yeah. <laughs> no. I'm okay. I'm actually, it's so crazy. I'm actually busy that day. I'm actually, I would. I totally would, but Noctowl is just not in the cards. We're going to do a rain check on Noctowl. No shot. Wow. Okay, no. Wait, he's winning. Sorry. I, I was a little bit I was a little bit shocked for a second there. But no, we're looking at 52, 51. Okay. Fur it fur is like okay. Fur it is like oh no. I'm not even gonna say it. He's not good. He's not good. Half the time when people talk about Furret, I think they're talking about Lanoon. I get them mixed up. And Lanoon is honestly better. Um come on, fur it. Only because of Centret. No, I'm alright with Porygon too. I, you know, we'll go and we'll just wrap up the poll there. I feel like that just makes sense, right? Porygon 2 fucks heavy. All right, let's go ahead and move on to the fire types. Wow. Ooh. Okay. You guys ready for a based take? You guys ready for quite possibly the most based take? You could, pr this, this might actually be like, you know how there's like on, in like a normal building, right? You have like the first floor, second floor, and you have like the ground level, and then you got the basement. I'm gonna lock in Quilava. I'm gonna lock in Quilava. Quilava goes so unbelievably hard. It's insane. It's insane. It's insane. Better than Typhlosion. Better than Typhlosion. I said it. Typhlosion, here's my problem with Typhlosion. Typhlosion just seems too, it's too, simple it's too simple and also especially that now they got rid of the fire i mean okay quilava also kind of suffered from it right like let's let's keep it fair but it's better it's better he's on all fours he's cool he's agile he's got a good demeanor about him it's wow okay he's probably not gonna win but the fact that it's so close is actually insane slugma okay slugma is not getting oh no wait am i win if I win, wait, it's so close. Holy shit. I can't believe that worked. We are locking in Quilava. <laughs> we are locking in Quilava as the best fire type from Gen 2. 
<laughs> that is sick. That is sick. Yeah, I always knew. I always knew you guys had good takes. I always knew. I mean, listen, Houndoom is cool, Typhlosion's cool, Entei's cool, Ho's cool, but like, Quilava Fox, man. Alright, Water Type. This is probably gonna be one of the harder ones. Um, so obviously Wooper is a hard candidate. Quaggy, Quaggy Fox, right? This guy, he's going clubbing. Um, he wears earplugs because he wants to, you know, have safe hearing health, but um, he does frequent them, which I, I think makes him cool. Um, we also could do that, yeah, yeah, well, let's also consider, we could do these other Pokemon, like, it, we could do them for later types, right? So Quaggy doesn't have to be in the water, we could put him for the ground. Maybe he fares better in that league, right? Um, but for right now, I'll go ahead, I'm gonna put Whoop on the pole, and, uh, we'll see if he wins water. I, I feel like he maybe does. For alligator is also not a bad idea. Um, or even Totodile, maybe. But, I mean, I don't know. It's hard to, it's really hard to go wrong with Wooper, honestly. Like, I mean, besides the fact that it's like, ha ha ha, like it's like a joke or a meme, I guess. He just actually is a cool Pokemon. And, um, you know, he frequents like the soup kitchen and stuff, which I think is cool. You know, really gives back to his community. All right, sick. We're going to go ahead and lock him in. That was actually surprising. I thought there was going to be more demeanor on that one, but that actually ended up being really easy. Um, okay. For grass, we got some solid picks here. He has, yeah, exactly. He doesn't need hands, right? All he needs is his feet, right? And he's, he's serving up soup, right? It's foot, it's foot soup. Who said that? J okay, jump pluff is crazy. It's <laughs> Jump Pluff, that's insane. That is, we are not going, I'm sorry. I would rather end stream, delete the channel, and retire before I put Jump Pluff on this fucking registry. Absolutely not. Quinn with the five, thank you, Quinn. Sunkern, no. <laughs> I'm, not even, I'm not even putting that to a vote, no. Um, Bayleaf is actually, I fuck with Bayleaf. I fuck with Bayleaf, I also fuck with Meganium. I think Meganium's cool. Um, Jonathan with the two. Thank you, Jonathan. Let us Chikorita fans finally get a win. No, I feel you. I feel you. I, I think this is a very clear... This is a very clear one. It's either Celebi, Meganium, or Bayleaf. Those are the options. Um, I'll go ahead. We'll throw Celebi up there first. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna make the poll. We'll just make the poll. We'll keep it easy. Celebi, Bayleaf, and Meganium. Yeah, let's just let's keep it simple. I feel like I feel like we don't really have to stress this one too hard. Um, just pick whatever your gut's feeling. Search deep down, you know where the lasagna is, and just figure out you know who you think should win. Um, Celebi, okay, yeah. I mean, yeah, I yeah. I don't really have a, a strong opinion on it. I feel like Celebi is like add Sunkern. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, add sun... <laughs> add sun curve. Oh, how's it going, guys? <laughs> that was a really... Man, you guys got a great sense of humor. Let's go ahead and lock Celebi in. Oh, man, dude. <laughs> wow, it's not even It's not even close. Bayleaf did win that, though, over Meganium, which is interesting. All right, electric type. Oh, God. Oh, man. I feel like... I feel like Ampharos. I feel like Ampharos. Ampharos is, is you know, I, I know I dog on Gen 2, but Ampharos is, Ampharos is raw. Ampharos is raw. Lantern? Nah. <laughs> nah. Let's, I'm just gonna, we'll litmus test. I'm gonna throw Ampharos in there. I feel like that's a pretty, I feel like that's a pretty easy one. I don't know. I mean, like, lan like, like I said, Lantern, well, maybe I didn't say it, but I will say it now. Lantern's fine. Mareep's cool. Pichu is also cool. Uh, Raikou is cool, but better than Ampharos? No. Better than Ampharos? Uh, no shot. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we're looking at a 62% yes. I feel like we can confidently just lock that in. Don't even really have to think about it much longer. Yeah, wow. That is exponential. All right. Ice. What do we got for ice? Um, not a lot of options because Gen 2 is kind of mid. <sighs> you see, here's my problem with Gen 2, right? It just relies so much on Gen 4. Like, Sneasel is, is dog ass <laughs> without Weavile. Pillow Swine, you, I mean, man, you need Mammal Swine. You need Mammal Swine for it to be cool. Delibird is mid. 
Smoochum, what the fuck even is that, you know? Anyways, uh, I feel like out of all of these, Sneasel is like the best of the of the mid. A lot of people are saying Delibird. Really? 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 I mean, I, I, I understand like he's like a funny Pokemon. He's like, ah, ha, ha, yeah, Delibird, he's Santa Claus. Whoa, like, it's so, so crazy. Um, but I don't know, Chief. Like, he's not all that. He is not all that. Like, okay, would you actually use one on your team? Be for real. One of your six precious slots, you're putting a deli bird on there? Yeah, fucking right. Yeah, fucking right, right? Like, what's he, what's he gonna do? Go for present? What's he gonna do? And then what, you're just gonna spam that the entire fucking game? That sounds fun. <laughs> that sounds like a good time. Wow, Sneasel is not winning. I. I didn't realize y'all were such big Christmas fans. Is this, okay, I guess I'll, I mean, clearly the next up has to be like Swinub, right? Like, there's no way. All right, fine, fine. I'll put Delibird, I'll put Delibird up there, but like, I would go Swinub. I would go Swinub over Delibird. I would go Swinub over Delibird. I don't know if that says something about me. I don't know if that says something about you guys. <laughs> Smoochum? No, okay. <laughs> oh, oh man, you guys are making me crack up up here. <laughs> I didn't know it was stand-up night. <laughs> yeah, no, okay, Iron Bundle is, I like Iron Bundle. Iron Bundle's cool. Okay, all right, that's, but all right, that's, you guys know, you guys know we're not talking about Iron Bundle, right? Like, you know we're talking about regular ass, derpy ass, dumb ass, stupid ass, present have an ass. I mean, I, I, I know Shady likes him, but I don't know. He's like, okay. He's like, all right. Anyways, the clear choice, right? The clear choice is Heracross. Do we even have to, we might not even have to put this to a vote. <laughs> if, if Tyro gets on the ladder, we're gonna have a problem. I like, I see, I see some of y'all. I see you guys being like, Tyro, <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no. God, could you imagine? Could you imagine? I just fucking... <laughs> Alright. Yeah, it's that's fine. That's fine. We're locking it in. I mean, I like him on top as well. Him on top is fine. He's cool. Please do it. Bro, you don't even want to see... Honestly, I was going to say you don't even want to see me do it, but you literally wouldn't even see me. I'm so quick with it. My, It's like faster than light. Watch this. You wouldn't even know. You wouldn't even know. Hey, King Frost, thank you for the five. I'm 30 minutes behind, but agreeing with Benamoth, even if everyone else doesn't. Thank you. Thank you, King Frost. You're going to see this in 30 minutes, but thank you. Appreciate that. Can, I, can someone, like, just let me... When, when King Frost, whenever you, whenever you see this, just know I appreciate that. Goat, man. Venomoth Fox. All right. Uh, poison type. Ooh, okay. God, Gen 2 has, like, no Pokemon. What? What is this? Um, yeah, Crobat, right? Crobat. I'm not even going to put that to a poll. I'm like, I literally actually not. Yeah, I, the chat is so, it could not be more clear. Okay, cool. Ground types. Um, so we're back with the Whooper and Quagsire. We can't double up on Whoopie Boy. So, I mean, I guess we could do Quag, but like, I mean, maybe? No, I feel, I feel like we go Steelix. <gasps> I feel like we go Steelix. Or actually, I feel like we go Pupitar. <laughs> Call or Don Don fan's cool. All right, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. I feel like Don fan, Don fan, Don fan or Steelix is like the obvious pick. But like Pupitar, I'm not gonna lie. I'm looking at him. Pupitar's kind of cool. I'll say it. He's kind of fucking cool. I mean, we'll, we'll we'll put it up to the jury. I don't I don't expect him to win, right? I don't expect you guys to agree with me on this one, but. Um, he's cool. Let me just say this. He's cooler than you think, right? Like you're sitting there, you're voting no confidently. You're saying absolutely not, Frank. Genuinely upset you even asked me this question. I'm going to leave right now and I'm going to watch YouTube shorts and I'm going to go to bed and be very upset with you. And what I say to that is never go to bed angry. And also Pupitar fucking rocks. And it's disrespectful that you would even consider him to not rock. 
We could actually, speaking of rock, we could put him in the rock category. We could, we could, I and mean, we'll see what the rock contendants are looking like. We'll see what kind of uh, environment we're playing with, but we could put him in the rock category. All right, we got a lot of Quagsires. Let's, uh, you know what? I'll just, let's just put up a poll. I'm going to say, I'm gonna, I'll put Steelix and Donphan in there just to give them a fair shake. We'll say Quag, Steelix, and then we will also say Donphan. I, I, I really think any of these could be, could be valid, personally. I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm pretty torn on this one. Because, like, on one hand, like, Steelix is fucking awesome, right? As an evolution to Onyx. So, like, you really, you can't go wrong with Steelix. Donphan is, like, kind of like a sleeper pick. But, like, he's equally as cool, you know? He's got, like, that, he's got that massive hog energy. Like, you're looking at him, you're like, damn. This guy, I mean, I don't want to make assumptions, but he is absolutely packing. So I fuck with that. I like that a lot. And then Quagsire is just cool. But we are we already got Whoopie Boy on there, and Whooper is is better than Quagsire, dare I say. So I'm actually fine with Don Fan getting in the one. Seems like you guys appreciate a good schmeat like anyone else. Horses with the seven, appreciate that. Sorry, I hate to spoil the bid, but we all know Spupa is the best pocket monster of all time. Horses, if Spupa somehow even remotely touches this list, we're gonna have a problem. We're gonna have a problem, all right? Anyways, all right, we're on to flying type. Wow, lots of big contenders here. What a stacked roster. Oh my god, I forgot we had Skarmory here. Ooh, okay, this is tough. I I feel like Lugia, because we, okay, we're not not doing Delibird, obviously. Uh, we also just can't. We're not, we can't do Crobat, because we already, we already did Crobat. I feel like, honestly, I feel like either, ooh, Mantine. Mantine is kind of a sleeper. I like Mantine a lot. To, for me, I feel like it's either Yanma, Mantine, Skarmory, or Lugia. I'm, I'm not even putting Ho-Oh in there. Ho I mean, Ho-Oh Ho is fine. Ho-Oh is fine. Ho-Oh is fine. But, I mean, let's be honest with ourselves, right? Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it, right? Murkrow? Eh? Yeah, I, I don't know. This really could be anyone's game. I'll, I'm going to go ahead. I'm just going to put up... Oh, the Don fan poll is still live. Whoopsies. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna put up a, I'm just gonna put a raw poll. I'm just gonna put a raw poll. We're not even gonna fuck around with the litmus test. Hey, thank you, Scott. Appreciate that. Is he, did he say Noctowl again? <laughs> no. <laughs> just, I'm, no. Okay, let's throw, we'll throw Yanma in there, and then, do we want Mantine? Do we want Mantine? Or is there another fourth? We got a lot of Murkrows. We also, we also, here's the thing, we also could do Lugia for Psychic. Or, or also just for le like for legendary, right? So maybe we don't even want to do Lugia right now. Zatu, okay. All right, all right. Just for kicks, just for kicks. Instead of Lugia, let's put Zatu, and then we'll do we'll do the crow. Because Lugia will probably be legendary, right? So let's not let's not even bother with this, right? Let's just let's save him for later. Oh, my timer's going off. Whoopsies. Whoopsie, whoopsie. Jump off. <laughs> Skarmory! Wow! Wow! Honestly, that makes sense. Alice of the Two, Murkrow is the biggest sleeper pick of the century. I actually do like Murkrow. I will say, though, Murkrow without Haunchcrow is dumb. I'll say that. Like, that, this, is why, this is what I'm talking about with Gen 2, man. Gen 4 saved Gen 2. Without Gen 4, I'm sorry, so many Gen 2 Pokemon are so fucking mid, man. And I like Murkrow. I like Murkrow, but I just mean like he's bad. He's just bad. Anyways, yeah, no, Jump Off absolutely is not getting a chance. Okay, let's go Skarmory. Psychic. <laughs> oh my god, we have every unknown. <laughs> okay. I know this is crazy, and I'm, I'm expecting y'all to be... Um, upset with me about this, but I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. And you guys are joking. You're joking. You're jokingly saying it. I actually love Unknown. Unironically, one of my favorite Pokemon. Unironically. Now, like, I'm not even sitting here. I'm not just being like, uh, Unknown. Uh, like, no. No, no, no. I genuinely fuck with him. 
because I love the mystery behind it. I think it's really interesting. I think it's an interesting idea to have a Pokemon that's so, I mean, obviously he's bad, but like he's just so, he's so weird and cool. He's so mysterious and I, I fuck with that. I really fuck with that. Hear me out, unknown M. Thank you, Beloink. I appreciate the 10. Um, hey, hang on, let me analyze, let me analyze. I feel like let's just take the best unknown, the top four unknowns and we'll put them in the poll. I think, ooh, actually, okay, wait, unknown M kind of does go hard. I feel like, okay, hang on, let me actually think about this. I feel like unknown O, D-E-T-E, I kind of like, I kind of like F. I know it's kind of biased because my name's Frank, but I kind of like F. W kind of Fox. Z, ooh, Z Fox. Okay. All right, all right, all right. So we're doing, we're just doing unknowns. <laughs> just pick your favorite letter. We're going to go Z. We're going to go M. Uh, we got some A, A. Yeah, A is pretty good. I do like A. We'll do A. And then our last letter will be... H? D? We got a lot of Ds in the chat. Let me see. Let me analyze D. Yeah, D looks all right, I guess. H? A F G H. Oh, wait, wait. I was looking at... Wait, I was looking at H when I said O. Anyways, okay, yeah, let's put H. Sorry, I don't know my alphabet. All right, vote on your favorite unknown, and we'll go ahead and lock that in. Um, thank you so much, Robert, for the six months. I remember feeling like I knew a second language when I was younger because I could read Unknown. Dude, yeah, it's so cool, man. All the puzzles involved with it. Like, Unknown is unironically a sick Pokemon. And I'm sick of pretending like it's not. Like, do you remember it in the movie when they were like, they're like going around causing mayhem and shit? Like, it was so fun. So fun and quirky and cool. Gotta go A. It looks like H is plowing out. I don't know why I used that. That was a crazy phrase. Hi, Vinny. V for Vinny, ah, well, the, the poll's already up, but I, otherwise I would. I absolutely would. Looks like H is winning. Okay, yeah, I'm fine with that. It's very symmetrical. It's very nice. Very satisfying. Well, it was close. It was extremely close. I might. I actually probably shouldn't have even ended that because it was that close. Uh, but all right, we'll go ahead and lock H in. I'm going to go ahead and do my math here. Bam. Awesome. Bug type. Wow. Lots of great options here, guys. <laughs> Gen 2, back at it again with the bangers. Um... It's, it's either Yanma Scizor or, or Heracross. Shuckle, guys, we cannot, I'm not considering Shuckle. Really? Shuckle. Shuckle, Shuckle, guys, Shuckle is so annoying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, he's so annoying. Have you ever used a Shuckle or fought a Shuckle? Do you have fun doing that? Like, is that something you enjoy? Do you enjoy pain? Do you enjoy torture? That's crazy. All right, I'll put him on the poll. I'll put him on the poll, but I'm not, I'm not gonna like it. Um, okay, so obviously we're saying Scizor. We're saying Heracross. We are saying Yanma, because I like Yanma. And I will, for whatever fucking reason, put shuckle on there even though he does not deserve to be there okay cool um let's see halo with the 17 months appreciate it. he said shuckle shuckle will throw you his knuckles if you don't pick him he doesn't have knuckles also my knuckles are so much faster have you guys seen i i think i've literally threatened violence at least on two separate occasions in this stream and you guys saw you saw how fast i was man oh my god my demeanor is insane I'm just like, it's like light, like the frame rate can't even keep up without, mm. Anyways, all right, Chuckle at 41%. Thank God he's losing. <laughs> you already, oh, we already did Heracross. You're right. Well, it doesn't matter. Heracross is fighting. I completely forgot. Yeah, we already did. Okay. Yeah, we'll just ignore him. All right, either way, Scizor's winning. Cool. Cool. Honestly, listen, that was the obvious pick, but it's also probably the best pick, right? I mean, if we're being honest with ourselves. All right, now we got T-Tar up in here. I feel like, yeah. Oh God, Shuckle's back. Okay, <laughs> guys, <laughs> guys, no, 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 no. I know, I know, <laughs> How funny would it be if instead of T-Tar, the clear and obvious choice, we pick Shuckle? That's what's going through your minds. That's going, that's, I can read, you guys, I don't even have to look at chat. I know what you're saying. You're like, yeah, guys, let's go Shuckle. Oh, it's so funny, no. 
No, it's not. You guys gotta understand, if this is gonna be my banner, right, this list is representing us. It's representing our tastes. It's representing what we value in this community. And the fact that Shuckle is even remotely being considered right now is insane. Um, I mean, once again, I will make the poll because that's what I do. That's like my job here. Uh, but it does not in any respect deserve to win. Um, I'm also going to throw, I'll throw Pubitar on there <laughs> just for, I don't know. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe we got some sleeper Pubitar fans. Anyways, um, LeBag with the 48 months. Dude, thank you, LeBag. Yo, what's up, Mr. Franklin? LeBag! Appreciate you, man. Thank you for the support. John, then with the two, Frank hates democracy. Okay, no, no, I'm a big democratic fan. That is, a, that is an accusation on my character, and I don't like that. But what I will say is, I think that the group should reconsider. That's what I'll say. I cannot believe, is it? Guys, we're T-Tar, T-Tar, Tyranitar is in the same bracket and you're going Shuckle. God, man, really? What is the reason? Like, does anybody have a valid argument for this? Like, like though, I just want to know why. Like, why? K-Dubs the two months, that's, thank you, K-Dubs, but geez. T-Tar for dark. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I guess, but like, what are the dark type options? I, I still feel like that's not a good idea. I mean, okay, whatever. Well, what are the dark type options? Guys, come on, we could have had Umbreon. Now you're gonna force T-Tar to go in the dark slot? J just because you want Shuckle that bad? Shuckle is not, we're, we're literally, you, you know what this is telling me? This is telling me that you guys would rather have Shuckle over Umbreon, over Murkrow, over Houndoom, over Steel. I would take any of these over Shuckle. Well, it's locked in now. So now, now what? Are we gonna not do T-Tar? Are we just not gonna put T-Tar? Is that, that's crazy. That's an insane thing. We're doing a Gen 2 best Pokemon. You're not putting T-Tar? Crazy. Anyways, thank you, LeBag. I, I fuck with Pupitar. I think Pupitar goes hard. All right, let's, let's just do the dark type now. Um, I, I literally, we have to do T-Tar. We have to. It's like, it's like I'm, I'll put Umbreon and Houndoom on there for, for kicks. You know, I'll, I'll put them on there for jest. I, I need a breather. I need a, I need a breather. I need a breather right now. This is just. Guys, I'll, I'll say it. Umbreon is not even that good. <laughs> I don't even like Umbreon. I mean, like, okay. It looks cool and it's shiny is cool. But have you ever used an Umbreon? It it's little it's just toxic like the entire fucking Pokemon, it's just toxic stall. That's the that's how that's how it that's what it does. It just stalls toxic. Like, is that I don't like it. I don't like the, Umbreon's fucking lame. I'll say it. The design is cool. The design is cool. Toxic stall, really? <sighs> Anyways, Robert with the two. Thank you, Robert. First super chat. Appreciate it, man. Shuckle used to be able to do the most damage. Yeah, but... Uh, T-Tar for Mega? Yeah, uh, no, well, even, even then, no. <laughs> Ampharos, Ampharos is a better Mega. Okay. All right, and once again, I have to detach myself, right? Like, it's not my list. Okay, um, for this next one. <laughs> what if there's only one ghost type in Gen 2? Really? It's just, there's no other ghost type? All right. That's insane. I'm not, man, Gen 2 is so mid. All right, do you guys agree? <laughs> do you guys agree on Mistrevis? <laughs> do the poll. <laughs> okay, we can't. If we, what, what are we doing? If we don't do Mistrevis, what are we doing? Do you guys have like a plan in mind? Like, because I get, I get the bit, right? Ha ah, ha, there's no other option. Let's vote no. What are we going to do? Okay. Serious talk. Let's talk about it. What are we going to do? What are we, are we just not going to fill that spot? 
We would, we would rather, wait, that's so funny. We would rather have nothing. We would rather starve ourselves of a ghost type generation two Pokemon than have mystery this. <laughs> that is so sad. I actually really like Mistrevis. Good chuckle again. <laughs> all right, all right. I I can't I can't put the image in there, but okay, just pretend. Pretend like the options are. <laughs> okay, pretend pretend like I have Ghost Shuckle, just Shuckle, but he got he got hit with like, I don't know, Forest Curse or what's the fucking move? I don't know. Ghost shuckle. Are we how how are we feeling about a ghost type shuckle? Is that what do you guys think about that? That's surely better than Mistrevis, right? Do you agree with ghost? Sh should we just put like a dragon type shuckle in there as well? I mean, we might as well just we can just fill out the rest of the. I mean, do we even have to? Why don't we just make up new Pokemon? I think the dragon type slot should be uh, Jonathan. His name is Jonathan, and he works in accounting and he files paperwork, and he sometimes is a dragon type, and that's why he is in this slot. All right, all right, fine, fine. I'll, I'll let you guys, you want, know whatever. You guys can have this one. I'm not a, I'm not the biggest Mistrevious fan, right? So that's fine. We have Ghost Shuckle in, in the ghost type slot. <laughs> now, now as far as dragon types go, <laughs> How are we feeling about Kingdra? <laughs> oh my god. No, Kingdra's cool. I like Kingdra. I can't believe, dude, like, there's only one... One dragon type. What the fuck? What was Gen 2 smoking? I swear to god. Like, p okay, people who say Generation 2 is the best gen why? It makes zero sense to me. It's so mid, dude. All right, all right, we're locking in Kingdra. That's fine. It's good to know that Kingdra somehow is better than Dragon Shuckle. That, that's at least, that's reassuring. That's reassuring to hear. I love that. All right, Steel types. We could do Steelix now. We already did Scizor. We already did Skarmory. Yeah. It, it just has to be Steelix, right? There's no shot we're putting Fortress. Okay. Steelix, right? Cool? Okay, I'll, I mean, listen, I'll put the poll up, but I don't really see how this is a debate. Right? I mean, he's just, Steelix is cool. Steelix is a cool guy. He fucks heavy. He's got a large demeanor, but really? Really? Okay, uh, that's better. I was gonna say, just doesn't make a lot of sense. I just don't see how... Shuckle, we can't just do Shuckle for every... What, should we just, should we just wrap, should we just wrap this all up, right? I want to see the point, right? It's just, guys, okay, we figured it out. Shuckle is our favorite Pokemon. That we don't, I don't even care for the other thousand of them, right? It's just Shuckle or nothing. So disrespectful. I feel like, the, like, even the guy who birthed Shuckle, the guy who's at the diner drawing up the preemptive beta Shuckle, even him doesn't fuck, he doesn't fuck with Shuckle that much, right? Like, it's just you guys. You guys are like the only group of people that are that are really fucking like that. Like, nobody else, even, even his own mother is like, nah. Anyways, um, I feel like Azumarill. I feel like, I feel like we just go Azumarill. Um, definitely not, what, what's their, I don't even know their name, Gramble, not Gramble. Gramble is so bad. I, every time people, I genuinely hate Gramble. Genuinely. Never, him and, him and the other guy, hate him. I've never liked them. Just wait till Gen 5 for Fairy. Is it literally just like Autono? Or is there no, is there no, there might not literally not be a Fairy type. Togepi, Togepi is also cool. Okay, let's, you know what? Yeah, I'll throw, let's throw Togepi on there. I, I, I vibe with Togepi. We'll throw Togepi and Azumarill. I, I feel like no one else is even coming close. Uh, so we'll slop that on there. Snubble, my baby. Guys, no. No. <laughs> Snubble. Snubble is so bad. He literally, he makes me visibly upset. Like, 
I clicked the show more fairy Pokemon button and it just immediately, just like this visceral anger, just like, like I, I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but like my expression drastically changed. <laughs> hey, Dominic. Dom, okay, all right. In case you guys don't know, that's my, that's my brother. He's, don't, he's going through puberty. Don't, don't, it's like, Dom, you don't have to be so visceral. I mean, I see your point, but you don't have to be so visceral about it. Anyways. <laughs> All right, we got Togepi. That's fine. That's good. Um, yeah, I'm all right with that. I mean, I personally, as like I said, Azumarill is the vibe, but it's okay. Um, starter. Starter. This is, this might, we might have to fight each other. I don't, like, like listen, I don't want to get into like an altercation right now but this might turn into one. Um, Typhlosion cannot win this. I'm sorry, he just can't. He just can't. Um, I'm going Quilava, honestly. Well, we already, we already did Quilava, fuck. Okay, I'm going for Alligator. I'm going for Alligator, I'm going Totodile, I'm going Bailey for Meganium or Cyndaquil. I'm going pretty much anybody, honestly. I, I think literally Typhlosion is like here, and then Chikorita's here, and then like everybody else is like above him. I just, I just feel like, like, I've never fucked with him. I've never fucked with him. Something about him, he's just like, like, I think in, in his sprite work, he's cool. Well, even then, he's too, like, I don't, his, his bare body is what kills me. Like, it's just too, I don't know. I, it's something about it just gives me the heebie-jeebies. Um, all right, let's go ahead. I'm going to lock in. We're going to lock in for Alligator, of course. We're going to lock in, we'll say... Chikorita slander. I like Chikorita. Vote Shuckle. <laughs> okay, we'll put Shuckle on there for the fans. <laughs> we'll put Meganium, and we will also put a hey, horse with the gifty. Thank you, horses. Shout out to the birthday boy, whoever received that. Um, actually, no, no. Bayleaf is cooler. Let's put Bayleaf over Meganium. Honestly, Bayleaf is cooler. Crocodile. No, Crocodile. I honestly don't. I, I don't like Crocodile either. And then we'll put. We'll put Cyndaquil. <laughs> Wait, am, am I literally, I'm not even, okay, no, I'll put Typhlosion. I'll put Typhlosion, just because I know there's a lot of people that like him. Fine, fine. But as I said, if this is my list, no, no, no. Okay, don't, don't actually vote Shuckle though, right? Like, like we're all agreeing that's like a bad idea. Like that's like completely defeats the point of the stream. Because like the entire point, like if you guys didn't know, the entire point is so that way we can take all the Pokemon and like narrow it down, right? And like, as you can see in this category, Shuckle doesn't really, he's not really here, right? I mean, I guess we could say he's here with us in spirit, but he's not like, Frogator. okay, Frogator. cool, 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 cool. I'm happy with that. I'm glad we could, we could stomp out the Shuckle lovers. I just like, once again, I just don't understand the, the love for him. Like genuinely, he's just unpleasant. <laughs> like, like that is the best way I can describe it. He's just extremely unpleasant. Um, okay, we got some banger forms here. I feel like Ampharos. I actually don't even have to think about this. Ampharos. Ampharos. I'm going to put Ampharos. Um, I, well, okay, here's the, I, I don't really, okay. Yeah, Mega Titar, right? Like you guys failed to put Titar anywhere else, which is ridiculous. So like we could sit here and be like, okay, let's put the Mega there. The problem is I don't like Mega Titar. I, I think it's a downgrade. I think Mega Titar is a downgrade from regular Titar. And the fact that we haven't put regular Titar here, like we just gotta go Ampharos. I mean, I'll listen, we'll we'll litmus test. We'll we'll go ahead, I'll dip my I'll dip my toe in the acid and how does it work again? We'll see if we got a if it's like a base or acidic or I don't fucking know how it works. Um, yeah, I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll put her in there. I, I just feel like, like Mega Ampharos is just the best out of those. If, if we're looking at it in an echo chamber, which is what we're supposed to be doing. Like we're not just, we're not just supposed to be putting Mega Titar there because we regret putting Titar where it should have been, where it should have been. Like we can't, we're not gonna vote based on, like we're get, it's like a pity vote. Steel, I do like Steelix. I, I don't like, I'll say it, I don't like Mega Heracross. I don't like Mega Heracross. It's just, he's not, he's just not it. 
Okay, so we're okay, so we're not doing Ampharos. That's crazy. That's insane. Okay, so Titar, really? Scizor? I don't really like Mega Scizor either. I mean, it's like okay. It's like alright. I feel like the like Steelix is the it goes Ampharos, Steelix, Houndoom, Scizor, Tyranitar, Heracross. That's the order. That's the order. Okay, let's just, I'll just make, I'll just make a pull. I'll just make a pull. Regular pull. We'll throw Steelix on there. We'll throw Titar on there for some reason. And then we'll throw Scizor and Houndoom. I'm, I'm not even putting Heracross. <laughs> Heracross, I'm sorry. He's so doofy. He's so doofy. And like, like regular Heracross is so cool. But this, what, what's even going on there? Right? Like it's pro probably actually my least favorite Mega. Yeah, Probably. Probably, actually. You see, here's the thing. As I said, it's not my list, but I like to think that I'm like the electoral college, right? Where I, I'm not like, it's not all, like, it's not fully mine, you know? Houndoom is, really? Really, Houndoom? Why, why are we not going Ampharos? Why are we not going Steelix? What is happening right now? Houndoom, really? Have you guys ever, have you ever used a Mega Houndoom? You see, here's the problem. You guys are, are only thinking about the design. Don't just, don't just think about the design. Mega Houndoom is so ass. Why are, why are we only, like, I'll agree, I'll agree. He looks cool. He's cool, right? He's cool. He's fine, right? But like, brother. Ambrose isn't even, well, because we already voted Ampharos out. Okay, it's fine. It's, I, I urge you guys to, wow, it's actually close. I urge you guys to reconsider. Urge you guys to reconsider. A hey, life over the six months, appreciate, appreciate that. Houndoom is objectively better in every way that sheep cannot compare. That is insane. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't realize you guys, I, like, I don't know, like it must be something in the water, right? I mean, I, I'm, or the time zone or something like, or maybe like there's some sort of like miscommunication or maybe, you guys just, did, maybe you didn't play the same game that I played because you insisted on unknown. Yeah, well, because unknown fucks. All right, fine, 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 fine. We'll, we'll just, it's, it's okay. How, we'll lock in Houndoom for some reason. Okay, legendary. Legendary. Um, uh, hmm. Wait, didn't we say we were going to do Lugia? I think we have to do Lugia. We have to do Lugia, right? I, I mean, we, we were purposely saving Lugia for this moment. I mean, once again, we'll put the poll up, but I, I think that's pretty locked in. Damn. We've been live for, <laughs> we live for almost two hours and we're not even done with the first gen or second gen. <sighs> we're doing, we're doing like about one generation per hour. So at this rate, <laughs> okay, we got to pick it up. We got to pick it up. Yep. Okay, cool. Lugia, done. <laughs> we got to go faster. Um, all right, uh, just type, type out of all these, out of all these, which, what a favorite, favorite, just type, type what you guys would vote. Yeah, okay, clearly Shuckle is on that list for some godforsaken reason. Should we put the dead Shuckle on there too? Ghost Shuckle, okay, and then we'll throw, it is overwhelmingly, we'll put Whooper on there, it is overwhelmingly Shuckle. And then I will say for Alligator, okay. So out of those, which are our favorites? Which is winning the cake? I feel like you gotta go Wooper here out of those four. Um, if it was my vote, like raw dog in it, like no influence, I'd probably say, I'd probably say Ampharos out of these, to be honest. Matthew the five, thank you, Matthew. The first super chat too. Dude, thank you so much. Can we start muting these chuckle comments? Like really? <laughs> Listen, it's a democracy, right? We give the people what they want. Alice with the two, thank you, Alice. My favorite was the blank ghost type. Yeah, I think it just really, it really stands out amongst the crowd. Okay, yeah, it's it's like not even a contest. All right, well, thank God we're moving out of Gen 2, so we don't got to worry about that anymore. Um, cool, Shuckle's our favorite from Gen 2, I guess, even though I literally, I didn't even put him on the map. I didn't even think he'd be here. Okay, Gen 3, wow. Gen 3 is fun, man. Gen 3, we're gonna have a good time with Gen 3. So, immediately I'm thinking Swallow or slacking or explode. Yeah, no, dude, gen, gen 3, I'm going to tell you guys right now, Gen 3 is going to be gen 3 is going to be rough. Um 
Okay, we'll throw we'll throw slacking on there. I'm throwing swallow on there because swallow fucks heavy. And then we will throw ca cast form. Cast form? Why? Thank you for the super chat, Light Flare. You can't silence the cheers for Shuckle. <laughs> yeah, they're too deafening. Uh, and then who else? Honestly, wait, what's, um, oh, we gotta do Zangus. Yeah, wait, Zangus fucks. Okay, while you guys vote, I'm gonna go get some water. Um, yeah, and then we'll go ahead and make that happen. I feel like personally, I think, yeah, I go Swallow. I definitely go Swallow out of these. Actually, I'm gonna see if I can keep talking to you guys even while I'm away. It'll probably break up at some point. I don't know if it has that much range. I'm just going in the fridge right now, getting a fucking jug of water. You guys ever see me chug a water bottle? Oh my God, you guys aren't ready. Look at this, look at my throatiness. Oh my God. If y'all have never, excuse me. If y'all have never raw dogged a crystal geyser, you ain't living. You ain't living, I'll say it. All right, uh, slacking is winning. That's crazy. Cool. <laughs> he just said throaty, he embraced the goat. No, 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 it was purely satirical. Purely satirical. Don't don't take that as a serious comment. All right. Uh, wow. I think. Okay. Well, it's okay. Here's the thing. Blaziken could be in the fighting category. I feel like. I don't know. I, I think our options are pretty clear here. I think it's like Blaziken, Torchic. Um. Hang on. Yeah, let's lock that in. Blaziken, Torchic. <laughs> Tor really Torkoal? Actually, yeah. I'll say yeah. Camrupt and Torkoal. Sun cast form, no, absolutely not. Absolutely fucking not. Cast form is so unbelievably mid. Like, I, I, I like, like, okay, the gimmick is interesting. I'll give you that. The gimmick is kind of cool. But outside of that, it's just like, what is he even going? Like, he's even, but even with the gimmick, like, he sucks, you know? He's just like, also, the, the, the fire form of cast form is probably the worst of all of them. I think the water one is probably the coolest. If I, if I had to, I mean, if I'm remembering, I, I mean, they're so forgettable, I forget sometimes. All right, Blaziken, cool. That was a pretty easy one. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like we did that pretty well. Wow, okay, this is gonna be a bitch. <laughs> this is, okay, this is gonna be hard. Oh, there's so many good water types in Gen 3. Huntail, no. Dude, listen, I like Huntail, but in this league, in this league, he is not on the registry. There's no way. So, okay, uh, we can we, we can only do four. We can only do four. So let's let's do Mudkip. We'll do Swampert, obviously. Oh my God, do we do we even do Swamp? I don't even think we have room for Swampert, because okay, Waylord has to be on there. Yeah, Waylord absolutely has to be on there. God, there's so many good fucking water types. Walrein, Milotic. Let, let's okay, let's let's agree. We're gonna we're gonna save Kyogre. Let's save Kyogre for the legendary. Let's save Kyogre. We don't need we don't need to do Kyogre right now. Wall Ray, we could probably save for ice. I, I think we gotta go. Let's go, let's focus on the pure water types. I think we go Milotic. And I think we go. Oh, Ludicolo, Ludicolo is so raw. Literally, I there are so many good water types in Gen 3, it's actually insane. Uh Pelipper, no. <laughs> that, and that's and that's one of the not good ones. It's actually crazy that out of all these, that's the one. That's the one you said. Okay. I'll throw Ludicolo on there. Ludicolo might end up being scooped up for grass though, to be honest. I I feel like, me personally, I think Waylord wins this. I love Waylord. He's one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, I'm like, I'd put him, yeah, top, he's top 10, maybe even top five for sure. I just love how big he is. Like, I, I don't know if you guys noticed, but like when it comes to Pokemon that I fuck with, a lot of it is Pokemon that I think are really interesting or like have like a unique trait about them. So like unknown, you know, he's mysterious, he's cool. Waylord, he's fucking like a brick shit house. You know, I, I just think it's interesting. All right, yeah, Mudkip 40%. I mean, that that just makes sense, right? Like that just adds up. Wow, my Lodic was close though. Interesting, okay. Grass, uh, oh man, a lot of banger grass types too. I feel like Weirdly enough, I'm thinking Tropius. Is that is that a, is that a hot take? I'm thinking Tropius. Tropius goes hard, and I'm sick of pretending like he doesn't. Okay, 
I'm fucking sick of it. I'm putting Tropius on there. Listen, whether you guys vote for him or not is up to you guys, but like, bruh, bruh, honestly, let's be honest with ourselves. Um, Septile, okay, Septile does go so insanely hard, but call me crazy, Grovile goes harder. I'm, I'm, I might put Grovile on here and not Septile. Can we, can we get some, can we get some, I mean, if you guys have a disagreement on that front, let me know. I personally feel like Grovile is cooler. I personally feel like Grovile is just a better Pokemon. I like Subtile. I do, but yeah, okay, fuck it. Yeah, we'll run it. We'll also put Breloom on there, and we are also going to put Cradilly? No. <sighs> Cradilly, why? Cact I think we do Cacturn, Ludicolo, or Shiftry. Okay, I don't know. There's a lot of vocal Cradilly fans. Okay, all right, fine, fine. Fine, 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 fine. I'll put, I'll put Cradilly on there. I... The problem with Cradilly is it's my same problem that I have with Umbreon. It's the same problem that I have with... Um, what's his name? I don't know. Uh, oh, fucking Shuckle. <laughs> it's, it's the same problem. They're annoying. They're annoying to fight. They're annoying to use. And they're just not fun. Wait, if I mute the music, can you guys hear my, my glugging noises? <sighs> can I just get a confirmation on that? Okay, uh, anyways, sorry, back to, <clears throat> back to, wow, Breloom winning, that's crazy. Wait, can you guys actually hear it? <laughs> there was music? Yeah? Is it not loud enough? <laughs> Oh my god, okay. Wow, it was close. It was close when Breloom sneaks it out. That's fine with me. I'm down with that. I like Breloom. That's cool. Grace of the 12 months, by the way. Thank you so much. Member for a year. This is your reminder to get some water and stay hydrated. Been doing that. That's, I've been preaching that since day one. If you're ranking over a thousand things at once, you gotta be prepared. Exactly. Exactly. You can't rank a thousand Pokemon without glugging it up. Been saying that. All right. Wow, this is a shitty fucking... <laughs> Look at this selection. Lebag with the two, thank you, Lebag. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put Manetric in there, and you guys can just like, I don't know, agree with that. <laughs> like, I don't even think we really got to debate that. It's, it's just like Manetric, right? Manetric. Minin or Plusle? That is insane. R Minin, really? Why? Should I, I'm gonna bump up the music a little bit. Why mining? Why specifically mining? Manetric looks awful, bro. I mean, okay, he's not my favorite electric type, but like, mining is silly looking. Yeah, but he's kind of dog. <laughs> like, he's just like, I feel like they're, I don't know. I feel like they're really dumb. And I, and I will not elaborate on that. Like, I, that's pretty much, <laughs> That pretty much sums up my feelings on them. All right, ice type. Woo! I feel like we got to do wall rain. I'm I'm gonna lock wall rain in. You guys, let me know if you're down. Wall rain is so sick, dude. Unironically, probably one of my favorite Gen Three mons. He's just cool. He's just cool. I got nothing else to say about him. You know, uh, I mean, Glalie is also yeah. I mean, I like Glalie. Glalie is also cool, but wall rain is cooler. Wow. Really? We're not we're not doing wall rain? We're not really. Sfeel? I mean I get it. I get it, but over wall rain? Sfeel is cute. Yeah, I mean yeah. No, I I like I'm picking up what you're putting down, I'm stepping what you're smelling in, but like I, it, okay, well, I don't know. It's yes. It's yes. I, I don't know. I, I know we got a huge Sfeel community right now, but it, listen, you're being vaguely represented, <laughs> like loosely. Um, okay, we already did Blaze again. We already did Breloom. Dude, there are some sick fighting types this gen. Pretty pretty much it's Hariyama or Medi Medicum, right? So I think, I don't know. I definitely not Combuskin and definitely not Makuhita. And definitely not Meditite. <laughs> so it actually seems like a lot of Hariyamas. Okay, we'll lock in. Yeah. I actually I actually really like Medicham, but we'll lock in Hariyama. I like Hariyama. 
Wow, these poison types are not giving us a lot to look look at here. This is, I feel like Roselia. Either Roselia or Dustox. Gulpin? No, dude, come on. That has to be a joke, right? That has to be like, you guys are like joshing with me? There's no way. All right, all right, fine. All right, let's, we'll just do the poll. I, I feel like Roselia is the obvious pick. Or, or ah, well, Dustox. Dustox is cool. It's, it's one of those two. Gulpin, Gulpin, you guys, okay. Can we just be honest? Instaviper is all right, I guess. No, no. No, it's, it's one of these three. It's one of these three. I've decided. Now, but be honest with me. And, and listen, we just had a super chat come in that, that summarizes my feelings completely. Thank you, Alice. They said Gulpin D's nuts. Are you guys only picking Gulpin because of the joke? Because if that's the case, I don't think we should pick him. I don't think, like, I just don't think that makes a lot of sense. Personally. Uh, thank you so much, Corey, for the membership. Hopefully you enjoy videos, uh, video, just video. There's more, like, there's uncut. If you go through, there's, like, a member video playlist. I'm sorry, I'm so bad at selling this. It's, like, a member video playlist, and, like, there's a bunch of uncut, uh, like, battles and shit from, like, other, like, bigger videos. Like, like we did, like, a... We did like an invisible battle where like all the Pokemon were invisible in the video that I dropped today. Like I'm gonna take that that full battle and put it out uncut for members. Um, behind the scenes content. Hey, you know what? Hey, help me enjoy it. Thank you for the, all right, plug over. Um, Gulpin is winning. Why is Gulpin winning? Can so, okay, just somebody, anybody in the chat, just give me one valid argument for Gulpin that's not a D's nuts joke, please. Is there more recorder content? Bro, there is so much recorder content and I will absolutely be putting that out for members as well. Okay, it's cute. It's adorable. I disagree. He's adorable. The meme, he looks funny. Gulpin is the reason. Okay. Sure. Purple Cliff said it was purple. That's not... <laughs> he doesn't look very purple to me. Um, okay, he's round. Okay. No, I honestly, the most valid argument that I, I, that I heard from that was the fact that he's round. I like that. I like the simplicity of that. You know what? I, that's all right. I, that's okay. Um, all right, best ground type. Now... To be honest with you, ooh, I don't know. Gee, I think we might have to go Groudon. Dude, but fuck it. I'm sorry, Flygon. We might have to go Flygon, bro. I, I think we got to go Flygon. I think, oh man, that's a tough one. Groudon, like, okay, Groudon is, is cool, but he also could be the legendary, right? But also there's a lot of, no, Rayquaza, fuck. No, yeah, shit. Um... Okay, I'm gonna put Flygon in there. Do you guys agree? I I think Flygon, like Flygon is just one of those Pokemon, man, that like, like everybody loves Flygon. Everybody loves Flygon. It, it's one of those just like classic, consistently good, confident Pokemon designs, right? Like it is just a, and the shiny is amazing. And like, you really like, you just, it is perfection. I'll say it. That, that is about as good as a Pokemon design gets, um, is Flygon. Like, that is like, that, that, it hit the bar. It hit the ceiling, and like, that's kind of, it just f nailed it. 10 out of 10. Um, Groudon looks like a, I don't think so. <laughs> I, I don't even know why I called attention to that. But yeah, I don't, I wouldn't say that personally. Anyways, oh, sh what the fuck? Shadow Lugia is on here? Damn, they got everybody. Okay. I don't know about this. I think, like, Salamence. Well, okay, it depends on Rayquaza, right? Obviously, but, like, it depends on whether we're, like, are we putting, are we putting Rayquaza as our legendary? I think we are, right? If we're putting Rayquaza as our legendary, then I think we do Salamence. Shadow Lugia, I don't, I, I'm gonna put Salamence in there. <laughs> Swellow? No, Swellow is actually, I'm not gonna lie. I was thinking about Swellow. Swellow is a base take. I like Swellow a lot. God, my legs are getting tired. I might have to, I, I didn't plan to sit down for this stream, but the more I'm realizing how long this is gonna take, the more I'm thinking about it. Okay, we're not doing Salamence. Why are we not? Are we real, are we re Well, okay, he could be the dragon type. But like, are we really, are we really doing this right now? Mask or rain? <laughs> you guys really want Shadow Lugia, really? We've already, okay. 
I what even is that is that from XD? I've never even played XD. Okay, all right. We could also do him for psychic. LeBag of the five. Thank you, LeBag. Do you agree polls are not giving us a voice, Frank? Let us vote. All right, all right, all right, fine. Fine, 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 fine. That's that's hey, you know what? That it is what it is. It is what it is. Shadow Lugia. And we'll put fucking Swallow in there, because that's funny. And uh, we'll put Masquerain. I don't even know why we're doing this poll. And we'll do Masquerain. No, and then we'll, we'll put Alter Alteria. is cool. It's pretty much between Alteria and Shadow Lugia. I, I don't... I don't know, Chief. Like, Shadow Lugia looks cool, but, like... Maybe it's just because I never played XD, so, like, I don't really... I don't really know the vibe, right? Like, I don't really know what he's up to. I just don't- I just don't really get like what he's- like what is he doing on the weekends? You know, it just doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. Alright. <sighs> yep, that's alright. Alright, yeah, that's fine. We'll do Shadow Lugia. That is a-okay. I mean, listen, not my list, right? I really feel like- well, also wait! What about Tropius? Well, it's too late now. I would- I think- I think we should have gone Tropius. <laughs> Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's hard. It's so hard. Okay. Uh, we got- Oh, wait! Oh my god, they- They added- I didn't realize they added unknown forms! Yo! I actually had no idea they did that. I thought- I thought it was all Gen 2. Wait, that's crazy! We, guys, we might have to go unknown. We might have to go unknown. I'll say we might- I'll, Okay, I'll put unknown question mark for sure is the better one. I'll put unknown question mark in there. I, I feel like, unironically, that's my vote. Um, okay, who else do we put? I mean, Metagross, obviously, right, is a contender. Um, okay, if you guys had to pick, Latios or Latios? Just pick one. I can't put both. Latios or Latios? One of the two. Deoxys Attack? Okay, maybe, actually. Latios? I'm seeing a lot of Os. Os? A lot of Os, too. Damn it. Fuck, this is hard. Oh, no, no Latios. Okay, let's go Latios. Latios, Latios. Ladi, Ladios. I, I would probably say Ladios too. Anyways, okay, and then we have one more slot. Honestly, man, it's a, it's a tough one. I feel like, yeah, like either Gardevoir. Gardevoir, yeah, okay. I've seen a lot of Gardevoirs. We'll lock that in. I, I could, like, listen, Deoxys could also be in this, but... That's a tough one. That's a tough one. I, I feel like with that, like, no one's really winning, to be honest. Um, I'm going to see, if I pull this chair over, I'm going to see if I can actually sit down. I don't know why I didn't think about... Actually, wait, I'm just going to get a stool. Okay, you guys, just once again, continue to vote, and I will keep talking to you guys. It might break up, but I'm going to grab a stool real quick. Okay. Okay, yep, got the stool. All right. I literally... I did not expect this to be the longest stream of my career. Metagross is winning. Okay. Honestly, that... That makes sense. That makes sense. I'm not even going to complain about that because that just that just kind of makes sense. I feel like Unknown was the sleeper pick, but, you know, it, it is what it is. All right, Metagross. We'll go ahead and lock that in. Wow, it was actually kind of close, though. Shockingly close. All right, bug types. What are we thinking here? Um... <laughs> Unironically, Claydol. Claydol is also cool. Listen, but here's the thing. We're not... Shuckle. Guys, he's not... Maybe... Okay, wait. I, clearly there's like a... Miscommunication or something, because he is not here. Like, I... None of these Pokemon are Shuckle. Which I just think is weird, because you guys are really... Like, I just don't really... <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Let's put Ninjask, right? Let's take this seriously, guys. Terra Bug. Guy, he's not a Gen 3 Mon. We're, we're just looking at... I, I understand you guys are really macro-focused, right? But, like, we're just looking at Gen 3 right now. Um, let's go ahead and focus that up. Armaldo, absolutely. I, I see that. I see that. Uh, and fuck it. We'll put... We'll put Volbeat in there. <laughs> I... I, what I will say, you know, I've never really had strong opinions about Volbeat and Illumis besides the fact that they're both really fucking mid. Um, but I, but, you know, after like closely examining them, I can confidently say 
that Volbeat is significantly worse than a Lumis. I like, I don't know if that's a crazy thing to say. Like normally, like most people just kind of group them together and say they're both bad. And, th and they are both bad, but Volbeat is so much worse. Like Illumis is kind of actually okay. All right, Ninjask. I actually feel like Armaldo would have been my vote. I think Armaldo's cool. He's got a good vibe. Um, oh, okay. Well, we could have added a second chance at Armaldo, but I guess not. I think um, not Cradilly. I'm gonna I'm gonna put Agron in there and just see if you guys vibe with it. I yeah no we're not. I don't think I could put Cradilly in here with a straight face. I put Cradilly in there. I think it just upsets everybody, and everybody being me. You clicked Armaldo. Oh shit! Oh shit! Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's Ninjask. Okay, well, Agron obviously wins. Agron obviously wins Rock. Agron for Steel. Okay, what are the Steel options? Oh no! I mean, ah, it's too late. It's too late. It's too late. We already did the poll. We already did the poll. We already did the poll. It is what it is. Okay, next up we got Ghost. Uh, I don't know, Chief. I think Sableye. Sableye? We down for Sableye? Shedinja? Okay, 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 okay. Okay, all right. God, you guys, I didn't realize you guys are such big Shedinja fans. All right, fine, fine, fine. Let's just, Sableye or Shedinja? I'll just put the pull up. I mean, man, you guys are very passionate about... I didn't expect such a loud response for... I mean, it's, God, it's just a fucking ghost type. <laughs> it's just a Gen 3 ghost type. Bayonet, oh, Bayonet also fucks. I didn't even see, I didn't even see him there. Bayonet actually might have been my pick. I don't know. God, this is so hard. I didn't expect this to be so hard. Okay, well, it looks like Shinja won that. So we'll go ahead and lock that in. Listen, the poll is final, so we just rock that. All right. Uh, ooh, this is a tough one. Okay, I... Shogun's there. I don't know if you guys can see him. I think... <sighs> Okay, well, so if we're doing Rayquaza for Legendary, we have to do Salamence. We have to do Salamence, right? Am I crazy for saying that? We have to do Salamence. Because we're doing Rayquaza for Legendary. And we already did fly. Didn't we already do Flygon? We already did Flygon. So, okay, yeah. I'm, I'll put Salamence, and I'll, I guess I'll put Altaria on there. And then I'll put, we, we said Latios is better than Latios, right? So we'll put Latios on there. I, I feel like, Sa like Sal, like Sal, it has to be Salamence. Like Latios is, is, you know, well, they're all good, right? They're all good. It's hard to pick, but you can't, you can't do a favorite Gen 3 Pokemon list without Salamence. Like it's just disrespectful. Okay. Yeah. That's, that's what, that's what I thought. Okay, cool. Dark types. Uh, we could bring Sableye back. I feel like Absol though, right? Absol. I mean, I'll just, we'll just lay it down. We'll lay down the brickwork. I feel like, right. I mean, like, I guess you have Sharpedo, which is also an option. Might, no, 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 not Mightyena. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absol is the clear choice. Nice leaf. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. I got to use the restroom. It's an emergency. <laughs> yeah, right. With his nipple have an ass. Absolutely not. All right, cool. I'm down for Absol. Uh, Steel, what do we got? Uh, yo, call me crazy. I'll move out of the way. Call me crazy, Matang. <laughs> call me crazy, call me crazy. You guys are gonna be like, oh, Frank, you're being so crazy right now. Matang, 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 come on. I propose we do Matang, personally. Ma Listen, I like Mawile just as much as the next guy. I like Jirachi just as much as the next guy. We already put Agron, we already did Metagross. I think we rock Matang. I'm gonna say Matang. I just think he's got, um, you know, I don't know. He's got a lot of things going for him. Two hands. He can float and shit, which I think is interesting. He's got spikes. Wow, it is like not even close. <laughs> it's like not even, 
<laughs> okay, wait, we're not, we can't do Reggie Steel. Come on. We, we, we do Jirachi over Reggie Steel nine out of 30 times, which I'm realizing that percentage is not really that great. It, it's like most of the time. Okay, 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 okay. Fine, 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 fine. fine. Let's, let's just, let's just, okay. Jirachi, I'm not putting Reggie Steel. Jirachi, Mawile. And okay, fine, fine. I'll put Reggie Steel. I'll put Reggie Steel. I I feel like Jirachi cle like Jirachi clears. Well, no, okay. Out of these three, Mawile clears. But out of the two legendary, it, it, it's very simple. Mawile, Jirachi, Reggie Steel. Reggie Steel, so mm -mm -mm, no. <laughs> Jirachi's so much cooler. Reggie Steel is just a big fucking, big fucking doofus. Reggie Steel looks like he just shit his pants and he's like really embarrassed about it. He's like standing in the doorway like, mom, I threw up. Like, no, <laughs> come on. Come on, dude. All right, yeah, looks like Jirachi's clearing. Damn, I do a pretty good Reggie Steel. <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, yeah, Drachi. Sounds like a plan. That's that's fine. That's actually okay with me. I'm actually all right with that. Fairy type. Oh, we can put Gardevoir on this one. We can also put Mawile. Ah, uh, I think I go Gardevoir here, personally. I think I go. I not. It's not like a sexual thing. I know you guys are immediately gonna say that because it. I mean, it's just every time. Like you can't even mention Gardevoir anymore without it being weird. It's like actually a problem. Um, Frank, no one said it was. <laughs> no, I, okay, don't make it out to be like, I'm the cause. No, no, no. Trust me, I didn't have to say anything. I could have just been dead silent. I could have just left and there would have been somebody, like I'm not the weird one. Like I just, I'm just getting ahead of the weirdness. Okay. All right, by the way, once again, I'll reiterate, I don't agree with it. I just don't. I, ju I just think it's ridiculous. All right, starter. Um, I will say this is the hardest starter decision we will have this entire stream. Um, these are the best starters in the entire series, objectively speaking. Like it, it is, it is, I cannot even tell you how hard of a decision it is between like Swampert, Sceptile, and Blaze again. Like they are all so fucking good. Um, I, I like literally, I don't even know what to, I don't even, okay, let, let's narrow it down, right? The ones that we're not putting in the poll are Marsh Tomp. We're not putting Marsh Tomp in there. We're also not putting Combuskin, for sure. So that eliminates two. I think we also need to eliminate Trico. Also, wait, yeah, we already did, wait, actually, wait, what did we do? We already did Grow Ball Blaze again and Mudkip. Okay, so yeah, we can't vote, we, 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 can't, we can't have duplicates. So I guess the only options are, well, I guess, okay, Swampert, right? Swampert, how about this? Let's just keep it simple. Swampert, Blaze again, or Sceptile? Or no, we already did Blaze again. <laughs> we already did Blaze again. <laughs> so I guess we'll do Dorchick. Swampert clears. Yeah, okay, this got really complicated. We'll just put, okay. I'm just gonna leave it at that. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it at that. I thought this was gonna be easy, but no. All right, I yeah, Swampert does clear. I mean, okay, if we're including the other ones in this, like if we were excluding duplicates, right? Like this might be a conversation, but yeah, it's very clearly Swampert. Okay, cool. Coolio, wow, Subtile's actually pretty close. I Subtile does fuck. It, as I said, it's hard. It's a really hard decision. All right, now we got fairy. What fairy types? Or no, sorry. No, we got me megas and shit. Oh my God. Okay, this is going to be hard. I think Mega Rayquaza, right? Well, um, no, 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 no. Because we Mega Rayquaza, it's not going to be in the like, ah, so hard. No, okay, okay. Mega Sableye is my pick. Ah, shit. Okay, keep in mind. So Mega Rayquaza is not like the, the these are just the forms. So they're not going to be like, you're not going to be able to pick Mega Rayquaza for the legendary, right? So I think my, my favorite Mega of all time is Mega Sableye. So I, I have to go Mega Sableye, but I would say, oh, and Mega Absol. Fuck. Okay. God, all my favorite Megas are here. 
I'm saying Mega Sableye, I'm saying Mega Absol, and I'm saying Mega Rayquaza. But I understand that it might not be that simple for other people, considering, you know, we got we got a lot of great options here. Um, okay, just type type what you guys want to see in the poll, and I'll just I'll just put them in. I think Mega Ray is like an obvious one. Um Sceptile Kyogre. Okay, we'll do we'll do Kyogre. I, I I don't I don't hate that. I don't hate that. I'll put Mega Sableye in there because it, it is objectively my favorite and I fucking love him and he's so great with Magic Bounce. Uh, and we will put Mawile. Ah, no, we'll do... Ah, no, Absol already won. Absol already won a category. We'll put Mawile in there. We'll put Mawile in there. God, I literally... I, I will say, I did not expect this. <laughs> we'll have for two hours. Okay. We're actually... I feel like we're not... No, we are, whew. we got a ways to go. We got a ways to go. Looks like a Mega Ray is clearing, okay. Sounds like a plan, that's totally cool with me. Uh, yeah, just go ahead and wrap that up, keep it simple. I mean, it is It is just objectively, like, I mean, just look at him, bro. Honestly, he's so fucking cool. Only six more gens to go, okay, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna pick up the pace. Um, legendary, okay, how, how about this? Just so I don't have to make a poll, I'm gonna, I'm saying Rayquaza. I'm saying Rayquaza. Just type yes. <laughs> Just type yes if you agree. <laughs> Reggie Rock. No? No? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, fuck. I should've just made a poll. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fine, fine. I'll make the poll. I'll make the poll. This is so hard to navigate. Right, there's no shot you're saying Reggie Rock right now. Come the fuck on. Are you serious? In a, in a league with Kyogre, in a league with Groudon, in a league with Latios and Latios and Rayquaza and Deoxys, you're saying Reggie Rock. Un, un, un. You, you guys, I, I'm realizing you guys, this is interesting, something I'm, I'm realizing with you guys, you guys prioritize the vibe over the truth. And I just think that's interesting. I just think that's interesting. Um, okay, who are we putting in this poll? <laughs> I guess, all right, fine. I'll put Reggie Rock for some unholy reason. Uh, we already ruled out Rayquaza. I'll put Groudon, I guess. I'll put Kyogre and I will put Deoxys Defense <laughs> because, because someone said Deoxys Defense. I don't, I don't see how Deoxys Defense wins this. Then again, I don't see how Reggie Rock fucking wins this. That's insane. That's crazy. <laughs> really? Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Red. Oh, no, wait, Kyogre. Wait. Hold up. Hold up. It's close. It's close. Hang on. Okay. No, you know what? It's Kyogre. It's Kyogre. Yep. That's it. That's it. That's it. Hey, thanks for voting, guys. Honestly, I, I fuck with that. That's a base take. All right. Now, what is the best of these? What is the best of these? I, man, I wish I could. I'm just going to like move off camera. <laughs> rigged? What do you mean rigged? It's a fucking, it's a, you guys voted. Listen, if you like Reggie Rock that much, why don't you marry him? All right, that was dumb. Um, all right, best of these. Let's see, Mudkip, Absol, Flygon, okay. And we need a fourth, 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 Salamence. All right, personally, I don't, I don't know, Chief. I'd probably say Mega Ray out of all these. Yeah, I'd probably say Mega Ray, but you know, it's up to you guys. Uh, thank you for the super chat. Thank you for the super chat, Shawnee. Mm -hmm. Appreciate that. I just feel like, like, okay, yeah, the sound effect is funny, but like, why? <laughs> you know? As I said, this is gonna become our community flag. So I think it's vitally important that we we really think about and we really take the time to consider all options, you know? Mudkip, okay. That is, that is A-OK. -okay. That is fine with me. Honestly, I'm very okay with that. All right, Gen 4. I'm excited for Gen 4. We got some bangers in Gen 4. Um, normal type. Now, keep in mind, I don't think it's feasible to save some of these Pokemon for the legendary slot, because when I tell you guys, 
like there are so many goaded fucking legendaries in this game. It's actually insane. Um, all right, I'm gonna say Star Raptor. I okay, like B Doof. Listen, I get the joke, right? It's like B Doof, ha, ah, like he's cool and he's funny. No, <laughs> no, Star Raptor is the clear pick. The it's so clear. It like could not be more clear. And like maybe you guys like maybe there's like some precipitation on your glasses, right? Like maybe. You guys need to go licky licky. Okay, I can't even believe some people are saying that. That's a that's insane. Licky licky, that's actually unhinged. Lopany is also unhinged because I know your motives. Um, Reggie Gigas, I like Reggie Gigas, I do. But slow start. Okay, wow, we're really doing this right now. Munchlax. Okay, Munchlax is actually I fuck with Munchlax. That's a, that's a good take. I like Munchlax. I don't think I'd pick it, but I I get it. Iggly buff is insane. Okay, all right, all right. Let's just Reggie Gigas. Um, I'll put Arceus in there. No, because Arceus is probably gonna be the legendary. Okay, never mind. No, I'm, well, maybe not. I'll, I'll put Arceus in there. I'll put B Doof in there, but I, I feel like personally, I'll put Porygon Z. I personally feel like voting B Doof is cringe. I'll, I'll say it. I'll say it. I, you know, not a lot of people are brave enough to say what I'm about to say, but I think it's kind of cringe. Like, Bidoof is, as I said, it's a, it's a good Pokemon. It's fine. It's fine. It's cool. Uh, you know, like, I get it. And it's like a big, big joke or, or like a meme. I don't know. Like, people fuck with him for some reason. And like, I, I get it, right? But to say that he is the best of these options, like, I understand fucking with Bidoof. I understand being a Bidoof fan. I look at Bidoof and I say, yeah, you know what? That'd get me out of bed in the morning. I like that. That and I that I enjoy that. But to say that he's the best out of Star Raptor, like he he's in the same league as I just don't think we're considering all options here, but it's okay. It's all right. I'm like, I'm getting weirdly uncomfortable with this being my banner, but you know, it's it is what it is. Um, okay, Infernape. Actually, based. <laughs> Base take? <laughs> Monferno fucks. I'm sick of people saying Monferno doesn't fuck. He fucks. How are we feeling about Monferno? I'm thinking Monferno. He's cool. He's raw, dude. He's really raw. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm gonna... Okay, I'm losing this. I'm losing this battle, but... I'm telling y'all, you guys would be... You guys would go up, like, 10 levels of coolness in my book if we went with Monferno right now. Like, I would be, like, three levels happier. I just think that'd be so rad. All right, it's okay. Yeah, you know, it's I understand. People have different opinions. I get it, right? Um, all right, how are we feeling about Infernape? How are we feeling about Infernape? I also feel like Heatran is also in the running. I like Heatran, right? Heatran, Heatran is, like, all right. He's, like, cool. Um, not, like, I mean, I'm not, like, you know, doing backflips for him, but, like, I'm, I'm having a good time. I'd give him a drink, you know, and we'd hang out. We'd chill by the poolside and talk about life. Um, all right, Infernape is a clear winner. That is exciting. Rotom Heat, you see, I also do like Rotom Heat, but as I said, like, I think what, what we're missing here is like, you guys gotta be more cutthroat, right? You gotta be more objective, you gotta be more decisive because the problem is, you know, you're looking at this this lineup and you're like, oh, I like Float, so I like Empoleon, I like Gastra, I like Rotom Wash, I like Polkia, there's so many Pokemon that I like. And like, I get that, I get that. Like, I'm the same way. But, but, we need to make decisive decisions. We need to be deliberate. We need to say not what Pokemon are good, not even what Pokemon are great. We need to say what Pokemon are bangers. What Pokemon comes home and, and is maybe with your wife and you're getting concerned about maybe some sort of infidelity situation. Like we need the Pokemon that are gonna steal and, and commit crime. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so Empoleon is obviously on the list, right? Uh, we'll throw Polkia on there. I think Polkia is in the running. Um, which, okay, which Gastrodon, though? Actually, I feel like it's very clear. It is obviously West form. And then I'm putting Floatzel on there um, because I love Floatzel. Floatzel is actually my, probably my, gen, my favorite Gen 4 Pokemon. Anyways, yeah, are we, are we doing, we, we got to do West Form with Gastrodon, right? I mean, that's not even a conversation. 
No Piplup? Bro, I mean, as I said, it's a stacked bracket, okay? It's a lat. Do you see this league right now? Like, we are in the top Sinnoh tiers. Gastrodon West form is actually crushing. That's hype. That's hype. Anyways, thank you, Jonathan, for the five. Appreciate it. Napoleon is easily the best water, but Frank reminds me of Gastron for some reason. I'm okay with that. I was going to disagree with that, but I'm okay with that. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I get what you're saying. I do fuck with Piplup. I even fuck with Primplup, to be honest, but... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, we're going to go Gastron. I like Gastron. He's cool. I As I said, I would go Floatzel. I would go Floatzel, personally, because Floatzel is just... I love Floatzel so much. He's just so fucking cool, but... Um, I, I understand, like, as I said, it's a stacked bracket, right? There really was no wrong answer there. East clears. Okay. That was the wrong answer. Anybody who perform or who, anyone who prefers East form is actually insane. West form goes so undeniably hard. Anyways. All right. Who are we putting here? We'll put, we'll put Tara in there. We'll put Mr. Tort. Uh, we'll also put shame and fly is actually, that's a, that's a sick pick. I, I like shame and fly a lot. That goes hard. Leafeon, I'm okay. <laughs> it's actually crazy you say that because I disagree. <laughs> let's put let's put Wormadam in there just for vibes. Wormadam and normal Shaman. Ah, no, Shaman Fly is cooler. Tangrowth. Ah, hey, God, this is a hard one. As as I said though, guys, we're not we're not looking at the greats. We're looking at the the goats. Sabadam with the member, thank you. Appreciate that. Hopefully you enjoy uh, more videos, member exclusive videos. Roserade, oh, Roserade is cool. Okay. God, this is so hard, man. I'm like, I'm like literally, I can't even believe how ridiculously hard this is. <laughs> I was like, I was like, yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. You know, it'll be, it'll be all right. I'll be chilling. I'm sure it'll be, you know, I, there's like gotta be some clear winners here, but like even like, even taking the community aspect out of it, like if I was just sitting here, Torterra does does run that. I feel like Torterra could have played in the ground league, but that's all right. Um, yeah, like even even if I was doing this on my own, I think I would really struggle. Alice with the membership, thank you so much. Hopefully you enjoy the vibes. Check out the member video playlist. <laughs> Anyways, all right, what are we thinking for electric? This is gonna be brutal. This is gonna be a fucking massacre. <laughs> Uh, what is with the, why is Pichu here? What the hell is that? Okay, we're not, we're not including Pichu. That's, that's a, that's a terrible idea. I feel like, wait, should we, should we just do Rotom? No, 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 that'd be, that'd be disrespectful. We have to include Luxray. Um, okay, if you guys had, if you guys had to pick one Rotom form, you only get one, you only get one Rotom. What are we thinking? I'll throw Electivire on there. Um, wash, wash, yeah, wash goes hard. Base, that is based. I actually fuck with regular Rotom too. I've seen a lot of wash. Okay, we'll do Rotom wash. I kind, I kind of agree with that. Yeah, I mean, I feel like for me, it, it's either ah, uh, it's so hard, man. It's probably between wash or, or the fan one. And then you know what? For for a little bit of a yeah, we'll put we'll put, we'll put a Magnezone for a little bit of a little offshoot there. Right, let's get some variety in there. Let's start mixing it up. Dude, I feel like I need like, you guys You guys know like those five hour energies they sell at the convenience store? I feel like I need like six of those. <laughs> Just like injected straight into my eyeballs. Have you guys ever had a five hour energy? I've never had one, but I've heard, well, I've heard mixed things. I feel like it, it seems really, it seems really bad for you, honestly. Like from the outside looking in, it does not seem like a good idea. Uh, Rotom Wash is looking like the lead. We need 30 hours of energy. Yeah, exactly. I, I heard they stack, right? I heard it's like a compound effect. Like, what does it even taste? I kind of want to try it just to, like, what does it taste like? Is it, does it taste good? I don't know. Anyways, uh, Rotom Wash is clearing. I'm sure Luxray is right behind. Yeah, but it's looking like Wash is the winner. I probably would have gone Luxray over Wash personally, but I get it. I get it. Wouldn't recommend. Yeah. Uh, 
All right, so we go on Mammoth Swine. I feel like we gotta go, I mean, oh man, that's a tough one too. Like Frostlass. Mm, okay, let's just do Mammoth, uh, Weavile's also good, fuck. <laughs> okay, Weavile, Mammoth Swine, and we'll do Frostlass. A and Obama Snow. Obama Snow is also very cool. This is a tough one. It, these are all tough ones, man. Gen 4 is just so hard. Gen, Gen 4? Yeah, Gen 4 is tough, man. I don't know. Rotom Fridge? No. We we already, we already like, Rotom Wash winning that last segment already kind of just put Rotom Fridge in the, in the, in the trash. Um, out of all of these, I probably would say Mammoth Swine. Probably. Hypothetically speaking, yeah, I, I think I agree with you guys there. I, I honestly, I didn't really fuck with Weavile until um, until Pokémon Tournament, and then he became my main, and then I and then I started fucking with him more. I was like, yeah, I see the appeal, I see what he's packing. Um, okay, so Infernape we already, yeah, Infernape we've already done, so we can't do Infernape. I think Lucario, right? I mean, it's kind of, I mean, I know it's like the basic answer, but like, of course. Right? Of course we do Lucario. Lucario is one of those Pokemon where it's like, I, I keep Lucario in the same tier that I keep Flygon, where it is just peak, it is just peak Pokemon. It is just peak, but like you can't really compete with, it's just fucking sick, man. Um, Yeah, I mean, listen, we also got some, we got some other, oh, whoopsies. We got some other bangers in here, right? I mean, like Toxicroak and Gallade are, are all, I mean, all of them. Really, I mean, all of them are bangers. But as I said, we're not looking for bangers. We're looking for bangers. You know what I mean? Anyways, uh, okay. We, we could do Toxicroak. If you guys like Toxicroak, we could do Toxicroak here. Even though I, I think here, I think we have to go Roserade. Or no, did we already go Roserade? No, no, no. I think we go Roserade. Toxicroak. Or, yeah, Drapion's also cool. Okay, all right. Shit, this is... <laughs> I did not expect this to be so hard. I'll put Roserade, Toxicroak, and then we'll throw, um, we'll throw Drapion in there. And then for the vibes, we'll throw Budu. I don't know. I, I I could see him pulling it out. I could see it. I could see it like a clutch last minute buzzer beater. There was a half court shot. I could see it. I could see. He's got, he's got that. He's got that in him, you know? Wow, it's actually close. Toxicroak is edging it out. Insane. I didn't think he'd be edging like that. Oh, okay. Wait, no. Yeah, wait. Drapion, Toxicroak, kind of neck and neck. If neck and neck meant not very neck and neck. At, well, no, they're kind of neck and neck. They're getting there. I'm surprised Budu's out of the race. Or sorry, Boo. Please don't spam chaos. Okay, yeah. Toxicroak, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm okay with that. No complaint. I probably would have said Roserade, honestly. I, out of all of those, I'd probably go Roserade over anything else. But <sighs> do you guys... Okay, based on the decisions we've made so far, do you guys think we're we're representing the community well? I don't know. Some of these decisions, I don't think we are. I'll say it. Some of some of these are questionable. But here's the here's the thing, right? With like a conglomerate voting system like this, is we're never ever like no no individual person is going to be able to. Oh my god, Gliscor fucks so heavy, but also Garchomp is in this shit. Um. No individual person is going to be able to fully agree with it, right? It's not, but also it's not really about that. It, it's it's a conglomerate for a reason, which I think is cool. Anyways, yeah, Gliscor and Garchomp. I feel like, I feel like those are like the picks. Jonathan with the two. Thank you, Jonathan. Gliscor has ended Garchomp's competitive career. Isn't Garchomp like RU now? That's insane. I'll throw I'll throw Rhyperior on there for the boys. I I feel like Garchomp kind of has to win this. And I'll put Hapowdon. Um, I kind of like which one. Which one's like the all gray one? Is that the male one or female one? I don't know. Is that the female? That'll be the female one. I'll say female. Yeah. Okay. Cool. 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 Um. Yeah. I don't know. I think. I think it's yeah. Oh, Gliscor is so fucking cool, man. But I, I think you have to go Garchomp. Unless we go Garchomp for the dragon, we go Garchomp for dragon, and then we do well. We can also do Gliscor for flying, right? I think Gliscor for flying makes sense. God, this is the hardest decision we've ever had to make. But okay, yeah, it's looking like, it's looking like Gliscor just barely edges it out. That's crazy. I, I mean, I'm assuming we, we go Garchomp for Dragon. 
Which that may, no, okay, wait, actually, I'm sorry. We have to go Staraptor. Guys, Orion Mega, fuck. <laughs> okay, okay, no, like, that almost fell over. Staraptor, Staraptor, Staraptor. I, this, this is a packed league. We have a lot of all-stars. We got LeBron. We got Michael Jordan. We got Shaq. We got a lot of options here. But, ah, man, we gotta go. We have, there's no way we go through this and we don't have Straptor on here. Like, I just don't think that's acceptable. I, I don't know. Listen, as I said, not my list. Um, I'll throw... Rotom? No. <laughs> Do you see this league right now? Do you see this league? You want me to put Shaman on there again? Male Combi. Okay. Okay, let's do let's do Shaman and then we'll do Mel Combi. <laughs> I don't listen, I like Honchcrow. I do, but I don't I don't think and I like Driplum too, and I love Togekiss. Like these are these these are all really phenomenal Pokemon, but they are not Staraptor. Right? Staraptor. We just go Staraptor. I mean, it's honestly, it's between Staraptor and Yanmega. Like, let's be honest with ourselves. That is the competition right now. Honchcrow robbed. Listen, I love Honchcrow. I think he's great. I think he, I think he, you know, he vibes and he fucks and he, he's got, he's got great energy about him, but I just, I don't know. We have to go. There's no way we do this. We don't have Staraptor on there. We just can't. All right, so we're going Cresselia, obviously, right? Clear, clear choice. Really not concerned about it. I'll go ahead and drop the poll real quick. You guys go and get those votes in. Um, I actually feel like that makes sense, personally. It's it's just like you look at Cresselia and you think, wow, that is just great A, one of the best Pokemon designs of our time. Um, really cool boss fight in Legends Arceus that wasn't annoying at all. Uh, really great time. Gallade? No. Really? Stop. Bronze, actually Bronzong is based. I, yeah, no, Gallade, right? I don't even think we have to, yeah, Gallade for sure. Okay, cool. I don't even think we have to pull that one. Um, All right. Okay, Yanmega, Yanmega, we still have a chance. We still have a chance? Mime Jr. <laughs> Mime Jr., are you for real? Okay, all right, fuck it, we'll run it, we'll run it, we'll run it. You want Mime Jr.? The pre-evo to one of the worst fucking Pokemon in Gen 1. Okay, that's fine, dude. We'll run it. We'll run it. Do you agree? Do you agree? Now, keep in mind, you're picking this over Gallade. Do you guys remember him in the Dark Ride movie? He was like, Gallade, go. I was like, Gallade. <laughs> Come on, guys. His iconic line. His, his, his iconic role in the, in the hit 2008 film. Which, by the way, Rise of Dark Rye, that movie came out 30 years ago. How fucking insane is that? Okay, we're going back to Gallade. You guys got you guys got good wits about you. I I if someone could correct me, I'm pretty sure it was 2008. It wasn't, it might be 2010. It might be 2010. I don't know. It's been so long and it makes me feel so old. Okay. Yan Mega, right? Please just give me Yan Mega. Don't you dare, because I know. Wait, it's 2007? Shut the fuck up, man. Wait, if it was 2007, that means that it was 16... Am I doing that math right? 16 years ago? Brother. Wait, I'm not doing that math right. There's no fucking way. Jonathan with it. No, guys, we can't. I'm not going... Here's the problem. Here's the problem. I'm I noticing... Almost fell the chair. That's insane. Thank you, Jonathan. I'm noticing a pattern. You guys are picking Pokemon just based on the memes. You're like, ha ha ha, Krikatoon makes the funny noise. Let's go with that one. No, no. By the way, let me just clarify. These, these jokes, these memes, they've been in the Pokemon community for, since its inception, right? And I just feel like it's about time we move on. Right? Like, we gotta create new jokes. Why don't we create a funny bit about Yan Mega? <laughs> right? Like, maybe he commits tax fraud or something. Like, that'd be funny. Like, and, and like, now we can jokingly vote Yan Mega. We're like, ha ha ha, he didn't pay his taxes. How funny is that? 
I just, I just think it's, you know, it, we can, we got to grow. We got to move on. Hunter, thank you for the gifty. Shout out to Jacob for being the birthday boy. Hopefully you enjoy your uh, member exclusive videos. By the way, uh, okay, we are going on mega, right? Okay, cool. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. What are we doing with these? I think we got to go Rampardos, right? Bonsley? No. No, no. Probopass? No. <laughs> wow. There, okay, there's actually a shocking amount of... I'm Really? Bonsley? I mean, I don't feel super strongly about any of these Pokemon, so... I guess we'll just... I, I, I don't know. I feel like Probopass Pass is kind of dog ass. I'll say it. Like, I, I know what Pokemon I wouldn't do. I Probopass Pass would not be making my cut. Frank, you look like Probopass. Pass. Brother? <laughs> do you wanna do you wanna like meet outside? We can we can we can yo, we can blow this pop stand. We can go, we can fucking we can run it. Like, we don't got to stay around, you know? Um, There's a nice parking lot. It's a great looking parking lot. Fantastic. No one's there. Great time to be serving up knuckle sandwiches. Um, okay, Rampardos. That is fine. Bro, wait, so someone, someone could literally make a times Frank has threatened the viewers <laughs> counter. And I, I think it's at four. I think it's at four or five in this two and a half hour live stream. <laughs> Oh fuck, this is gonna be hard. Okay, um, I here's my thing. Here's my thing. Garatina clears. Garatina absolutely clears. But if we're gonna do Garatina for legendary, I well, but also too like Garatina clears so heavy that we might even want to save the legendary spot for like Arceus. Right? If we go Garatina here, then we, then we can go Arceus. I don't know. Uh, or people are saying Spiritomb. I like Spiritomb, but Garatina is... Garatina just fucks so hard. It's insane. And I'm not even... I'm going to say Origin Form, uh, which is the Snake Form, which, which is, like, objectively better. Okay. And I'll put Miss Magius on there. I like. I actually really like Miss Magius. I think if, if I wasn't going with Garatina, I'd be going Miss Magius, I think. They're all they're all good. It's hard. It's hard. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna lay on the floor for a second while you guys vote. Okay, nope, the votes are over. I'm just gonna I'll stay where I'm at. <sighs> Not enough love. No, I, man. I mean, it's hard. I like Driplum too. Driplum is Driplum has a vibe about him. But yeah, Garatina's the obvious play. Dragon. Oh, Primal Dialga's on this. Oh shit. Okay. Oh man, this is hard. <laughs> I, I feel like you have to... Okay, well, it just, it just... Okay. Ah, this is hard. This is hard. It just depends on what we're putting in our legendary slot, right? I think it, I think it's between Garchomp and Dialga, personally. We already... We, we're not... I, I feel like it's dumb to do Garatina twice. Let's just... Okay, I'm going to put Garchomp in there because it, it, we can't... We can't go through Sinnoh and not have Garchomp, right? So, do you agree? I feel like Garchomp is like... I mean, I love Dialga, I love Palkia, but like... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's alright with me. I think... Oh god, we go Darkrai. We absolutely go Darkrai. We got Drapion over there. I think we go Darkrai. I don't even think we have to really talk about it. Darkrai is so fucking cool, man. Right? Can we just agree on that? I, I I don't even think. Weavile? No. Come on. Come on. Be fucking for real. Be fucking for real. Have you seen Darkrai? Honchkrow? I like Honchkrow. I love Darkrai. I, like, you gotta think, okay, what Pokemon would I take a bullet for? I ain't taking a bullet for Honchkrow. I'll tell you that right now. N absolutely not. <laughs> not taking a bullet for Weavile. Nope. Not taking a bullet for Spiritomb. Nope. Darkrai, I think about it. Anyways, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm down with that. Next up, we got Steel. Oh, we could do Dialga for Steel. We already did Lucario. Uh, we already did Empoleon. Yeah, I, th I think we do Dialga for Steel. Am I crazy? We do Dialga for Steel. For sure. Right? 
Bron Bronzong? Really? We're not... Guys, come on. Stop playing. Stop playing around. Stop, stop fuck. stop. You're fuck. you're fucking me. <laughs> okay, no, that's... Not like that. You're fucking with... Sorry, there's a with that I just missed in there. You're fucking with me. <laughs> no. Yeah, Dialga. Okay, cool. Hey, yo. Yeah, no, no, absolutely not. Worma, okay, Worma Dam, would, that would have been funny. We only have two fairy types. Um, we know, we know, right? We know the answer. We know, we know. We know. Guys, no, no, no. There's like an uncomfortable amount of Mime Jr. Why, why the Mime Jr.? It, he's so mid. He's so unbelievable. I'll listen. I'll put the pull up, but like, just like, just like, come on, like, just. I'm asking you to simply consider the facts, right? Togekiss has Aura Sphere. He's got uh, wings. He's got a cool. He's got. He's immune to ground type moves. Right? Like, are we really considering all the facts here? And it looks like we are. Cool. Um, rigged, if not. Yeah, no, Mime Jr. does not deserve this spot. You, I'm, I'm sorry, there's like some drug use potentially involved. Like, Mime Jr., it just, he's so... All right, best starter. So we've already done Torterra. We've already done Empoleon. We did Infernape too, right? Oh, no, we didn't do Empoleon. Oh, shit. Okay, so Empoleon has to be on the roster. I'll throw Piplup on there too. I know a lot of people are feeling Piplup. So we'll do, yeah, Piplup. I feel like Empoleon, Monferno, yeah, Monferno Fox. I I would maybe I would maybe go Monferno, I think. I would maybe go Monferno. And fuck it. We'll just we'll put Primplup on there too. <laughs> we'll put the whole the whole line. We'll put the, <laughs> it's the entire Piplup line, and then <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna shit my pants. Is the entire <laughs> sorry, it's the water coming back up. The entire Piplup line, and then Monferno. I I actually feel like oh god, I don't know. I feel like Mon. Mm, no, I'm Polyon. I gotta go on Polyon. Turtwig beats them all. No, he doesn't. Come on, be for real. Be for real. We didn't do Empoleon for water, a better win. Yeah, I, I feel like Empoleon, man, people really like Piplup. Okay. I, I mean, I, I get it, I guess. I mean, I probably would have gone Empoleon, but yeah, okay. I mean, I understand it. He is very, he is very cute. He's probably like one of the best, like first stage starters. Now we got the Megas. Um, oh man, I don't know. I mean, Mega Lucario, right? Right, yeah, either that or Gallade. Or it's like it's like Lucario, Gallade, Lopany, Obama Snow, Garchomp. Garchomp is kind of mid. Lopany, we got a lot of Lop. I actually really like, and I know people are gonna make it weird, so I'll just make it weird out the gate. Lopany's cool. I really like, especially Mega Lopany is really cool. So like, I I would not be mad if that won. I'll say, yeah, we'll, we'll lock in. We'll lock Gallade, Lopany, Lucario. I feel like Lucario is like, either Lucario or Gallade, right? Is I feel like the go-to choice. And then... I'll put a Bomba Snow, I guess. I, I don't think Mega Garchomp is... I don't think he's I don't think he's top tier. I don't think he's ranking, to be honest. Like, if we're looking at the stats, if we're looking at the administration, if we're looking at his history, he's not fucking doing it. He's not making the cut. Regular Garchomp is sick. Mega Garchomp, I, it's one of the few Megas that I think is a downgrade, honestly. Like, it, some of the Megas are downgrades, right? And, like, not even just, like, in the game, but also just, like, with the design. I feel like Lucar or, uh, Garchomp is both of those. Obama Snow is, like, kind of a... It's like, eh, I don't know. They're both kind of the same. Where do you put Lucario though? Yeah, but we can do the form separate. Okay, yeah, I'm I'm down. I'm down with that. That just makes the most sense, right? I mean, he was like the first Mega, I think. Was he the first Mega? Is that like a lore thing? I don't know. Okay. Oh God. Okay, this is where it gets hard. So, we've already done Garatina. We've already done Dialga. Uh, 
I think that's it. And we are, well, no, we already did Darkrai. So, okay. I, I think Arceus or Polkia, right? Fion, really? Really, Fion? We have literally the best selection of, of legendaries in the entire fucking, like this is the best generation of legendaries and we're gonna, and we're gonna put Fion. <laughs> okay. All right, yeah, no, I, I, no, I, I see it, I see it. Is, I don't even know, is this Manaphy or is that Fion? I literally can't even tell. That's Fion, I'm sure. <laughs> okay, how are we feeling about Fion, guys? We, we big Fion fans? I don't know, man, it, it's close, dude. Is that Manaphy? I actually think I might've put Manaphy. Oh my God, I did, wait. Let me put the right one. Yeah, no, that, yeah, Fion for sure, bro. For sure. Okay, you got yeah, you guys don't agree. Okay. I thought for a second maybe maybe it would take off, but no, okay. Uh I think Arceus, honestly, is probably the play. Shaman, didn't we already do Shaman? Oh no, we we've, we've been putting Shaman, but he has not been winning. Um okay, I'll, here's what I'll do. I'll make I'll make a poll. I'll make a poll with Shaman Fly. Well we'll do we'll do Arceus, of course. We'll do Shaman. Shaman Fly, and then we'll also do, we'll do, we gotta put Polky in there, right? And then we'll do... Mm -hmm. Garatina Base? No, we can't. I'll put Heatran, I'll put Heatran. I don't, I don't think Heatran really should be up there, but like, as I said, like he's cool, he's like chill, but like when I, when I tell you guys, this is, this, tier this tournament this entire situation this league this is not like the playoffs okay this is like this is the world fucking cup of pokemon yeah and it, it looks like Arceus is the choice okay that i'm honestly i'm cool with that that that's that's i'm down with that honestly like if we didn't put garatina for ghost um i think garatina would have belonged there but Anyways, okay. Uh, what is the best overall? Oh God, man. Garatina base rigged. All right, we're not gonna put base and origin form. Come on, we don't gotta do that. Bidoof, I swear to God. Okay, I'll put Bidoof in the poll, but I swear to God, if it wins, I'm gonna be upset. Swear to God. I swear, I'm gonna be so actually upset. It's just, it's so, guys. We gotta move on. We got like, it's cringe. It's cringe. We gotta move on. I'm sorry. I've been saying that. I've been saying that. It's like, I swear, like, okay. The Pokemon community, we we have like three jokes. We have three jokes. <laughs> and it's, it's Lord Helix, Bidoof, and fucking too much water. And like, it's like, that's it. Like, we just stick on it for decades. <laughs> okay. Um, we'll put Rotom, I'll put Mega Lucario on there. And we will put, I already got, I already got Garatina on there. We'll put, okay, Gliscor, I'm down for Gliscor. Okay. I feel, oh, I should put Dark Ride on there. It's fine. I feel like, I feel like Garatina wins this. Yeah, I feel like Garatina just, right? Guys, don't vote, Bidoof. If you got okay, I'll I'll say if you vote Bidoof, oh, I'm gonna end stream. I'm gonna stream. You vote Bidoof, I end stream. Mm, now, you're, now you're thinking about it, right? Thinking about it, you're like, oh, oh man, the stream has been so fun and interesting. I really don't want it to end. Man, we're only at Gen Four. I wonder what he thinks of Lechonk. Don't do it. Don't do it, guys. Come on. I know you're better than that. We're gonna say our favorite Gen Four Pokemon out of. All of these amazing options is fucking Bidoof, really? That's the best? That's the best that Gen 4 has? Insane. Insane. That is an insane take. I, I, I understand the bit, but that is like an insane take. And for this to represent us as a community, like, I'm, I'm begging you guys. I mean, just come on. <laughs> any other Garatina enjoyers? <laughs> I mean, really, anybody. 
Just, if you guys have like alt accounts, if you want to just like, I mean, really anybody. It, oh yes. Uh, fuck yeah. Okay. Whoo! That was close. Wow, that was close, man. Hey, I appreciate y'all. You guys, you guys have good takes, man. I've been saying that. You guys got insane takes. Awesome. All right, let's move on to Gen Five. How are you feeling about Gen Five? <laughs> <laughs> Say rigged all you want. It's the truth. <laughs> oh, man. Gen 5 normal types. Got a lot of great options here. Ah, oh, man. This is great. <laughs> I personally feel like Pat Rat is in the running, is what I would say if that was, if I had bad ideas and bad takes. Um, I feel like, okay, honestly, Meloetta. I, I feel I feel lukewarm. I feel lukewarm about a lot of these Pokemon. Okay. Oh no, actually Auto No. No, but it's not Mega. I like Mega Auto No. I don't like regular Auto No. Regular Auto No is kind of kind of kind of mid. All right, I'll, I'll put Lillipup on there. Uh, I'll put uh, Meloetta normal form. And I guess Stoutland is cool. I'll put Stoutland down there. Um, <laughs> Braviary. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of lukewarm about Gen 5 normal types. I mean, I don't know. Like, I like Meloetta. I think Meloetta's cool. And I like uh, Stoutland. And Braviary is okay. Yeah, I'm not, I don't, I don't feel like, I'm not like sitting here like fighting over these Pokemon, right? Like I'm seeing them and I'm like, yeah, yeah, they're all right. They're all right. Like none, none of them are like bad, but like none of them are like amazing, right? It's like very, I'm just very in the middle about it. Meloetta normal. Okay. That is that is fine with me. Fire types. Oh my god, Volcarona, right? Holy shit, we have to do Volcarona. Guys, guys, be fucking for real. Volcarona, come on. I know, listen, Regiram's cool, right? Whatever. And like, I mean, there's a lot of good fire types in Gen. I mean, you know, obviously we have um fucking Lampent, right? He's a he's a goat, but like, come on, dude. Come on. Come on. No, 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 Dominic, Embor's mid. Embor's so mid. We, for sure, for sure, Volcarona. Easily Regiram? No. I mean, like, Regiram is cool. I like Regiram, but I don't love Regiram. I don't love, I'm not dying for Regiram. Victini, okay, Victini, maybe. Victini might be in the running. The only Pokemon that are in the running right now, even getting remotely close, are Victini and, um, Chandelure. That's it. That's it. Nobody else. Nobody else even touches Volcarona. Okay. Looks like we're sitting at a yes. Perfect. That is that is good with me. Water types. Okay. I'm thinking Keldeo. Um, Zen mode Darmanitan. Yeah, dude. Classic. You can't pick one fire type. Yeah, they are. Well, honestly, we could have maybe done Volcarona for bug. Oshawott. Oshawott does go hard. I feel like I'm looking at this, I'm thinking Oshawa and I'm thinking Keldeo. Those are those are my two. Actually, Duat kind of fucks too. Okay, I like I don't I think I like Oshawa and Duat better than Samurott. Let's say, okay, let's say Keldeo with cool head. We'll say Oshawa, Duat, Simipor, please don't make fun of me. Brother, you are you are asking. <laughs> you are asking to get bullied with Simipor. Nah, dude. Semipor is so... I actually... No, I won't, I won't give you too much. He's cool. He's all right. What should our fourth be? I'm just going to throw Time Pull on there. I think Time Pull is interesting. Actually, actually, uh, Seismitoad. I should have put Seismitoad on there, but it's all right. I, out, of, out of these, I'd, I'd maybe go Keldeo. I'd maybe go Keldeo. I think he's the, I think he's the coolest. I feel like I feel like uh, with a lot of Gen Five, I'm realizing I'm I'm like, you see, you see, I don't I don't hate any of the Pokemon from Gen Five. I either like them or I love them. You know what I mean? Which is which is overall a good thing. But I'm not like it, it's not like Gen Four or Gen Three where I'm like fighting over it. Like I feel like with these, like there's a there's a very clear. There's a clear two or three or one that just like very obviously stands out. Anyways, Oshawott. Gen 5 is the best gen. I can't vote on this bro too hard. It, it is it is the best gen. It is the best gen. Fighting for our lives over here. Tortuga. 
<laughs> that's that's crazy. That's crazy. Um, all right. <sighs> Servine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm, this is not a joke. This is not a joke. Servine. No, I'm not fucking around. Servine. Servine is better than superior. <laughs> okay. All right. It was no. It was a long shot. It was a long shot. No, I get it. I get it. I was just. I was just throwing it out. Among us, I'm literally out of principle. I'm not. This is exactly what I'm talking about. I'm not. I'm not putting a Moongus on here. Just. Just the fact that even one person said Among Us, I'm not putting it on there. If, if you're choosing your favorite Pokemon based on memes, that ain't right. That ain't right. I'll say it. It ain't right. I'm putting Ferrothorn on there for sure. Uh, we'll throw Superior on there. I like I, I like Ferrothorn. I love Ferrothorn. You guys know I'm a big Ferrothorn fan. Huge Ferrothorn fan. I Weirdly enough, I want to put Lilligant on there. Lilligant deserves a spot. I'll say it. Lilligant's cool. I really like Lilligant. And... <laughs> Autumn Deerling. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, I see the vision. I, I see it. I see the vision. I feel I feel like those are probably the best four. Verizion, ah, Verizion's whatever. Yeah, whatever. You, if, listen, we can put Verizion for legendary. Whimsicott, oh fuck, I didn't even see Whimsicott. Ah, oh, Whimsicott should have been on there. <laughs> Instead, we put Autumn Deerling. <laughs> yeah, Whimsicott should have been on there. Well, it's okay. We can do Whimsicott for fairy. Okay, looks like Ferrothorn's winning. That's that's cool. Ferro, Ferro, fine. Down for that. Love Ferrothorn. Big Ferrothorn fan. Um, all right. Oh, this is gonna be tough. I feel like you gotta go Galvantula, right? I mean, we could go Zekrom, but I feel like Zekrom mostly plays in the Legendary Division or in the Dragon Division. I mean, I'll put him on the pole, but I feel like he'd be probably be better there, right? I'll put Galvantula. Stunfisk? Nah, come on. Electros? Actually, no, you know what? Electros is sick. Yeah, we'll put Electros on there. Substrika. Okay. Yeah, we'll put we'll put we'll, we'll we'll put we'll put the zebra on there. I don't know. I feel like Zip like I like Substrika a lot, but like he's not winning any awards, you know? Okay, yeah, it looks like Galvantula. I, I, I feel like Galvantula is probably the best pick. I, I think overall, like, it's tough. Because I also really like Thunder Astherian. It's just, in a moga, it's just, ugh. I feel like you guys know, like, how um, when you make decisions over time, your your willpower for decisions, like, goes down. It's like, it's like a resource. <laughs> and uh, I feel like I've exhausted... <laughs> all of my decision-making skills today. Th this is like, this is the truest test of your decision durability. Base Blitzel, that's raw. Honestly, we should have put that on the poll. Decision, exactly, exactly. I, I am feeling it. Anyways, um, weirdly enough, I'm thinking Cryogonal. Is that is that crazy? Am I insane for saying that? I think Cryogonal. Yeah, I think Kragonal. He's cool. Base Kyurem. Oh, fuck. Well, Kyurem, Kyurem could play in the Legendary Division, you know? I, I, will, I will say regular Kyurem is better than Kyurem White and Black. I will say that. Okay, so if we're not doing that, are we doing regular Kyurem? White Kyurem. Ah, uh, White Kyurem. I don't know. I feel like the fusions are kind of like whatever. Honestly, like regular Kyurem, like Kyurem is cooler just by himself. Bear tick, bear tick is okay. Yeah, let's, yeah, let's, let's lock, we'll lock in Kyurem, lock in Kyurem. That, that just, that just makes sense, right? All right, fighting types. Um, wow, big day for Embor fans. Um, big day for Embor fans. Big day for Scrafty fans. We already did Keldeo, right? Oh no, we did Oshawa. Oh, so we can put Keldeo on here. I think Keldeo. Ooh, either oh, Keldeo or Kinkelder. I love Kinkelder. Fuck. Okay. We'll put Kinkelder on there. 
I'm putting Keldeo. Specifically Resolute Form. <laughs> because it's cooler. Scrafty. Ah, no. Mel Meloetta, no. Yeah, we'll do We'll put Scrafty on. I feel like Scrafty might play in the Dark Division, though. Me, uh, me and Shao is cool, too. There's a lot of good fighting types. Terrakion. Ah, okay. Okay, we'll lock that in. I don't know, man. It's, th it's a tough one. I just feel like the options are really, really, I don't know, really any of these go. I feel like the problem, the pro oh yeah, High Dragon and Dark. Fuck, you're right. Okay. I, Cobalion. Ah, Terrakion's better. Terrakion's better than Cobalion. Yeah, Conkelder. Okay, I feel like, the hard part is like, I feel like really any of these could could have taken it, honestly. It's, you know, it really what it is, is it's just about reading the room, right? And understanding the, the moral values that align with the Pokemon you choose. Keep in mind, like this, this is like a representation of us, you know? And that's why I'll be choosing Scolipede for the poison section. Uh, <laughs> how about ground? <laughs> Whirlipede? Stop. How's the progress? I mean, we're in Gen 5 now, so it, it you know, could be worse. Anyways, uh, Excadrill, Crocodile, we got some bangers here. Golurk is kind of, I, mm, man, I might go Golurk. I might go Gol, either Golurk, Excadrill, or Seismitoad. Golurk, Golurk, dude, the thing about Golurk is he just goes so unnecessarily hard. Um, well, and I'll throw, I'll throw Lando T. Okay, yeah, I feel like, I feel like Seismitoad maybe could have squeaked in there. But though those are the four. Those are the four. I out of those four, I think I go Golurk. But also Golurk could be the ghost, our ghost pick. Ah oh, no, we gotta go Chandelure. Fuck. Man, this is I am like, I feel like I got hit by an Amtrak. You guys know what an Amtrak is? It's like a train. <laughs> I feel like I got hit by a train, dude. Who won that? Crocodile? You know, honestly, I don't think Crocodile deserved it. I'll say it. I'll say it. His nose is too damn long. Why don't you just say train? I feel like Amtrak is more interesting. All right. We got the... Wow. Okay. Yeah, we got, we got, the, we got the, the weather boys back. Amtrak is so bad. Is it actually? I've never actually ridden on one. Archaeops? Archaeops is based. Archaeops is really based. I like Archaeops a lot. Okay, let's I think let's start with the let's start with the weather forces, right? I'm thinking Thunderous Therian. Right? Obviously. I'm thinking uh land we'll, we'll put Lando T back on there. Just just for like just the principle of it. Um yeah, Archaeops. And you know what? I'm going to throw a sleeper pick in there. I'm going to say Sigilyph. I think Sigilyph is cool. I know. Bold take. Crazy, crazy take. That's like an, something an insane person would say. You're weird. I know. I. You know what? I fully accept that. Sigilyph is cool. Sigilyph is cool. He's a cool guy. Um, I feel like the flying types in general in Gen 5 are kind of weak, to be honest. Like, really the only ones that I love are like a Molga... I, I like all the Therian forms. I like Archaeops and I like Sigilyph. But that that is about it, to be honest, with the with the Gen 5 flying types. Um, Psychic type. Oh, Reuniclus, right? Right? Oh, Victini. Fuck. I forgot Victini was in this. Okay. <laughs> I I feel like Reuniclus. Reuniclus is so cool, but Victini might edge it out. Let's just, let's keep this simple. Victini, Reuniclus, right? Let's keep it simple. Just 50-50, pick it down the middle. We don't, we don't got to overthink it. Um, I, I feel like Victini wins that. Oh, it's close. It's actually close. Whoa. Whoa. Shockingly close. Ridiculous. Like, surprisingly close. Wow. Yeah. Okay. I, you know, Reuniclus is a Pokemon that, like, you don't think you would love. 
Like you look at it and you're like, what is going on here? But it like high key, low key, really fucks. Anyways, um, okay, so we've already done, here's the problem. We've already done Volcarona, we've already done Galvantula, we've already done Scolipede. So really the options are Genesect. <laughs> like really that's kind of it. I will say, I, I don't, I'm not like falling in love, right? But I do love, I do like Lee Vanny. I do like Crustle, I do like Iselgore. But I mean, it's, it's so obviously, yeah, it's so obviously Genesect. Like, we, we might as well, we just wrap it up right there, right? Keep it simple. Um, okay, Rock Tide. We already done Archaeops. I think... Whew, I think Gigalith, maybe. I don't know. What are we thinking? Yeah, Gigalith is definitely on the roster. We, did we already do Terrakion? I don't think Terrakion won, though, right? Yeah, because we got, we got Conk in there. All right, I'll, I'll throw Terrakion in there. And I'll put Crustle in there for the vibes. And then, oh, no, Caracosta. I like Caracosta. Just a lot, of, a lot of positivity going around, right? Bulldor is a better silhouette than Gigalith. Ah. Uh, nah. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I feel like Gigalith, he's just like... Gigalith reminds me of Onyx, and I think that's cool. That's all, that's all I really have to say on the topic. Uh, moving on. It's about all I have to say. Now, I think for this next one, we can very easily... Oh, oh fuck, man. So we already did... Did we already do Golurk? Oh my god, no, we didn't. But okay, here's the thing. We also we also have ground coming up. No, we don't. <laughs> so if we don't pick Golurk here, he's not getting picked. It's tough, right? I feel like it... Because it, I also really want Chandelure on here. Like, it, it's got to be between Chandelure, Golurk, and Kofagrigus. Right, I mean, I don't even think we have to really think about that much. Um, yeah, I think, and I think Chandelure takes it, to be honest. But it makes me sad, because Golurk and Kofagrigus are, are also very cool. Right? And even, yeah, Je Jellicent is also, I mean, that's the thing, man. We're not just picking Pokemon that we think are good, right? We're not even picking Pokemon that we think are great. Yeah, mask. That's based. I like that. That's that's. I like that. That's respectable. Um, we we're picking the best of the best, and I think when when considering that, it makes the the outlook of these decisions a little more clear. Anyways, dragon type. Holy shit! Now keep in mind, we still have dark type coming up, so we don't necessarily have to do high dragon here. Oh fuck! But Zoroark takes. Yeah, Zoroark takes that, right? <laughs> right? I don't even think we have to do High Dragon for Dragon now, because Zoroark absolutely takes that. <laughs> right? Right? Right. Come on. Be honest with me. Be honest with me. We don't even got to... I know... Listen, there's a lot of great Dark types. Bisharp is cool. Zora was cool. We already did Crooked Tile. Um... That's about it. Like, there's a lot of cool dark types, but like, yeah, Z Zoroark absolutely takes that. Okay, now we have to go high dragon for dragon, correct? Correct? Yeah, right. I mean, Haxorus, maybe. How are we how are we feeling about how are we feeling about high dragon? I I we can't not have high dragon on here, right? Like, man, you guys are really pining for Haxorus. I don't know. Listen, I like Haxorus. I'm a big Haxorus fan, but I think High Dragon takes it. Wow. Wait, no, it's close. It is, we are within a nose hair right now. Okay, no, actually, wait. That's High Dragon. Axe you? Axe you. Shut the front door. You are not being for real right now. Axe you. Axe you? No, what? What? That's crazy. That's actually an insane take. Axu is not better than Hydragon. You understand the league we're in. Axu, no fucking shot, dude. I would, I would take Fracture. I would take Fracture over Axu. I would take Dino over Axu. I would take Zwilet. I would take any of these. Actually, the only Pokemon I wouldn't take over Axu is Dredagon and uh, the Fusions. 
Axio is bottom 50%, bottom 30%. I'm taking Fracture, for sure. Anyways, uh, more Pokemon here. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like it's cute, it's cute, but like, I don't, besides being cute, I'm not like, I'm not like pining to be his best friend. Anyways, so we, we already did Ferrothorn, right? Yeah, okay, we already did Ferrothorn. Um, we haven't done Excadrill. I, call me crazy, no, Excadrill takes this. Like, okay, Bisharp is cool, right? But Excadrill, right? Come on. Come on. I, I, right? I, we already we already did Genesect. So, I mean, just going, you know, process of elimination. Wow, it, it is kind of close. We have to do Excadrill. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, okay, cool, 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 cool. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Cool, 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 cool. Clang, clang. Yeah, no, I listen, Clink Clang, I like Clink Clang. I'm not like one of those Clink Clang haters, right? He definitely grew on me. Um, and he, he fucks, he, especially with like gear shift, it's cool. He is cool. I, I would rate him very highly, but compared to Excadrill, I mean, come on. What was it, Cot? <laughs> not, not even gonna deliberate on that one. Um, it's crazy that that's the only Gen 5 fairy type. I actually didn't know that. Durant, yeah, no, Durant's mid. Come on, come on. We're, we, you guys, you guys are sitting in little leagues. You guys are sitting in junior varsity. We are at the fucking Super Bowl. We are at the fucking Super Bowl, okay? This is no time for, for Aaron Rodgers past his prime, okay? This is, we, get Tom Brady on the field. Get Tom Brady, we're talking Excadrill, okay? Excadrill and Durant do not keep, they don't compete in the same, anyways. Um, I'm pretty sure we already did Oshawott. Yeah, we already did Oshawott, um, but the rest of them are fair game. I think Duat is actually a valid choice here. I think Duat. I think Superior. Um, I think Servine. I think Zer I think the middle stages are, are up for grabs. Um, I don't think any other... <laughs> Pokemon is up for Snivy, maybe. Embor, no, come on, be for real. Tepig. Okay, if you guys had, if you had to pick one Pokemon, we'll do one. We'll do one from the Embor line. Who are we doing? Tepig. And Pig Knight is no shot. Tepig. Okay, we'll do Tepig. I I'll do Tepig over Embor. Okay. I I feel like Duat kind of clears this. The, literally, I, man, the, the Samurott line is just, yeah, the Samurott line is just so good. I feel like Samurott himself is kind of mid, but like the first, it's like, these two are amazing. You, you are amazing. You're very good, very good. Mid. Okay. Mid. Anyways, Duat. Nice. Uh, all right. Oh my God. <laughs> so we got we got two options for the forms, right? It's Mega Audino <laughs> and then the Garbage Dump. I'm going Mega Audino. I love Mega Audino. Literally one of my favorite Megas. Do you agree? I feel like it's actually a pretty trash. Guys, what? Are you fucking kidding me? Wait, like, you're not, like, serious, right? Like, it's obviously Mega Autono. You're gonna pick a giant... Okay, first of all, let's not even talk about the fact that one is a G-Max and one is a Mega, right? Every, every, literally every Mega. Every Mega is above every G-Max, right? So, like, on that principle alone, we go Autono. On that, on that concept alone, we go Autono. But then you get into the fact that it's literally one of the worst G Maxes. It's just a pile. It's what the fuck are we? Why? Really? G Max Gardevoir Garbodor got a far better design. No, he did not. Dude. Sorry, I almost fell off the chair. Mega Autono is so sick, dude. I'm, I'm genuinely. This is baffling to me. Mega Autono is so cool. 
The, the only Pokemon in Gen 5 to get a Mega. It's normal and fairy. It's insanely good with support. It's bulky as hell. It looks awesome. It's got that beautiful white finish. I love it, man. I Mega Arno is one of my favorite Megas. It's actually very upsetting that you guys are disrespecting. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, it just took a little bit of convincing, a little bit of bias. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> go ahead and wrap that pull up right there. Great time to go ahead and wrap that pull up. Awesome. <laughs> just, I'm glad my persuading helped. Redo the pull? No. No, I got the result I wanted. Why would I redo it? I, I, holy shit. What is this? What am I clicking on right now? X and Y? Oh, wait, all the Megas are listed under X and Y? Huh? That can't be, that can't be real. That can't be real. No, I'm not redoing the poll, guys. Come on, be fucking for real. Be real. Those should not count. Yeah, that's crazy. Okay, uh, favorite legendary from uh, Gen 5. Um, Zekrom. Zekrom, right? Zekrom. Right, I feel like that's actually like a really, I actually don't think that's a hard decision at all. Lando T, nah, come on. Come on, come on, it's Zekrom. I mean, be, be honest with me, right? I, I thought we agreed when we started the stream we were gonna tell the truth. I thought we agreed that we were gonna be good, good, honest, truth, truth pursuers. I thought that was kind of the, the vibe of the stream. Zekrom, yep. Kiram Black, no. <laughs> I I'm gonna be honest. I don't really have like a. I don't have like a reasoning. Just no. Um, I don't really like the fusions. I don't really like them. I mean, they're like okay. They're like all right. Anyways, all right. Gen six. Gen six normal type. Oh shit. So the the megas are also included here, which I don't know if I agree with. I mean, what? Whatever. We'll, we'll play. We'll play by the rules. So okay. I feel like out of all of these, Heliolisk. Right? Oh, I forgot. Oh shit. Oh, we skipped it. Oh shit. Okay, hang on. Whoopsies. All right, favorite from black and <gasps> favorite from black and white out of these. Uh, okay, which ones do you guys want in the poll? I um okay, people want Oshawott, Volcarona, yeah. I mean, they're all they're all good, right? It's we're really we're we're fight we're fighting a losing battle right now. Zekrom in there, okay. And yeah, Zoroark. Okay, yeah, out of those four. I feel like out of those four, I think I go, I think I go Zoroark. I think I go Zoroark personally. But I mean, they're all, they're all great. They're all, they're all phenomenal. We can skip Megas. I feel like we should for Gen 6. I feel like we should for Gen 6. I, I also feel like, yeah, I, don't, I think that makes sense, right? Because literally, like, we're not, we're not, like, rating the Gen 5 Pokemon. Or the Gen, sorry, we're not rating the Gen 6 Pokemon. We're, like, we're just adding the Megas in again. All right, Volca, wow, Volcarona 1? That's actually, I'm, I mean, I'm down. I'm down, but I did not expect that. Um, there are Megas for Gen 6. No, I, I understand that. <laughs> I understand there's Megas in Gen 6. I'm saying the Megas have always been here and we've already rated, we've already rated all the Megas. Cause we've been doing them, we've been doing it here. Like if we, if we do a Gen 6 fighting type, it's just gonna be fucking Lucario. Like, I mean, I guess, I don't know. I guess that's not necessarily true, but I don't know. All right, whatever. We'll, we'll stick, we'll stick with it. We'll stick with it. I personally feel like out of these, let's, let's, yeah, let's follow, let's, we'll follow, we'll follow the vibe. We'll follow the vibe. Um, there is Mega Deancey. Yeah, I, I guess that, yeah, I don't know. Heliolisk, right? The pink fur fru. Nah, that's based. I like that. I like that. Pink fur fru. I, th I think Heliolisk wins for me, personally. Um, I think Mega Pidgeot is also on that list. Yeah, Mega Pit, probably Mega Pidgeot and Mega Lopunny. Yeah, those are those are the top four, right? Fletchling, nah, come on, 
Come on, come on. Listen, we'll get Talonflame on there. Don't you worry. Don't even stress about it. Pyroar is also good. But also, I feel like Pyroar is kind of like... I mean, he's like, all right. Right? I mean, he's like... I, I give him like C tier or B tier. He's cool. Megas are cheating. Hey, listen, you know what? I, I'm mixed about it too, but we'll we'll just follow the form. We'll follow the form. Keep it simple. Honestly, and I mean, the fact that like Heliolisk winning out of the... Well, also, wait, didn't we already have Mega Pidgeot on one? No, I don't think we did. Anyways, uh, fire types. Oh, boy. You just had no Megas? No, I said we we're going to follow the form. That was That was the... I, it was a conflict of interest, but yeah, I think I, I think I said we're going to follow the form. Took a lot of effort for me not to vote. Yeah, no, Lopini, it's so enticing, right? Okay, I think Talonflame. <sighs> yeah, well, Talonflame has to be on there. For sure. Volcanion? Uh, I don't personally see it, but yeah. Are we putting Primal Ground on? We'll put, we'll put Primal Ground on there. And Char yeah, Charizard X. Okay. Uh, damn, Delphox didn't even Delphox didn't even get to show up. That's sad. That's upsetting. Honestly, though, I think Brakeson's better. Is that a crazy take? I feel like Brakeson is. Oh, honestly, dude, Flachinder Fox. I actually, I, I might do Flachinder over Talonflame. I don't know. If, I don't know if that's like an insane idea. I think Flachinder is a cooler design. Which I, I don't know if that, that that's kind of that's kind of a sick take. I'd put that on a billboard personally. Frank really likes mid evos. I really do. I hadn't really thought about it, but I really do. Anyways, all right. So yeah, Greninja, right? Greninja. Do we even have to like? I mean, I'll I don't know. I'll put it up, but like I feel like Greninja, right? I mean, Mega Gyarados. Like I like Mega Slowbro, Mega Gyarados. All the Megas are cool. Mega Blasters are cool, but like Greninja, obviously, right? Yeah, I mean, it's just, it's clear as day. Crowds in 200k, thank you, Rachel, I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you guys for being here, by the way. I, I do appreciate, I, honestly, I had no idea this was going to go as long as it has. <laughs> I, like, how long have we we've been live for, wait, we're almost four hours. I literally, I was like, yeah, we'll be live for like an hour and a half. <laughs> I, I was like, yeah, it'll be like, yeah, just whatever, cute little cute stream. I, I'll stand up for it. I'll just stand the whole time. It'll be fine. Yeah, we'll, we'll be done in whatever. Was not that. But I appreciate y'all coming out. It's been a fun time. Go-Go? Are we putting Go-Go in this bracket right now? Gorgeist is cool. I don't, I don't think he's... Well, okay, Trevenant is the better one, though, right? Like, yeah, Trevenant. And then we'll say Chestnut. Really? <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> uh, we'll put Mega Sceptile. Quilladin. <laughs> you guys are so funny. And then we'll put Mega Venusaur. I like Mega Venusaur. Okay, cool. Out of these, I, I think I say Trevenant. Trevenant is just so fucking cool, man. He, he just, he's just got that demeanor about him. I've been saying that. He just like, I don't know, something about it, he just... <laughs> Could you imagine? No, yeah, he's just cool. I like Trevenant a lot. And it looks like you guys also like Trevenant. Go, listen, I like, listen, Go-Go's cool. I do like go as well. But Trevenant. It's just that simple. Massive ass water bottle. Yeah, I'm a thirsty fucking boy. You know, ranking Pokemon, it takes a lot out of your, 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 Liver. I uh, just pretend I didn't say that. Okay. Oh, uh, oh, damn. Okay, so we can't do Heliolisk. Um, is that the cosplay Pikachu's? Okay. I I feel like, dude, Mega Ampharos. Mega Ampharos just wins this, right? Am I crazy for saying that? The Dene? No, come on. I like the Dene, but I don't. I'm not like over Mega Ampharos? Yeah, right. You know what I mean? Manetric? No, no, no. Mega Manetric is, like, miserable. I mean, look at him, bro. <laughs> bro, he looks like... He looks like he's a fucking... Like, he's, like, he looks like a billboard. No. Come on. 
over Mega, I'm sorry, over Mega Ampharos? Wow, okay, it's really close, but yeah, Mega Ampharos wins this. Okay, yeah, no. No, 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 I, listen, I like Dedenne. That, that's about it, that's about, that's about all I can say. All right, Ice Types, oh, that should be an easy one. Um, Aurorus, right? Yeah, I don't know if that's like a hot take, but yeah, Aurorus for sure, he's so cool. Do people not fuck with Aurorus? I fuck with Aurorus. I'm a big Aurorus guy. Huge Aurorus guy. Amora, Amora's cool too. Avalog is cool. Ah, I mean, that is, that is tough. That is tough, but yeah, I'd say, I still say Aurorus. I still say. And it looks like 68% is also saying Aurorus. Yeah, Aurorus is cool. I mean, he like sucks ass, right? Like when it comes to actually using him, but I like him. Wow. Okay, Mega Mewtwo X might might be in this tier. Damn. Okay, God. I feel. Like, I mean, one of the Megas has to win here, right? Palucha is cool too. I feel like Mega Gallade actually would be the winner. So we already did Mega Lucario, so we can't do that. Okay, this one. Yeah, I don't know. This one. This one's tough. I did. We already do. We haven't done Mega Blaziken. Okay, so we got Mega Blaziken. We got Hawlucha. I feel like we gotta put, we gotta put Mega Gallade on there. Pangoro? Mega, okay, no, Mega Heracross, absolutely not. Um, <laughs> Mega Lopini, fuck, man. There's so many good fighting types. Okay, we'll just, we'll just do one of those. We'll just do one of those. Th this one's hard. This one's really hard. Pangoro, I like Pangoro, but I think Halucha's better. Do you guys remember when Halucha leaked and uh, they like someone posted the picture on 4chan or whatever and everyone thought it was fake? Same with Greninja. Dude, the the pre like the, the leaks of Greninja, everybody was like viscerally angry. It literally they were like, they were like, no shot. <laughs> they were like, no shot. Like this cannot be, it's so bad it cannot be real. A couple years later, all of a sudden, literally one of the best best Pokemon Game Freak has made. Actually crazy. All right, wow, Halucha pulls that out. That's sick, I like that. Next up, we got uh, Mega Beedrill, right? Right? Mega Beedrill. Am I, am I, maybe I'm a crazy person who's saying crazy things, but I, I yeah, Mega Beedrill. Mega Beedrill. I, listen, I love Dragalge. I do, oh, fuck. I do love Dragalge, but Mega Beedrill's cooler. Wow. Oh wait, no, no wait, no. It is kind of yes. I, as I said, I listen. It's hard. Wow. Never mind. Dragalge. We got some big Dragalge fans. I, I mean, I get it. I get it. Dragalge is cool. I like. I big big fan. I'm also a Dragalge fan, but I think Mega Beedrill is cooler. Dragalge is over or underrated. Yeah, he kind of is. Okay, well, let's fuck it. We'll, 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 we'll fuck it. We'll do Dragalge. That's, I'm down with that. I'm totally down with that. Oh, uh, God, what do we do with... I think we go... I think we go Diggersby? <laughs> Is what I would say if I was smoking weed. There's no way. <laughs> uh, well, Z okay, Zygarde, obviously. Right. And then Groudon. Yeah. And then... I don't know. Okay, I'll put Diggers Beyond there for, for the lols, but like, no, <laughs> you know? And then I guess we'll do Steelix. I don't know. One of those. Honestly, just like, instead of like being deliberate about your choice, just like throw a dart at your screen, right? Or just like close your eyes and fucking just pick one. Okay, Zygarde, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Zygarde, Zygarde's dope. I still think Beedoof should have won earlier. Nah. Nah, nah. I don't, I don't, I don't. I, what, like, what does that say about, you know, what does that say about the channel, about the community, if Beedoof is our favorite Gen 4 Pokemon? Out of everything. Like, that, that is just, I, I don't think, I'd be embarrassed. I would actually, there'd be like a level of embarrassment there that I don't think I can handle. Uh, all right, cool. Flying. Oh, okay, we gotta go with one of the Vivions, right? <laughs> We, did we, we already did Mega Rayquaza. Yeah, okay. 
Honestly, if, oh man, you felt all so, you felt all or Neuvern. Fuck, there's so many options. This one, this one's hard. Neuvern is sick. We'll throw, we'll throw Neuvern on there. We'll throw your Veltal on there. Uh, yeah, we'll throw the pink Vavillion. Dude, I mean, it's so, it's so hard to choose. And I'm gonna put Mega Pinsir on there because it's, it's my second favorite Mega and I love it so much. And it's so cool. And God, there's so many cool flying type Megas. It makes it so hard. Save you Veltal for Dark. That actually makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> do do Neuvern. Yep. That is. Oh no, you have Veltal. I honestly, yeah, we probably should save it for Dark. Let's be honest. Let's keep it a stack. I, let's look within ourselves. Understand the intent. Um, but also Neuvern could play in the Dragon Division. You know, that's not a crazy thing. Wow, it is. It is ridiculously close. <laughs> it's like absurdly close. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. All right. Uh, Neuvern, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Yeah. No. Honestly, that I, I'm down for that. That makes sense. Because when we go when we go to the Dark Division. Oh god, there's a lot of good dark Pokemon. But I think, yeah, we can put your belt or Hoopa. Oh fuck. Okay. Psychic. We actually could do Hoopa for Psychic. Now that I'm thinking about it. Gudra. Ah, oh, yeah, Gudra's probably gonna be dragon. Anyways, alright, what are we thinking here? Pink Pavilion beat Mega Pinsir. That's sad. That's like genuinely depressing. Alright, let's put let's put Hoopa on there. Malamar. I really like Malamar. Yeah, Malamar's cool. I'm going to put Mega Mewtwo Y just because he is absurdly cool. And then, yeah, no, Slowbro. I agree, actually. Slowbro, I, Slowbro is unironically one of my favorite Megas, too. He's just like, I don't know. It's just such a... Well, okay, he's, fu he's fun to use in competitive, and he's also just so ridiculous. It's so great. By, by the way, the Hoopa, uh, I didn't specify, but the Hoopa is Hoopa Unbound. Maybe I should have specified. <laughs> before you guys all voted for him. Maybe, maybe we got some big regular Hoopa fans in the chat, huh? Big regular Hoopa fans. Oh, pe people are saying, oh, rigged. I, I mean, come on, it was so obviously, really? You think I'd, you think I'd put regular Hoopa? I mean, come on. Of course it was Hoopa Unbound, of course. Anyways, uh, oh, we got a lot more Vivian. Guys, can we please do... I just spat everywhere. Holy shit. Um, can we please do Mega Pinsir? I'm I'm asking earnestly. Or Beedrill. One of the two. I feel like that just makes the most sense, right? Beedrill, Pinsir. And then just, I'll put, yeah, Sunset Vivian is also kind of cool. I like the Pokeball Vivian too, actually. We'll put, the, we'll put that one on there. Right, we, 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 got, we got some options. We got some options. I feel like, yeah, I don't know. I feel like out of all the bug type Megas, Scizor and Heracross are kind of like whatever. I, I actively dislike it, uh, Heracross. But Pinsir and Beedrill are so fucking cool, man. God. Yeah, no, Mega Beedrill. Me, like, I, I'm not like a big Beedrill fan. I don't love Beedrill. I'm not, you know, going out on weekends wishing a Beedrill would walk up to me. Like, I... It's just the mega, it just, it's so, and he's so good too. Like he fucking, he hits hard, he's fast as hell. He's so sick. Anyways, big Beedrill fan. Um, I don't know what we do here. Um, can we just do Binacle? You guys down for Binacle? I just think that'd be funny. I just, I don't know, can we do Binacle? I'm just kind of feeling Binacle. I, I, can we just have like one, just like one Binacle? Like, I'm sure the one Binacle fan would be pretty happy about it. <laughs> Come on, guys. Come on, what about the what about the Binacle fans? What about the big, the big Binacle? There's only like three of them, but like, we don't want to disappoint them. Tyrantrum, okay, fine. Actually, Mega Deancey would have also been a great pick. It's all right. All right. It's all right. Don't, hey, no need to spam. No need to spam. It's all right. We'll, we'll do Tyrantrum. I personally, I think, okay, we just go Aegislash here, right? Do we go, do we go shield form or attack form? I think is the better. <laughs> That's the bigger question, right? Oh man, Ghost is hard. 
there's a lot. Of, I mean, I Mega Sableye is like, you know, that'd be my pick, but anyways. All right, do we go shield form or attack form? Probably shield, right? Probably shield. I think shield, personally. I just feel like he looks cooler when he's all regal like that. Yeah, okay, cool. I, you know, call me crazy too. I really fuck with Doughblade. I know, I know a lot of people are like, oh, it's a sword. Oh, it's two swords. Oh. I'm actually a big Doughblade fan. Um, all right, Dragon. I think we gotta start like lightning rounding these, right? How about... We already did Mega Rayquaza, right? Can we, oh, Gudra. Okay. Honestly, that might be easier. If there's like an overwhelming, just just type which one you guys want. I mean, you guys have been doing that, but like type which one, instead of doing a poll every time, type which one you guys want. And if it's an overwhelming majority, we'll just go with that. Okay, what are you guys thinking? Save boy, please. Save boy, please. Wait, you guys want Gumi? Wait, you want Gumi? Wait, I'm, are you sure? Gumi, okay. Malamar, Yveltal, Mega Absol. Wait, Gumi or Gudra? You guys are being so indecisive. I, I, Gumi, I'm locking in Gumi. I'm locking in Gumi. Mega Absol? Okay, cool. How about how about Steel? We already did Aegis Slash. I feel like we gotta do... Dude, call me crazy, we do Klefki. We already did Mega Lucario too. We've done Mega Absol. Oh shit, have we? You're right. Wait, have we? Where? No, wait, I don't think we have. I don't think we have. Yeah, we haven't. <laughs> okay, I, I kind of want to do Klefki. We did normal Absol. Yeah, we did normal Absol. We didn't do we didn't do Mega. Okay, Klefki down. I'm I love Klefki. Klefki is fucking dope. Okay, I feel like oh, this is hard. Fairy's hard. Xerneas, right? No, dude, I, I'm telling y'all, Klefki fucks. Y'all y'all are being y'all being so weird about it. Klefki fucks. Klefki fucks. Sylveon, oh, Sylveon's good too. Gardevoir. Oh, this one, we, 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 we might do a poll. We might do a poll. The Dene, no, come on. Come on, be fucking for real. All right, all right, fine, fine, fine. We'll do a poll, we'll do a poll, we'll do a poll. We'll do a poll. Xerneas, Sylveon. We'll, I'll throw Mawile in there. And then fucking uh, AZ Floet, sure. I, I feel like you go Xerneas. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Either Xerneas or Sylveon. Uh, probably Sylveon, actually. Now that I think about it, probably Sylveon. Yeah, yeah, Sylveon. Okay, that makes sense. Coolio. Uh, starter. Okay, we already did Greninja, right? <laughs> Wait, that kind of limits our options. Wait, so if we, if we don't do Greninja... I... <laughs> what? I guess... Not okay, nothing from the chessman. Well, maybe chessman, maybe chess. Froki, I've seen a lot of Froki. Fennekin, ah, oh, this is hard. Okay, okay, here's, here's what we'll do. We'll just keep it simple. We'll just keep it simple. Froki, chessman, hang on. Fennekin, right? We're not, we're not even gonna go to the evolutions. We're not even gonna go to the evolutions. Just look at the base forms. Just pick your favorite. I probably would go Fennekin out of the base forms. Either Fennekin or Chessman. I feel like like Froki, Froki is okay, but like he gets better. Where the other two start really good and then they get worse. Is my is my intuition. But it looks like okay. Wow, Froki, Froki is destroying. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. I am not mad about that. He's a goofy. Yeah, I mean, he's a goofy little frog guy. I don't mind it. Wow. I mean. <laughs> what what's your favorite mega, guys? <laughs> Can I I'm just no fuck it. I'm just gonna go Sableye. That's my favorite mega. I'm I want Sableye on this roster, okay? Alright, he's my favorite. Fuck you. It's my list. <laughs> Literally started the stream. It's not my list. Just okay, just let me have it. Just let me have it. We're not we're not gonna sit here and debate megas. We've been doing that. Alright, legendary. Um I don't know a legendary. Sableye is based. Bro, I've been saying that. He's so cool, man. He's so sick. So, bro, magic bounce? Forget about it. Okay, well, so we've already done Mega Rayquaza, so we're not doing that. Uh, we'll throw Yveltal on there. We'll throw 
Xerneas on there. We'll throw 100% Zygarde on there. Man, I don't know. I I, I want to say Yveltal would be my pick. We already have Hoopa Unbound. Did we already we already did? We did regular Kyogre. I think we did Primal Groudon. Um, I'll throw I'll throw Primal Kyogre on there. Okay, I feel like Zygarde is the play. Uh, no, Yveltal. I feel like we go Yveltal, right? God, this is so hard, man. I, I really underestimated how tough this is gonna be. Like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like getting secondhand, well, firsthand, I'm, I guess I'm a primary source. I'm getting like secondhand stress. Luxury better be in here somewhere. Ah, I think we did it for electric, gen four. Did we? <laughs> no, we did Rotom Wash. Eee, stinky. Thank you, Pickle. Thank you, Pickle. Zygarde one ground. Yeah, but that was that was regular Zygarde. Um, all right, now we gotta pick a favorite out of these. This that's tough. I man, I feel like Greninja, right? You just go Greninja. I don't know. I, what do you what do you what do you guys what are you guys feeling? Gumi. Okay, I'll I'll throw Gumi on there. I do love Gumi. Gumi, Greninja. Um Wow, it's probably just gonna be one of those. Sable, I'll put the Sableye on there. And I'll put Age of Slash. Okay. That's that's a tough one. That I mean, no matter well, I feel like all of these are tough ones, right? When you get to the end and it's like, oh, these are all the these are all the ones you These are all the these are all the ones you picked. And then you gotta go through and figure out, you know, the best of the best of the best. Oh my god, it's hard. What now it's gonna be interesting is like, so at the very end of this, we're gonna end up with a with a definitive favorite Pokemon. Like this is like gonna end up like we're gonna have to only pick one Pokemon that represents everything. So <laughs> that that's gonna be interesting. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what that's going to look like. I mean, so far, these are, so far, so far, these are the options. Greninja, Garatina, Volcarona, Mudkip, Shuckle, and Missing. <laughs> I forgot we did Missing now. What the fuck was that? I, ugh, please don't make it Shuckle. That's so dumb. <laughs> Ghost Shuckle. <laughs> hey, I don't know. You never know. It's going to be, listen, we still have a lot of bangers here, right? So let's keep going. Gen 7. Uh, Swoopzilla, th Swoopzilla, thank you for the five. So I have to get drunk and donate to Vinny, but you're pretty cool too. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. That means a lot. Um, okay. God, what do we do here? Normal type? Uh, am I correct? Just, just type whatever you guys, Savali. Okay, down. Uh, okay. Yeah, just, just, just type them. And then if it looks like it's mixed, then we'll do a poll. I think that's probably the, that probably the best way to move forward. Okay. We got Litten. Incineroar, I literally refuse Incineroar. Marowak, I fuck with Marowak. Litten, Litten, Litten. Litten, Salazzle, Litten. Toracat, I'm seeing a lot of Littens. Marowak, oh shit, that's hard. Okay, okay, let's let's do, hang on, we'll do a pull with Salazzle. Marowak and Litten. That's tough. I, I, I mean, as long as it's not Incineroar, I'm fine. <laughs> I literally, I've been saying that, dude. Incineroar, I drives me crazy. I genuinely, I genuinely dislike Incineroar on a fundamental level. He just like, I, I think here's my problem. Oh, I'm not gonna get into it. Oh, I'm gonna get into it. Fuck it. Um, my problem with starters, Gen Seven is not too bad. It's bad with Incineroar, but it's especially bad in Gen Eight. Just. The fact that they're giving them jobs kills me. Like Incineroar is so, he's so goofy and weird and cringe. He's like a, he's just a man. He's just like a guy. You know what I mean? Like, and he acts like he's like a, just like a dude. Like he's just fucking around. He's like, yeah, but yeah. press the reaper, dude. Like, fuck you, dude. Like you're a Pokemon. Like. You're, it's supposed to be a creature, not like a guy. He's like, a, he's like, a, and then Gen 8 is so bad. I hate Gen 8. Holy shit. Anyways, okay. Sorry, tangent over. Um, Ash Greninja, Bruxish. 
Marowak wins. Oh, did I not put him in there? Oh, I was talking. Oh my God. That's crazy, bro. I was like so mad about Incineroar that it stuck in my brain. <laughs> I don't even think he was on the poll. Oh my God. Okay. What were we thinking? What were we thinking for water? Wimpod. That's crazy. Bruxish is crazy. You understand we have Ash Greninja, we have Tabu Fidi and Wishy Washy in the same league, and you're saying Wimpod? That's insane. You're saying Bruxish? Crazy. Galissapod's cool. Okay. Galissapod. I'm down. Grass. Uh, Decidueye, right? Or no, Rowlet. We go Rowlet for sure, right? Rowlet? Rowlet, yes. Rowlet, I think we go Rowlet. Rowlet, 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 yeah. Yeah, that, that just, I mean, that just makes sense, right? Okay. Um, Zerkatry? No, Zeraora. We go Zeraora, right? Alolan Raichu? Vikavolt? Vikavolt? I'm seeing a lot of Vikavolt, Alolan Raichu. Damn, really? Over Zeraora? Okay, well, we gotta pull this one. Um, that's crazy. I, I feel like Zara Aura clears right now. Uh, uh I mean, I, yeah, I, I get. I mean, Vikavolt's cool. Like, I like him, but he's like, I mean, he's not coming to my birthday party, right? Like, I'm not like going out of my way to invite him. I mean, I, I like Alolan Raichu, but like, I don't, I like regular Raichu better, <laughs> honestly. Yeah, Zara, yeah, Zara Aura clears. Okay, good, good, good. Cool. Very cool and rad. And sweet and cool and rad. I'm having a great time. Where's Coco? Oh, fuck! Oh, do we know Tapu Coco clears? Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't even see Tapu Coco. Okay, <laughs> well, too late now. Maybe we put him down for fairy. That's crazy. All right, what were you? <laughs> That's. <laughs> no, yeah, Tapu Coco should have been the obvious answer. Um, Alola Ninetales, right? I don't even, I, that one, that one can't be hard. We can't, there's no way we come to a disagreement on that one. Nine tails, nine tails. Okay, cool. Uh, fighting. Crab? You're kidding. That's like, that's like a joke. That's like a... Sand Slash? How are we divided on... Guys, this is an easy one. This is an easy one. <laughs> oh, no, wait, you're talking, you're talking about fighting. Okay, hang on. I thought you were still on ice. Okay. You gotta go Marshadow, right? There's way too many crabs. Marshadow. Marshadow? But there's a lot of buzzwolves. Jesus, really? What is I'm like, I can't even believe I thought I thought I had you guys nailed by now. I guess not. I was I was like, yeah, okay, Mar obviously Marshadow. Obviously. Buzzle is, okay, I like Buzzle, like he's fine, but like, come on. Marshadow is so fucking cool. Like, yeah, okay, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, like, yeah, he, just look at him. Bro, a ghostly shadow fighter, are you kidding me? Okay, Poison, uh, did we already, we haven't, yeah, we haven't done Slazzle, so we could do Slazzle. I feel like Naganadel though, right? Poipole, Poipole, Naganadel. Muck, Slazzle, Toxapex, Mu there's a lot of mucks, really? I feel like I'm, I feel like I ha I'm having like a fever dream right now. There's no way that many of y'all want muck. Nobody is, guys, Naganadel is right here. What is happening? There's just no way, okay. All right, muck. Naganadel, and I guess we'll put Salazzle in there. That I shocked. Alolan Muck is fucking fire. Yeah, I mean he's he's all right, but in the same tier as Naganadel. I mean, come on, dude. Male Salandit. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, I mean Toxapex is also like listen. As I said, guys, guys, it's. We're picking, I know we're like five hours in, but like 
we're picking the best of the best. Like any Pokemon that has a remote flaw is not welcome. Naganadel is the only Pokemon up here that is flawless. So I don't I don't understand how okay it's it's winning okay cool awesome cool yeah that's that thank you thank you I'm glad I'm just I feel like we should need to reiterate that right like we're not picking Pokemon that are good we're not picking Pokemon that are cool we're not picking Pokemon that are great we're not even picking Pokemon that are amazing we're picking Pokemon that that fuck you know what I mean anyways uh, Mudsdale Mudsdale's cool over Zygarde though we've already done hundred percent. Okay, there's a lot of Mudsdale. Okay, yeah, we'll do Mudsdale. Um, I, oh man, I go Minior here. We already did Rowlet. I go Minior here personally, but I love Minior. He's so cool. We've already done Zygarde. Well, no, we did we did 100%. We, it's 10% still open, but it doesn't matter because Mudsdale won. Two cannon? Minior purple. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of two cannons. I I don't know. I, I never really liked two cannon, but I guess. <laughs> now, okay, keep in mind when it comes to this, obviously, like the legendary slot is open, right? So, like, we probably shouldn't go Ultra Necrozma. Dawnwing's Necrozma. I've seen a lot of Necrozma. Ultra Necrozma, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, oh, that one, that one's tough. Okay, all right, let's do a pull, we'll do a pull, we'll do a pull. I feel like, listen, as long as we save Ultra Necrozma for Legendary, I think we're fine. So we'll do Dawnwings, Lunala, fucking, what do you, what do you guys want? Oh, well, I guess we'll do Solgaleo. Uh, you want me to add Bruxish? Okay. If Bruxish wins this, I it would be a crime. And I'll put Raichu on there. It would be a crime. An absolute sin. Disgrace to mankind. Probably against the Geneva Convention. Um, yeah, that would not be good. No. <laughs> what? What the fuck? That's not real. That's not, okay, thank you. I was gonna say, that's not, you can't. You can't, it's just, in, in, look at the league. Look at the roster. Look at the players. Bruxish is not even coming to the fucking game. He's not even showing up. Like, he's not even getting a ticket. Like, he's not in the spectator seat. He's not on the bench. He's outside in the parking lot doing drugs. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Okay, Dawn Wings, cool. I'm down for that. Um, okay, bug type. Uh, Rabombi. We are did we already do Glissapod? I think we already did Glissapod, right? Bruxish is based. No, it's not. It's just sad. It's just depressing. Araquinid, Vika Volt. I'm seeing a lot of Vicky Volt. We already did Glissapod, so no, none of that. I actually love Rabombi, but I think I think Vigavolt's pulling this out. Yeah, okay. All right, rock type. <laughs> you know, it's so funny. Someone suggested, I, I did a video um, drop today. It was like on bad bad ideas. I took your bad ideas and I bought it. Minior, we're going Minior? Lycanroc, ah. Lycanroc Dusk, I'm seeing a lot of Lycanroc Dusk. I love Minior, man. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of Dusk. Which one's Dusk? Is it this one? That's Midnight. That's Dusk, right? I actually feel like Midnight's cooler, but whatever. I actually feel like this is the worst one. Is this Dusk? I feel like it's actually the worst one. That's crazy. Yeah, no, I would have gone these two over. Anyways, um, but yeah, someone literally... I was making, like, mods of bad ideas, like custom Pokemon and all that. And someone literally suggested to make Lycanroc Dusk form. And I was like, brother, <laughs> like I'm, that that I, that exists. I I don't need to. You you do that, right? Like it's it's like in the game. Mimikyu, okay, yeah, that's easy. Love Mimikyu. Dragon. Now we already did Zygarde 100, percent um, and we're probably gonna do Ultra Necrozma for for the guy for Legendary. 
Executor? Oh, come on, nah, dude. No, we go, we, if we, we gotta go Poiple here, obviously. Oh no, we already went Naganadel, did we? Yeah, we already did, Never mind. Never mind. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of Kamoa. Okay, we'll do that. Now, Dark? We, Ash Greninja, right? We haven't done Ash Greninja yet. That's, that's on the table, that's valid. Guzzlord? Lots of Guzzlord. Holy fuck. Okay, let's just let's, let's do Ash Greninja. <laughs> that, that's safe. That's a safe bet, right? That's a safe bet. Steel? Um, oh, this is tough. I don't know. That's yeah, that's a tough one. That's a, that's a tough one. I feel like Hey, Plogan. What's up, Plogan? Thank you for being a member. Diglett? Cartana, Celesteela. All right, this this one, this one, there's too many. We're going to do a poll. Um I'll throw, I'll throw Diglett in there. I will throw Solgaleo, uh, Kartana, and Stack Attacka? Sure, okay. Honestly, yeah, I don't know. That, this one's, this one's hard. This one's hard. I feel like, I feel like, okay, Diglett, now that I'm looking at it, Diglett definitely does not win. <laughs> like, absolutely not. Out of these? Out of these? No, 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 no. Sogaleo, okay, yeah, Sogaleo is, is valid. I think, I think, I think Cartana is also valid. Oh, it's okay. It's a long, yeah, clear winner. Cool, Sogaleo. Uh, guy, okay, we gotta go Tabu Coco, right? Tabu Coco. We already did Mimikyu. We have, we we didn't put him. We have to do Tabu Coco. Tabu Coco is literally one of the best Gen Seven Mons. We can't not put him in. I like listen, I, and I like uh, Primarina. I like Rabombi. Yeah, I mean, we got some bangers here, but Tapu Coco just fucks heavy. Um, okay, starter. Now, we already did Rowlet. Oh, man. Who do we even... Okay, I'm going to make a poll. I think we... Well, we put, we put Decidueye, right? Decidueye. We put Primarina. Uh, oof. We put... I, yeah, I think Decidueye just, just wins this, right? I'll put Poplio on there. And did we already do Litten? I can't remember. I'll put Litten on there. I don't know, Chief. That one, yeah, I think it's just Decidueye. The whole the whole Rowlet line is just goaded. Same with same with the Primarina line. I really like the Poplio line. It's just Incineroar that I absolutely despise. <laughs> uh, actually, yeah, no, Tor Torcat's cool. I like Torcat. Torcat and Litten are pretty cool. Alright, Decidueye, we are in. Well, I was going to say we're in the final stretch, but goddamn, we are not. <laughs> I can't believe. I can't believe how long. Wait, how long have we been live? Literally almost four hours. I can't believe how long this is taking us. Okay. Um, uh, what is this? What is this? Gimmick form? Do you guys want muck? I know you guys have been pining for muck. Well, alternate Cro we're gonna, we got to save alternate Crozen for the legendary. Melmetal. Okay. A actually, yeah. Actually, yeah. No, you're valid for that. And then, okay, obviously Ultra Necrozma, right? No debate. We've literally been saving it the whole time. Does anybody have a complaint on that? <laughs> like, we literally, the entire Generation 7, we've been building to that moment, right? Like, there's no, nobody, it's say no now or forever hold your peace or whatever. Okay. All right. Who are we picking? Muck? No, it's too late. It's too late. We we've been we've been doing that. All right, who are we picking out of these? No complaint. Okay. No muck, guys. <laughs> you guys voted no metal. Okay. All right. All right. No metal or muck for 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 the gimmick form. This is it. This is it. This is your final chance. It's either the the big ass no metal or it's muck. I understand the we got so many muck fans. I just don't even get it. Wow, it's actually okay. All right, we'll put muck. All right, do you guys want muck to win? I'm assuming with that much enthusiasm, right? Muck should just be the winner entirely, right? Okay, cool. <laughs> okay, rigged. Yes. No. Okay, <laughs> this is so hard. It's like trying to orchestrate, like, an entire assembly of first graders, like. It, 
Yes. Okay. All right. I'm locking it in. I'm locking it in. I'm locking it in. We can't. I've done enough thinking today. All right. Gen 8. Yikes. God, this is going to be brutal. <laughs> oh, my God. Greedent? Really? Greedent? Really? No. Come on. Be fucking for real. Ursaluna? No, Ursaluna fucks. Actually, wait, is Zorwark here? Oh my god, we go Zorwark. For sure. I didn't even know he was on there. Yeah, that's, that's like not even close. Okay, fire. Um... Arcanine? Arcanine. Senescorch? Typhlosion? Okay, okay, okay. All right, I'll make a poll. Typhlosion, Arcanine, Senescorch. Yay! I don't know. I, I'm kind of impartial, to be honest. I actually, I do like the Hisuian Typhlosion. Way better than regular Typhlosion. Thank you, Jello. Did you dare lock it in, get muck off that spot right now. Jello, I, I don't know what to tell you, man. It's, it's too late, you know? Um... Once once a Pokemon is locked in, it's locked in. And that's just kind of how it is. Um, Typhlosion. Okay, I'm actually down with that. Um, I would I would ask for Lapras again, but it's not going to win. So, like, what's the point, right? Um, Pokia Horse. I actually, maybe. I feel like Urshifu, actually. I don't know. This is kind of a tough one. Muck. Muck is not here. I, like, I don't know. Maybe there's like a little bit of miscommunication or I, I don't, okay, hang on. G-Max, Urshifu, let's, let's do this the right way. Choodle, I really fuck with Choodle. Thank you, Flamesad. Muck sweep. Okay, you see, now here's the problem, right? You guys love Shuckle. You love Muck, but now they're gonna be competing when we do the favorite. So like, what are you guys gonna do, you know? Cramorant. I'm not gonna lie, these water type ones are brutal. I feel like Basque Legion should be in the running, right? Am I crazy for saying that? Th this is, yeah, no, this is a weird one. This is a super, I feel like I, I would probably go Basque Legion or Arascuta, actually. I feel like, God, I don't know, this is, Cramorant, really? Muck. I don't think Muck is here. What You guys just like, you guys have like a very, um, you pick one thing and you just like, like this is my thing now. Like you just, you pick a thing and you just like, this is it. This is my life now. It's like, it's, it's an obsession. It's honestly concerning. Tobin just said, come in the chat. I just thought we were more mature than that. I don't know. I thought you guys were like above that in a weird way. I guess I was wrong. Man, it sure suck if you guys prove me wrong, right? <laughs> sure suck. What's up, Tobin? Uh, all right, we're going G-Max Urshifu. Cool. Grass type. Oh, God. I think Lilligant. Yeah, Lilligant, right? Or, or Hisuian Decidueye. Now, Tobin, oh, Tobin, well, you know I can't do that without your help, obviously. Apple, Flapple, Applin, Grookey, absolutely not. I, I'm telling you guys right now, Rillaboom and Thwacky, like, they're not getting on this list. I literally, I literally refuse. I actively, angrily, it seems like Appleton is actually winning. I missed you, I missed you too, Tobin. All right, we'll throw Appleton in there. That's fine with me. Yeah, lots of apples. All right, down. I feel like, okay, Electrotype, we gotta go, oh shit, Reggie Lucky, right? The wacky sweep, yeah, no. Absolutely not. I would sooner retire. Pull Grookey right now, no. Toxic, toxic, tree. I'm gonna be honest, I never really liked him. I would much rather have Reggie Lucky, but it, you know, if that's what you guys want, hey, you know, w once again, it's not my list, right? It's not my list. Come on, Snom? Snom, 
Snom, right? Snom. I don't even think we have to debate that, right? Snom. Well, or Frostmoth, but like Snom, right? Snom. Okay, cool. Fighting. Ah, I don't know about this one. Lapras, yeah, I, well, yeah, I do like his G-Max form, but I don't know. I, I'm just, I, listen, I got regular Lapras in there. That's all I care about. Surf Edge, Zapdos, Lilligant. Okay, this one's kind of tough. This one, yeah, this one definitely needs a pull. Um, let's put Lilligant in there. Let's put Zapdos. Sneasler? Yikes, but okay. And Surfetched. Okay, I actually don't like Surfetched. I'll say it. I don't know if that's a bull. I, I don't like a lot of Gen 8 Pokemon, to be honest. Gen, Gen 8, literally it's like, okay, Gen 2 is like my least favorite set of Pokemon. And then Gen 8 is like right behind it. I just, I don't know. I don't, I don't vibe with them. I don't vibe with them. You just don't like Gen 8. I don't. Which is, it's weird because Gen 8 is the game that I play the most. <laughs> Which is kind of depressing, right? But it's just, you know, it's, I, I like it for the mods. Zapdos. Okay. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good pick. All right. Um, now we could do Eternatus here, but you know, we're probably going to want to save Eternatus for the legendary. Perhaps. Perhaps. You don't like Gen 2? I don't like the decks. We 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 talk we 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 went in we went into it with extreme detail earlier, but it is just no guys. We're not doing Garbodor. I literally I actively refuse. Okay, didn't. <sighs> Why do you guys like G Max Garbodor? Like what the fuck? Like it's such a random ass, stupid ass, dumb ass. It's like the most random, shitty, garbage, actually garbage Pokemon I've ever seen in my life. It's like honestly depressing. Um, I'll I'll put. Uh, who else do I put on here? I'll put Eternit even over Eternamax Eternatus. And I guess who else do we put on here? Sneed. I'll put Sneedler, I guess. And then Overquill. I, I don't know. Okay, yeah. I, pick, pick between those. Skip, Muck, and Snom already won. Hey, listen, it ain't over till it's over. I mean, you guys are really liking that garbage thing. I it literally, like, it's just crazy that, like, you can have such bad taste that you think garbage is cool. And, like, I like Garbodor. I like, Garbodor's cool. I, you know what? I'm with you. Garbodor's cool. But G-Max Garbodor? Especially with all the other options, like, bro, we got fucking Venusaur, we had fucking Gengar, and you're going with, you're going with that. That's just, it's just crazy. It's just crazy to me. I don't know. Maybe I'm weird for that, but it's just kind of, kind of absurd. Um, Ursaloon, or, er, ooh, I'd, I'd go Runarigus. I love Runarigus. Big Runarigus fan. Big Runarigus fan. Ursaluna, Ursaluna, yeah, okay. We'll, we'll go Ursaluna, but I, I, Runarigus Fox. I would do Runarigus personally. Anyways, um, all right, flying. Hmm. Uh, so we already did Zapdos. I feel like you do, you do Moltres here, right? You, de you gotta do Moltres. Braviary, Cramorant, Articuno, okay. All right, we'll do, we'll do the poll. Man, you guys are so torn all the time. Why can't we, why can't we just all have the same idea all the time? You know, or why, why can't, that defeats the point. I'll throw Charizard in there for lols. I, I feel like, well, this chair is broken. I can't believe I keep accidentally falling off it. Give us Cramorant. I'm pretty sure you already did Cramorant, right? No. Well, it, I don't know. Cramorad's dumb, so no. <laughs> so that, that's my, that's my presidential, president, that's my veto. I'm going to veto Cramorad. It's my, it's my veto. Anyways, Corviknight, that's, that's honestly surprising. I mean, Corviknight's cool, but like, come on, man. Moltres was right there. Um, all right. Articuno, maybe? 
No shot you beat a cram rat. Why do you guys like cram rat? What, like, what, what's so special about him? I, I feel like he's mid. I feel like he's pretty mid. He's very forgettable, too. Ponyta. He swallows things. Yeah, I mean, I listen, I like swallowing just as much as the next guy, but, like, that doesn't mean I'm fucking with him, you know? Mr. Mime. No, we are not doing Mr. Mime. <laughs> we are not doing Mr. Mime. What is with this obsession with Mr. Mime? And, and the, the Galarian one is even worse. I'll say it. The Galarian one is even... Okay, we'll make a poll. We'll make a poll. I... Just, I don't, I don't know. You know, I really thought this was going to be like a representation of, um, of the community. You know, I, I really thought it was going to be like, this is what we stand for. And like, this is what we believe in. But, you know, the more we're going into this, the more I'm realizing that we, we just, we just pick Pokemon that is funny. We pick Pokemon that is, haha. Um, and you know what, actually... That, that is kind of the vibe. Oh, but Articuno's winning. Holy shit. Holy shit, Articuno pulls this out? Could you imagine, how funny would it be if like, just somehow, right, Articuno ends up being the favorite Pokemon? <laughs> like if we, if we, if he wins this and then he wins the favorite of Gen 7, we, we could just make, we could just make Galarian Articuno, like it'd be random as fuck. But it'd be, it'd be cool. I'm just, just saying, hey, think about it, guys. I'm just saying. It'd be cooler than Mr. Mime. It'd be cooler than Shuckle. I'm just saying. Just something, something, to, something, to, something to think about. Something to suckle on, you know? Um, okay, we already did we already do Snom? We already did Snom, right? Cleavor? Okay. Okay. We got a lot of... Uh, we got a couple of Scorches. And I have a Cleavor. Cleavor. Okay. Yeah, I'm down. All right. Rock types. Well, actually, wait. Why don't we do... Let, let's meet in the middle. Let's meet in the middle. Let's do... Scorch, And we'll do Cleavor for... Yeah. Or no, but they want Arcanine. You guys want... Okay. Sorry. Okay, fine. Okay, we'll do Arcanine. <laughs> cool. That's good. We all happy with that? There's literally no possible way everybody will be happy with that, but we're going we're gonna to lock it in. Anyways, uh, Ghost. Can we do Ritorigus, please? We already did Zoroark. I mean, I know Dragapult is like... I think Ritorigus would be so hype. Ah, there's... Ah, Dragapult. Yeah. Ah, okay, we'll do Dragapult. We'll do Dragapult. I'm pretty sure he plays in the Dragon Division, but... It's fine. Actually, no, nah, the, the, the Dragon Division's packed. Holy shit, they got an entire, they got an entire varsity team out here. That's insane. Um, okay, I'm assuming we're gonna do Eternatus for Legendary, right? So maybe we should do Palkia? Dialga, Palkia, hmm. Hmm, Gudra. Okay, I don't know, I'm gonna, let me, let me put it to a poll. I think yeah, this one this one requires some more some more mitigation. I think <sighs> gotta you know consult the jury and all that. Palkia, Dialga, um, Gudra, and then Dracovish. I don't. I gotta be honest. Dracovish is like eh. Then then again, I all of Gen Eight is eh. I me personally, I'm going. I think I'm going Gudra here. I think I'm going Gudra. Dracofish is just kind of eh. I don't know. It's like, it's like, Dracofish, it just, I like, okay, I like, here's what I'll say. I like the concept of all of the fo of the fossils, where they're like fusion fossils. I think that's interesting. I think it's a cool, unique concept. But I think the downside of that is that all of them look like ass. <laughs> and like, not good. <laughs> but I, I like the creativity. I like the creativity, but I don't like how they look like ass. Anyways, uh, all right, this one might be hard. Moltres? Moltres, right? I mean, I don't know, it's tough. It's tough, but Moltres. 
More Peko? Are you for real? That has to be a prank, right? Urshifu? Okay, wait, hang on. That You guys are like pranking me, right? More Peko? Really? Come on, dude. That's insane. That's that's a that's a that's a that's a crazy person to answer. That's like that's like something like hypothetically, if like like a crazy person were to speak. No shot, dude. What what about more Peko? Seriously? We got Grimmsnarl. We got Thievel. <laughs> okay, that was a joke. We got Grimmsnarl. We got fucking Urshifu. Even Lanoon, even Lanoon and, and Obstagoon and, Zig and Zarud, like literally all of them I think are better than Morpeko. That's insane. Yeah, we got fucking Samurott, Moltres. Okay, at least Moltres is winning now. That's insane. I Like what, he's hungry. I No, I get that. Everybody is, I'm hungry right now. I could go for a fucking, God, I can go for a flatbread right now. Oh my God. I would tear up a flatbread, just forget about it. Oh yeah, Samurott, Samurott's raw. All right, all right, we, we got Moltres though. That, that's good. That's an acceptable pick. I'm down for that. I literally, I, I did not expect this to take, well, I don't know why I didn't expect this to take long. I probably should have saw this coming, honestly. All right, Steel type. Um, So we already did Gudra. I think we, I don't know, Zacian? <clears throat> do we do Zacian? I think we just do Zacian, right? Zacian. Zacian, yeah, we just use Zacian. We already did, especially we already did Corviknight. Like, yeah, we just use Zacian. All right, uh, this is Fairy type. Zacian, yeah, I think we do Zacian. <laughs> Duraludon, no, no. <laughs> just gonna, just gonna give a hard no on that one. Rapidash, Zacian, yeah, I think we do Zacian personally. I mean, it was a hard choice, but I think we, I think we do do Zacian on that one. Um, starter. Okay. Oh, the, uh, the Hisuian starters are in this. Um. So we, wait, what starters haven't we done? I think we haven't done any of them. Wow, there's, oh no, we did Typhlosion. Okay, yeah, they're so shit. Okay, um. I've seen a lot of Decidueye. Let's, we'll put this one to a poll. I think, honestly, I think Samurott is a contender. I think Decidueye, or no, did we already do Decidueye? The wacky? No. I... I would be so upset. Okay, I'll put Samurai. I'll put the wacky just because it's funny. But like like as a haha, -ha, like a joke joke response. I'll put the Sidueye there. And I'll put Score Bunny. Score Bunny's, I like Score Bunny. Score Bunny's cool. The rest, the rest of them are miserably terrible, but that's fine. Yeah, I, I think me personally, I think I'm going... I think I'm going Decidueye. No, no, guy, no, no, say it. Go, say it with your chest. Say it with your chest. If you guys want the wacky so bad, see what happens. <laughs> see what happens. Oh my God. No, yeah, Decidueye is the obvious pick. Like, bro, like, why did they name it Thwacky? Why was that the name? That's so upsetting. Oh, wow, Samurai. Wait, whoa, this is close. Oh, this is extremely close. Samurai is just barely edging it out. Okay. All right. Now yeah, I'm down. I'm, I'm totally okay with that. Um, holy shit. Uh, I'm just going to pick this one. <laughs> wait, can I do Runarigus? No, wait, what is this? Gimmick forms? Oh. Um. Braviary? Okay. I, I, yeah, this one is, okay, let's do Braviary. That's fine. Braviary is cool. All right, and best legendary. Uh, I feel like you go Eternatus here, right? No, I don't know. I don't, I don't like any. Well, I, I honestly though, honestly, okay. I think you go Reggie Lecky personally. Zacian, ah, uh, you know, I I didn't I didn't consider Zacian. Yeah, maybe we should go Zacian. Yeah, 
You know, I wasn't thinking about that. You know, when we did Zacian here, and then we also did Zacian here, I forgot that we could also do it like there was like another, yeah. What the fuck is even this Zacian? What is this? Wait, I'm so confused. Because this is the, the the super form. This is the dead form. Yeah, wait, what is that? What, does anybody know what that is? I'm actually so confused. Because it's a different... It's different. It doesn't have the... Behemoth Blade cutscene Zacian. Oh! <laughs> wait, that's insane. The fact that those three are separate is insane. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, of course. Yeah, we couldn't couldn't do this without Zacian. Now, obviously, when we're thinking about the best Pokemon from this, I mean, there's really only one possible choice, right? Um, I mean, I think you guys, you guys, you know, can put the word in my mouth. We all know what it is. Really, there's no reason to even deliberate it. Um, we are going to lock in Zacian. Uh... <laughs> Okay, there's actually a lot of snoms. Let's just, okay, let's just do this. Let's keep it simple, right? Zacian, snom, and then for some reason, your weird garbage obsession, okay? Let's just, we'll keep that, keep it simple, right? Keep it simple. I, I feel like nothing, nothing else from Gen 8 has really made an impact, so. Uh, we'll just, we'll just stick with what is acceptable. It's looking like snom, okay. Honestly, that is, that's probably, that's probably the best choice, I'd say. I'm all, I'm all right with that. I'm cool with that. All right, now on to... Wow, this is it. This is it, chat. The final gen. Gen 9, baby. Here it is. I feel like... Oh, man, I don't know, dude. I don't know. I feel like a lot of Gen 9, gen 9 mons I'm kind of lukewarm about, to be honest. So we'll, we'll see. I, I mean, I, I like them better than Gen 8. I will say that. But in general, I'm kind of lukewarm. Um, okay, Cyclozar, right? Obviously. Right? Uh, right, right? I mean, that that just that just makes sense. Right? I mean, the only other Pokemon that comes close is like the Olive one. Lechonk? No, dude, no. Come on. Be fucking for real. Be fucking for real. Really? Really? LeChonk? Really? What? Am I, like, am I crazy? Am I crazy? I thought that was so obvious. LeChonk. All right, fine. That's insane. I'm telling you guys, that's a crazy pick. I would, yeah, no, I would do, I would do the Dunsparce. I would do him before I do LeChonk. Lechonk is cringe, bro. What do you, do you know the evolves into this? Ugh. Anyways, um, all right, fire type. I feel like, oh, that's tough. This one's tough. Oh, actually, no, it's not tough. It's actually not tough. We go, um, we go Cerule Edge, right? I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It's a pretty, it's a pretty packed category. Like Armor Rouge is sick. Chiu is sick. Iron Moth is sick, Skeletor's just sick, but yeah, you you go, I mean, it's just, it's one of those where, like, it's in such a stacked league, but it's so clearly above the rest that you just have to go for it. Yes, I think, I think Cerule Edge is actually, it's my second favorite Gen 9 Mon. Anyways, all right, Water, um, I think we... Walk, walking, am I crazy? Walking, oh no, you guys are gonna want Wiglet. God damn it. I already know, I already know. Like, we don't even have to do the rest of it. You don't even have to bother putting in the chat. I know what you guys want. Actually, why no, actually, hang on, hang on. No, 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 walking wake, maybe. I really thought y'all were just gonna be Wiglet fans. Okay, hang on, it ain't over. Let's see, walking wake. Let's, let's analyze this, let's get official about this. I'll throw Wug Trio in the mix. Actually, no, we'll, we'll Wiglet's better, we'll put Wiglet. Wiglet, and then uh, I'll throw Dodonzo in there, and and for lols, I'll throw Iron Bundle. Iron Bumble. Okay, all right, yeah, yeah. Put this one to a poll. I actually didn't expect this one to be as close, but yeah. I probably, I'd say Walking Wake. Yeah. Yeah, okay, it's not close. I don't know why I thought it was close. 
Walking Wake for sure. It's just so cool, man. It's probably it's probably one of the coolest um, coolest paradox form. The fuck you mean Iron Bundle? He's right there. <laughs> that's that's him right there. He's he's having a good day. I think I don't know. I mean I don't know his personal life. Um, okay, God, this is hard. I immediately right off the bat I'm saying I'm saying you know what I'm just gonna give you guys three options. I don't I don't even it. it and I'm, I'm not going to lie, this is biased. This is biased, but I'm going to give you guys three options, which I believe is objectively the best three options. Okay, I'm not even going to I'm not even going to look at influence. Like I'm just going to give you my top 3 and you guys pick from these. It's very simple. Um, I actually don't even know one of one of his names. What's <laughs> What's the what's the snail guy? <laughs> what's the snail guy? I love him, but I, I forgot his name. He, he's in the poll for sure. No, Ting, no, Ting Lu's the the the, the, the moose guy. Wo Chien, Wo Chien, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because I, I love I love the meme where it's like, I know <laughs> I, I, I know I was dogging on you guys for doing the meme thing, but the meme where they're like live Wo Chien reaction is actually so funny. Um anyways, those are your three choices. You got Ogre Pond, Miascarada, and Wo Chien. Th those are objectively the best three. Um Yeah. I, I would probably go, I'd probably go Ogre Pawn. I, I would go Ogre Pawn or Miascarada, personally. I think, honestly, Miascarada is probably my favorite starter in a long time. Like, it's, it's, it's like actually crazy how much I, I love that starter line. Toad School should be up there. I, listen, I like Toad School, but he's not, he's not in the playoffs, right? He's not in the regional championships. All right, yeah, uh, Ogre Pond, that's, that's a valid choice. I love Ogre Pond. He's actually so sick. Anyways, um, Maridon? No, well, we, we might save Maridon, right, for Legendary? Hmm. Raging Volt? Yeah, maybe. Sandy Shocks? Hmm. Oh, damn, you guys are so mixed. Really? Okay, all right, all right. All right, I'll do the poll. I'll do the poll. <laughs> uh, I'll put Palmot in there. Kilowattrel, I actually don't really like him, but I'll, I'll put him in there. I feel like, I don't know, yeah, I feel like Maridon is, well, it just depends, right? Are we saving him or not? I think Maridon is is the clear winner here. If If we're not saving him, right? Maridon is so fucking cool. It's insane. Where is Sandy Shocks? I mean, I like Sandy Shocks, but... <laughs> I mean, I, I would do Sandy Shocks over Kilowattrel, but... I don't know. I, I, I was seeing some Kilowattrel energy in the chat, so I figured we'd reciprocate. Wow, it looks like Raikou's winning. That's crazy. Okay. I'm okay with that. That's all right. Um, all right, cool. What do we got now? Ice? Uh, okay, this has to be just Chim Piao. Chim, Chim Pao, right? Right? Chim Pao. Yeah, okay, cool. Satoddle? That's that's based. <laughs> that's actually a based pick. I like that. Iron Bundle? No, it's, it's Chim Pao. It's Chim Pao. All right, what do we got here? Poison? Oh, no. Fighting? Oh, man, dude. I don't know. I think you, I think you go Iron Valiant. Moth? Ah, uh, Slitherwing? No. <laughs> Save Coridon. Yeah, it, it depends on what you guys want for legendary, right? Annihilate is cool. Uh, this one, this one's tough. Okay, let's make a poll. Annihilate. Um, I'm not gonna. Yeah, you know, I'm not gonna put Coridon because I feel like that's gonna be the legendary, right? I don't know. Iron Valiant, Slitherwing. And I'll put, I'll put Great Dusk. I'll put, yeah, Great Dusk in there. I know for sure Okie Dogie ain't getting anywhere close to winning. That's for sure. Bro, could you imagine being the person that fills out this entire thing and then ends up with Okie Dogie as their favorite Pokemon? <laughs> How fucking embarrassing. Oh my God. That would, that would be so upsetting. Okay, Annihilate. I'm, I'm down for that. 
Wow, another chance at Okie Dogie. It's gotta be, wait, okay, we gotta do Claude Zire, right? Right, right, right. I don't even think we have to, oh wait, I wasn't showing you guys. Right, 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 we don't even have to think about this. <laughs> Ro has not spelt a single Mon right entire stream. <laughs> Claude, Claude, right? Yeah, no, Claude Zire, dude, he's so fucking cool. Love Claude Zire. Honestly, fuck it. <laughs> fuck it, right? Fuck it, we, we know what's right. We know what's right. All right, what are we doing for, <laughs> what are we doing for, what is this, Psychic? Yeah, we double up, we double up. We know what's right. We know the laws of the land. Pooper, no, it's okay, he's, he's roped in. It's like they're a bundle package. Kilowatt troll? Come on, we can't do kilowatt troll. <laughs> Flamigo? Okay, we'll do Flamigo. I'm down for that. What is this? Oh no, this is psychic. I'm getting them mixed up. Call me crazy? Bam. Call me crazy. If if anyone can provide one decent argument as to why not, I'll I'll switch it. You're crazy. No, no, no. Hear me out. Revival blessing. No, Furigraph exists. Furigraph, Armorouge. Nope. Nope. Rab, Rabs, what's his name? <laughs> Rabs, Rabska? <laughs> Dude, he's so rad. He's so cool. All right, no, yeah, you guys, you guys are saying I'm based? We're keeping it. We're keeping it. You know what? Fuck it. He's on a winning streak right now, okay? He, that's No, that's just him using Revival Blessing. Okay, next up. <laughs> Based. <laughs> All right, guys, what do you think of a rock? I, ah. Uh... Cloth. Cloth or Garganackle? I've seen a lot of Garganackle. This is a democracy. Yeah, it's a democracy. Don't, don't worry, I'm, I'm keeping, listen, you guys are, you guys are influencing the election, for sure. For sure. There's, there's some influence here. Anyways, uh, we already did Cerule Edge. I guess we do... <laughs> Goldango Chest Form. <laughs> Fluttermane? I'm kind of down for Fluttermane. Bramblin. Honestly, no, that's based. I actually fuck heavy with Bramblin. Or no, Bramblegast. Yeah, no, you know what? That's, that is, that is the definition of based. Bramblegast is so hype, man. I know he sucks, but he's so cool. He's so cool, man. He's got that ability that makes him like immune to wind moves and it boosts his speed. That's so tight. All right, Roaring Moon. This one's tough. I think Ro Roaring Moon. Yeah. Archlodon. Uh, he's not even out yet. Yeah, Roaring Moon. Roaring Moon, right? Yeah, okay. All right. We got a second chance at doing Meow Scarada. Diplin. Ah. All right, all right, fine. We'll do a pull. We'll do a pull. We'll do a pull. Diplin. I just feel like, like you're not gonna let Roaring Moon not go drafted, right? If we don't, if we don't do Roaring Moon for this, then we got to do it for Dark. Mabosta, all right, all right, chill with the spam, chill with the spam. I feel like no Dark. I feel like we gotta go. <sighs> okay, yeah, Roaring Moon wins easy. Um. Okay, Low Kicks was my favorite. I'm blocking it. Low Kicks was my favorite Gen 9 Pokemon before uh, before like Ogre Pond. So that, that's personally what I would go for, but I'm seeing a lot of Chi Yu love. This, it's a, this is a tough one, right? I mean, no matter which way you look at it, King Gambit's cool. You're, you're, wor you're working with, yeah. And we already did Shin Pao, right? Yeah, okay. I think we do Chi Yu. That makes sense. Um, all right, Tinkaton? Well, we could also do Tinkaton for Fairy. What's Fairy? What do we got for Fairy? Or we do Iron Valiant for Fairy. King Gambit, King Gambit. Okay, yeah, let's do, I like that. King Gambit and then Tinkaton, right? Are we in agreement? 
That's good. That's good. Liking that. Cool. Yeah, I think I think that that makes sense. Yes. Okay. Awesome. Starter. Um. Okay. So we already did. Who have we already done? Nobody. I. I man. I. I. I think we go Meowscarada. I'll put the pull up. I think Meowscarada is the best man. Um. I'll put Skella Dirge. I'll put Mr. Dirge on there. Um. I'll put Quaxley, I guess. And I'll put Foycoco on there. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, me personally, Meowscarada wins this 10 out of 10 times. The only Pokemon that don't win this is... Man, it kind of sucks. I'm realizing, like, I I picked the worst starter when I played through uh, Scarlet and Violet the first time. I picked Quaxley. And I, I like Quaxley, but his evolutions... I mean, they're okay. They're okay. But it's just, like, compared to Mr. Dirge over here... And compare, like, this this line, the Meowscarada line is perfect. The Skeletor's line is, like, an 8 out of 10. 9 out of 10. And the Quaxley line is, like, a 6 or 7 out of 10. And, of course, I picked the duck. <laughs> um, okay, Meowscarada wins. I'm, dude, I'm so down. Meowscarada is probably, probably my favorite starter in a long time. Um, okay, and then we got gimmicky forms. I guess we could, oh, we could put Pooper here. Oh, look at that. Yeah, we just put Pooper there, right? And then we got Pooper and Claude. Cool. All right, Legendary. Um, Toad School. No, guys, come on. Be fucking for real. Be fucking for real. We go Pooper there, please. Please, come on. Now, best Legendary. Oh. I think Coridon, right? Monkey Dory, that would be, that is a criminal pick. A pick like that should get you locked up. <laughs> Monkey Dory. Either, Mon well, we already did Ogre Pond. So yeah, I, I think, I think that makes the most sense. Okay, now we got to pick a favorite out of these. Crydon, yeah, it's, it's Crydon. It's just Crydon. Now for this, oh man, okay, this one, this, with this one, we, we definitely got to make a poll here. Now keep in mind, this is deciding what our favorite Gen 9 Pokemon is. I mean, I personally feel like it's pretty obvious, right? I mean, we've been talking about him. We've been joking about him. We've been loving him, hating him, farming him. I don't know what that means. Um, we've just been enjoying his presence and I think we should definitely embrace that. Um, <laughs> Coridon again. Okay, I'll put him on the poll. <laughs> We just double up on the Coridon. No, 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 no. Come on, guys. This, there's one right answer here, and you guys know what the answer is. I'm not going to say it. I don't have to. Um, it is, it is, it is, uh, well, actually, Ogre Pond maybe should have been on this list. But, like, if we're talking from a community standpoint, yeah, this, Claude Zire is the best choice. Claude Zire is absolutely the best choice, I think. I mean, he, dude, he was, he was so good. He was so unbelievably good. He was the one that broke the dupes rule. Th that, is, that is an unprecedented achievement. He literally made history. So I think we got to respect that. Um, yeah, and it's like not even close. Awesome. We'll go ahead and lock Claude Zire in. I, uh, I am not mad about that. So, okay, now, now we're on the final stretch, right? Um... So now though, that's okay. So I'm pretty sure now we have to pick. Now we pick our favorite normal type. Yeah, our favorite. Oh, it's gonna be a bitch. Fair fire type, and then and then pretty much. So we pick all of our favorite types, and then it goes down, and then we pick our favorite Pokemon, right? So okay, starting here, favorite normal type. What are you guys thinking? Oh man, there's there's two joke normal types. Whoa, which one are you guys gonna go for? Bidoof, 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 Bidoof. Okay. All right. No, I get it. I get it. I would not have been... I'm going Zoroark every day of the week here, but it's all right. Fire type. What are we thinking? I... Ooh, fuck. I'm thinking Volcarona. I'm thinking Volcarona. Is my vote? Damn, we have a very interesting... Oh, this is going to be close. Volcarona, Quilava. That's based. Quilava winning best fire type is actually insane. Infernape, Infernape. Okay, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's make a pull. Let's make a pull. Chill, chill. 
Calm your horses. Um, I'll put Infernape on there. Arcanine. Yep. And then we'll put... I'll put Kulava just because that's so based. Honestly, Kulava making it all the way to be the best fire type is actually amazing. I, I think Volcarona, though, right? It's just the pick. Um, wow. <laughs> oh, no. Come on. Don't give it to Infernape. No. If you're going to do it, if you're going to do it, just give it to Kulava. Come on. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> Don't, if you're either, you either got to go Volcarona or you got to go Kulava. That is so funny. I'm so unbelievably down for that. It's just so unbelievable. <laughs> like, that, that is the most based pick you could have possibly picked. That's amazing. I'm so down for that. All right, best water type. I I feel like it's Wooper. Or Mud... Ah, it might be Mudkip. Ah, it might be Greninja. I don't know, dude. That one's tough. Oshawott. We got a couple Oshawott boats. Okay. I, I'm gonna I feel like I'm gonna, you know what? I'm already seeing it. I'm gonna have to make a, a poll for all of these. There is no way we come to a consensus on this. <laughs> oh my god. It's like literally because now we're at we are literally at like peak polarizing, right? Like this is this is like this is it. This is the finale, right? We gotta we gotta really be smart about this. All right, Mudkip, Mudkip's chilling. I honestly, I mean, listen, we're at the point now where like all of these choices are so good um, that it's just it's anyone's game, right? It's literally, I mean, you, I'm sure the results are really close. Oh, never mind. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> it Mudkip it is. That's good idea, guys. Um, I, man, I don't know about these. Rowlet? Rowlet, maybe? Rowlet or Ferrothorn? No. Rowlet or Ogre Pond? I don't know. That This one, we'll put the Torterra. I, I probably wouldn't go Torterra, but I see it. All right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Ch -ch -ch -chill, ch -ch -chill, ch -chill. I'll put Venusaur in there just because he's a legacy character. And I'll put Ogre Pond. I feel like Ferrothorn would, uh, I, I don't know. I didn't put Ferrothorn in there, but I feel like that would have best represented us. Like if we're going for like a representing the community type beat, I feel like Ferrothorn should have been on there. I mean, you guys know, big, big Ferrothorn fan. I've been fucking with him since day one. Rowlet, okay. All right, wow, Ogre Pond's in second. That's nuts. All right, I'm all right with that. I'm cool with that. All right, onto Electric. Um... What would be the top four? I mean, oh, well, Magnemite, obviously, right? We got to bring Magnemite back. <laughs> so, Magnemite. <laughs> um, I want to say Ampharos, but you guys apparently hate Ampharos. I'll put, I'll put Wash in there. Um, hmm. I'm not, I'm not going to put Raikou because he's not even out yet. I'll put Zara Aura, and then I'll put reg regular Ampharos. Because you guys hate the Mega, apparently. Okay. Yeah, we'll see how that plays out. Um, I, I feel like Magnemite just wins that. This actually probably would have... Yeah, this is like the easiest one. <laughs> it's just Magnemite. It's just the GOAT, man. Wow. No, it's close. Holy shit, no, it's close. Guys, what happened? We are so... We are so... We are so excited about Magnemite. What happened? Wait, now I'm kind of disappointed. We were so... Everybody was hyping up Magnemite. We were like the biggest Magnemite fans. What happened? Zara Aura? I mean, yeah, but Magnemite, bro. I thought... What, Zara Aura like barely got into this bracket. Do you guys remember like... Like he almost didn't even make it. Why is he even in contention right now? That's crazy. Wait, Magnemite. Closing the pool. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, nice, dude. Yeah, nice. Very decisive win for Magnemite there. You really, you know, it's not often you see... Not often you see decisive wins like that one. <laughs> Thank God we're on the Chiefs. Anyways, um, can we just go Lapras? Can we just go... I mean, he's literally... He's on, wrong arm again. He's literally on my arm. I'm just gonna... You know, executive decision, I'm gonna say Lapras. Exa I, I'm gonna say it, right? Listen, at the end of the day, I have the mouse. So, like, I'm gonna make that decision, but... You know, I, I respect the other calls. I do. But I just will not be respecting them. Um, all right. 
What are we what are we thinking for fighting? I think Lucario is probably in that bracket, right? I'm thinking Lucario's in there. Uh Marshadow definitely is. Mm. Heracross? Yeah. Yeah, Heracross. It's a legacy character. And our last one, uh, we'll, we'll throw a bone to the Gen 6 fans. Him with the Hawlucha. See how we're feeling about that. Um, I feel like, I don't know, I think Lucar, uh, yeah, I think Lucario takes that, honestly. As I said, all of these are hard, right? Like, they're all, they're all difficult. All of them are great. Um, wow, no, it's close. It's shockingly close. I mean, listen, I, I love Marshadow. I do. Ah, I don't know. It, it, it's tough. It's tough. I think Lucario, Lucario just has that, like, he's got that, that senior citizen discount, right? <laughs> he's got that, uh, I don't know. He just got that demerit, man. I don't know. Yeah, we'll give it to him. He's just, a, he's a, as I said, legacy character. Um, all right, so obviously we're going Claude Zire here, and then we're also going Claude Zire here as well. No, okay, hang on. I'll, I'll give it a fair shake. I'll give it a fair shake. I, I'm thinking of, I, no, you know what? I'm thinking about it. We'll give it a fair shake. Who do you guys want in the poison? Is it gonna, fucking Garbodor. I already know you guys want Garbodor and I'm so upset about it. Muck, you want Muck? I'll give you Muck. That's fine. And uh, I'm gonna put Claude Sire in there because I feel like he should win. And I will throw Crobat in there as well. Okay. Ah, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I think I think po like poison is easy, right? Poison we just go claw dire. That's yeah, honestly that like it, ground is harder when I'm when I'm looking at it. Yeah. We go claw dire. Ground ground is harder. Um I actually think Flygon takes this. Call me crazy, I think I think Flygon. I as I said, we'll put it to the poll, but really think Flygon clears this. Gliscor could be close as well. Um, and I'll put, uh, who else do you guys want? I got, I got Claude Zyre in there as well. I'll put Ursaluna. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think Fly, you gotta go Flygon, right? I mean, it's, I don't know, Gliscor's putting up a fight. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, 40%. It's looking, oh no, it's so close. <laughs> it's so close. <laughs> Oh my God, it literally could not be closer. That's crazy. I, once again, it goes back to my my outlook on legacy characters. I think you go legacy. I think you go Flygon. Flygon just feels right, man. There's something about it. It's just, he's, as I said, he's he's literally, I mean, Gliscor is also really good, right? But it's like, Flygon is peak Pokemon design. Like you, you, it does not get much better than Flygon. It really doesn't. So we'll go ahead. We'll, we'll we'll lock that in. Yeah, I think I think that just makes sense. As, but then again, I mean, as I said, all of these are close, right? Frank, you're influencing the voters. I trust me. I've been doing that the whole time. <laughs> That's like kind of my shtick, you know. That's kind of what I do. Um, wow, we got some. Uh, what did we? What happened? What happened with the flying type picks? Why do I feel like these are so mid? I feel like we could have done so much better. Am I crazy? Okay, well, we'll put the Lugia in there. I'm putting Staraptor in there. I'm also putting Charizard in there because I have to. Um, and then the fourth option, we'll go ahead. We're going to put... Uh, I'll put Archeops. I'll put Archeops. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, uh, this one's tough. I, I mean, I feel like you go Charizard. I feel like you go Charizard, but... I, you know what it is? I think a lot of the, you know, the newer generation, I think they just don't fuck with Charizard. I'll say it. I don't know if that's a bold statement, but I, I just don't think they fuck with it like we used to, you know? It's a shame. Also, I'm surprised Shadow Lugia is, like, listen, I've never played XD, so, like, I don't know what Shadow Lugia is, really. But, I mean, it looks cool, but it's like... Like, what? <laughs> is it really that cool? Like... I don't know. That, that's surprising to me. And like, it literally wasn't even close, which that that's shocking. Corviknight robbed. Yeah, potentially. Um, okay, so obviously this one, you know, we, we got uh, Rabska, of course, is one of the options, a classic. 
Um, yeah, we'll throw Mew in there, I guess. Oh, we got we have to put unknown. Yeah, for sure. We'll put unknown in there. Love unknown. And then for our last one, let's put uh let's put Metagross. I I would personally go unknown here or Rabska personally, but you know, as I said, not my list. <clears throat> Seems like Metagross might take it home. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's you know, I, I don't agree with it on a fundamental level, but, you know. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. Damn, I, I you know what I will say? I'm very, I'm very, I still can't believe we put Ghost, wait, <laughs> does that count? Are we going to be able to say Ghost Shuckle could win the, I guess so, right? Um, all right. Please don't spam Sundeep. Um, okay, can we, okay, guys, can we do Rabska for this one? I just think that'd be funny. I just think that'd be funny. Okay, hang on, I'll, I'll make the pull, I'll make the pull. Is that even its name? I literally don't even know if that's what it's called. It's just something along those lines. I mean, ah, it's God, I mean, I don't know. If we're, if we're taking this seriously, right, like, if we're actually looking at this, probably... Probably Scizor. Probably, yeah. Well, I'd probably go Yan Mega. I think Yan Mega would win in my book, but. Yeah, I mean Scizor. Yeah, right. This list is full of the most basic tates imaginable and just straight lunacy. <laughs> yeah, it's like. It's like some of the picks are like Metagross, Salamence, Charizard, and then we have fucking Ghost Shuckle, Zacian three times, Rabska. <laughs> And like, I, I don't know, Gar G Max Garbodor for some reason is like a big. People are really liking G Max Garbodor for some unholy reason. Oh my god. Okay, all right. What are we thinking about this one? What are we thinking? What are we thinking? Oh wait, no. This is. I already. I don't even have to do the poll. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You guys win. Do you guys? Do you guys want Ghost type Shuckle as well, or just regular Shuckle? I personally feel like Garatina should maybe take this, but I also think Ghost Type Shuckle maybe is in the running. Ghost Shuckle, okay, all right. Yeah, you know, listen, I'm here to please. All right, so Shuckle won best Rock Type and also best Ghost Type, <laughs> which is insane. Um, what are you guys thinking Dragon-wise? Oh God, this is gonna be, this is gonna be heated. Fuck, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing with the Dragon. Okay, we gotta put Salamence in there, right? Uh, oh man. Kamoo. I actually don't like Kamoo. I'll say it. Not a big fan. Garchomp, of course. And we'll, we'll throw Gumi in there. All right. Uh, I mean, you guys are probably going to vote. If I had to guess, you guys are probably going to vote Gumi. Yep, there it is. You guys are probably going to vote Gumi. I feel like Garchomp probably deserves to win. But yeah, it's Gumi. It's, it's just, it's like not even close. Yeah. Oh no, it is close. It is close. Holy shit. Okay, wait. Hang on. No, it ain't over till it's over. Let's not let's not jump to conclusions here. Yeah, Garchomp should for sure. For sure. Yeah, I, I don't know what it is about Kamo. -Oh. I just never liked it. I don't know. It just kind of oh, 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 oh there it is. There it is. And the pull and the pull and the pull and the pull. <coughs> oh yeah, Kamo is so mid. <laughs> All right, cool. Garchomp. Happy about that. That it's Ty? No, no, no. Garchomp was in the lead. Ty? No, no, no. The the one the one above is in the lead. That's how that's how the polls work. I mean, they're both 33%, but Garchomp must have been 33.6% or something. And then it wasn't a tie. I promise you it wasn't a tie. That would be insane. Anyways, all right, what are we thinking about dark types? I I forgot we put missing no in here. Oh, actually, I should probably move out of the way. I, I okay, God, this is hard. Me personally, I think I go missing no? We really go, is this really what we're doing? I feel like we go dark rye. We either go dark rye or Zoroark. Wow, it is overwhelmingly missing no. Okay, <laughs> sure. 
Who said it? Why is it even a dark type? Who said that? It's not. Who said it was dark type? Anyways, um, steel. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Magneton would be either. We gotta go Zacian or Magneton. Those are the only good picks. <laughs> Zacian or Magneton. Uh, okay, hang on. I'll just, let's just put a poll. Let's just put a poll. I mean, really, guys, it's, there's only two options. It's just, Zacian or Magneton, that's all that, that's all that we need, right? One of the two. I mean, no, no other Pokemon is even remotely competing. I mean, let's just be honest, right? <laughs> okay, yeah, Magneton, dude, so down. I'm, you know, I'm really glad, I feel like, we, oh, it's close. Holy shit, oh my god, okay. Wow, are, we're getting more Zacian. That's crazy. That's, it's close. No, it's so close. Oh my God. I'm on the edge of my seat right now. Um, Yeah, no, I, I really appreciate it. We've been giving a lot of love to like the lesser known Pokemon, you know? Well, okay, some of the time. It, it's so, it, it is so polarizing. We're, we're either picking Charizard or we're picking fucking Magneton. And it's like, it's kind of based. I like it. Let's go Magneton. I'm down with that. Okay. Um, fairy type. I, I mean, I feel like Zacian is the obvious pick. <laughs> Zay, I mean, we, you could always use more Zacian, right? You could always use more Zacian. All right, we'll put, we'll put it to the poll. Um, and you know what? Just for kicks, I'll throw, no, never mind. I lied. I'll put Tinkaton in there, yeah, and then we'll put, I mean, you can't, you can't talk fairy types without Sylveon, right? Uh, and then Whimsicott, I'll put Whimsicott in there. All right, one of those. Honestly, it's really anyone's game. I feel like, I just feel like we don't have enough Zacian on this list, you know? Like, we only have three, and I mean, especially his mid, <laughs> yeah, you also gotta keep in mind, like, this Zacian is not normal Zacian. This is... Mid Behemoth Bash, Zacian. This is Zac. This isn't Crown Form Zacian. This isn't regular Zacian. This is Zacian who's like mid fucking fight. Like he's like he's getting it. He's, uh, you know, he's high on on. Um, he's like you know he's going for it, and I just think that's impressive. I don't know, bro. I'm so tired. <laughs> so. I, I just can't believe we've been doing this for five hours. I feel like I got hit by a train. Sylveon. Okay, cool. Down for Sylveon. I'm also losing my voice too. I feel like I feel like by tomorrow I'm gonna be just fucked. Um. Okay. Now we're looking. Oh, this is best starter. Oh, wow. We didn't pick a single fire type starter. That's crazy. Wow. Okay. Best starter out of these. Who are we thinking? Man, I don't even know. It's a tough one. Okay, I think, yeah, we'll Swampert, right? Uh, I'm seeing, we'll put Piplup on there. Um, we'll put War Turtle. I think that's valid. And we will put... I've seen a lot of do... Oh, we'll put Meow... Let's put a Grass type. Let's put Meow Scrot on there. Okay, I think out of those... Oh, man. I think out of those, I'm going Swampert. Either Swampert or War Turtle. But, but I mean, honestly, it's... I mean, I don't know. They're, they're all amazing, right? They're all phenomenal. Yeah. Wow, but it's not even close. <laughs> That's crazy. That's, I mean, we, we love all of them, but clearly we have a favorite. Damn. Okay. Best gimmick form. It, okay. It's gotta be. Okay. It's gotta be Pooper, right? <laughs> it's gotta be fucking Pooper. Do we even have to. We ain't gotta talk about it, right? Like, I don't even have to waste my time with a poll. Yeah, it's Poober. We're, we're shitting up a storm. Muck, no, come on. Come on, pick, pick the, okay, I know you guys are laughing your ass about, about, about Muck, right? It's like, okay, no, come on. Pooper is the better joke, right? All right, fine, I'll, I'll put it, I'll put it to the poll. It's, you know, it's getting to the point to where all these you know, all these bits are just so good. It's just, you can't even keep them straight anymore, right? 
Wow, I can't believe Muck is, no, wow, okay, it's close. I feel like Pooper is a clear win. I, I don't know why y'all are so hyped up on Muck. I actually don't, I actually don't get it. Like, I like Muck, I like, he's cool, he's all right, and I, you know, haha, it spells come if you smell it backwards, but like, but like, come on, like, Pooper, it just writes itself, man. Okay, there we go, that's what I thought, that's what I thought. All right, now this is gonna be tough, best legendary. Damn, I actually can't believe this is what we narrowed it down to. I feel like there's better. Wait, why is Rayquaza not here? Why is Garatina not here? What the fuck? How did we end up with this? Like, seriously. Both of my favorite legendaries are not here. <laughs> That's actually a crime. They were in other categories. Oh, yeah, I guess. And they didn't win those categories, which is crazy. Okay, um... All right, I'll put Zygarde on there. Uh, I will put Lugia on there. We'll put Arceus, because I, like I feel like obliged to. And I need one more. We're going to put Mewtwo. We're going to put Mewtwo. It's a classic, man. We can't not put Mewtwo, right? That's like, that's like, that's like, that's like trying to make a sandwich without bread. Come on. Let's, let's be honest with ourselves. So this pretty much determines what our favorite legendary is. I feel like Mew... Yeah... Uh, yeah, no, you gotta go Mewtwo. You gotta go Mewtwo, bro. Either Mewtwo or Arceus. You don't, you don't go Zygarde here. You don't go, I mean, listen, all these are great. You don't go Lugia. You don't go Zygarde. You go Mewtwo or Arceus. I mean, that's, that's just what it is, right? I like, listen, as I said, I like them all. I like them all, but yeah, you just, you go Mewtwo. It's that simple. That's cool. All right. Wow, this is it. Holy shit, wait, this is actually it. Um, this is our favorite Pokemon. Well, we're, we're gonna figure out what our favorite Pokemon is. These are the options. This is the, the best of the best. Like nothing is better than this. This is the, we've narrowed it down, cream of the crop. These are the best, which by the way, this lineup is crazy. I'm looking at it. If I were to go through and actually choose my top, like, I don't know, 20 ferret Pokemon. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, Lapras is on there. And Flygon is maybe on there. And Greninja, maybe. And Garatina. But, like, this is a weird-ass fucking list. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to make a poll. We can only choose four um, <laughs> to actually pick from. And whatever you guys pick will be the absolute number one favorite Pokemon of the community. Uncontested. Um, and it'll, it'll be the new mascot for the channel, pretty much. So I'm gonna put Lapras on there because you know what, whether you guys like it or not, that that's my dude, that's my fucking guy. So we're putting him on there. Um, you guys obviously want Shuckle, which I feel like might just win, <laughs> to be honest, which is insane. The fact that Shuckle has even gotten this far, honestly. Um, okay, let's put, who, who else, Who's, who else? Um, Okay, we gotta put Kulava, right? Kulava fucks. We gotta put Kulava on there. Honestly, I'm shocked he even made it this far. And then our last one, I think we should do like an actual serious one. Like an actual like good one. Like, like something we could really fuck with, right? Like, like Garatina. Let's put Garatina on there. I'm feeling it. Or should we put Magnemite? No. Actually, no, we've been, ah, Magnemite's too funny. Okay, let's do Magnemite. All right, literally, <laughs> here's your options. My actual favorite Pokemon, a joke, a based joke, and then another joke. I actually don't like Shuckle. The fact that it's gotten this far is insane. I don't know if it's like out of spite or just like blatant disrespect. Like you guys know, like this is gonna be like my Lapras, let's go. Come on, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. That'd be insane, that'd be insane. This is gonna be my banner. I'm gonna put this, this is gonna be like the YouTube banner. Like. If, if Lapras, that would make me so happy. He's on, he's, wrong arm again. He's on my arm. How cool is that? Wow, I actually can't believe you guys are giving this to me. I, I really thought it was going to be Shuckle. I really, really thought, I, I did not think you guys were actually going to get, I thought no shot. Like, I put him on there because I was like, you know, principal, but I did not think you guys would actually do that. That's crazy. Well, thank you. That's, 
actually really sweet of you guys. I, I genuinely thought it was just gonna be like a fucking chuckle and I was gonna be upset about it, but no, that's like, that's like a very clear win. I appreciate it. That's very sweet of you guys. Chuckle in second, Magnemite in last. I hate to see it. Well, with that being said, um, Lapras is our favorite Pokemon. <laughs> Completely unbiased, by the way, right? Like definitely, definitely not just because he's my favorite. Um, appreciate it. Yeah, thank you all so much for watching. This has been a fun stream. I can't believe we've been live for like five hours. It's actually insane. Do the top four as the banner? That would actually be sick. Honestly, okay, maybe, yeah, maybe I'll do that. I'll, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess around in Photoshop. We'll come up with something cool. It'll be cool. Maybe we'll do like the four of them and then we'll have like the actual grid in the background. Something like that. Um, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, that's really about it. I wanted to have like more of like a, <laughs> like a statement at the end of this, but I just appreciate you guys being here. Thank you. Hit that sub button. Hit that like button. Thank you for all the support. Thank you for all the members. Thank you all for the super chats and all that. I really appreciate it. Um, I'll talk to you guys later. We'll be live next week. It'll be a good time. Bye. By the way, oh, here's the full, I should probably show the list. Here's the full, <laughs> the full thing. I can't believe I just forgot to show it off. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. We made some good decisions today. I, I'm pretty happy with this. I think we did good. Anyways, all right. Bye, guys. Have a good one. I'll talk to you later. Bye.